Hi guys, this is the full supercut of Barry Bixon's quest to survive 100 days as a nomad biker with nothing but his trusty tent and bike to keep him safe. But first, I am aiming for 10,000 subscribers by Christmas, so if you did enjoy the series and my content, please do consider subscribing to the channel if you want already to help us get there, or even drop a like as that really helps as well. Now, a quick word from today's sponsor. Are you looking to set up a Project Envoy server for you and your friends, but not sure where to start? Well, with today's sponsor, Indifferent Broccoli, all you need to do is click the link in the description or pinned in the comments and select how many players you want. There is no confusing options and they offer a wide range of benefits, including an easy to use control panel to make it as simple as possible to get started. It really hasn't been easy with these guys. It won't break the bank either as they offer very competitive prices and also offer a two day free trial to test out first with no credit card details required. So why not give it a go with the link below? Thank you Indifferent Broccoli for sponsoring this video, now let's get on with it. Okay guys, we are back with a brand new series, the Biker Nomad. We have the mod for this to start. We're also looking a bit, bit Daryl-esque. We're playing as Barry Bixon. Now I'll run over the traits quickly because we have taken Veteran Vehicle Nomad, which gives us all of these lovely skills to be the Nomad. We're very overweight and losing health, but that's fine. So the traits we've had to take some, well, yeah, some bad ones. So we've got Thin Skin, Slow Healer, Fear of Blood, Claustrophobic. So we're not allowed to sleep indoors. We are not. Well, I suppose we can sleep in. No, we can't. We've got to stay in the tent. We've got to stay in the tent. Pacifist, prone to illness, smoker, weak stomach, clumsy, short sighted, slow reader. Vehicle, nomad, outdoor camping gear. So we start with a tent and everything. As you can see here, we better put this in our in our uh, bike here to save us losing the bloody health. Um, we also got the vehicle nomad tools, so that's the wrench and everything. We'll actually pop that on our belt. And we start with a 28 superior, so that's fine. It's a nice looking bike. We got cat size, dexterous, outdoorsman, lucky, fast learner, keen hearing, fit, and weight. So all the usual stuff. But we did have to take quite a few bad ones. I mean, fear of blood is not ideal. I was always going to take claustrophobic for this run anyway. Gas can, let's fill our bike up. It's going to be a good one. 100 days. 100 days of sleeping rough. It's going to be interesting. It's going to be interesting. It's fun. I wanted to do a, no a Nomad run for a while. Uh, we'll actually put the axe in there because we probably won't use that. We have got a starter kit as well. Wait, have we got two saws? Oh, no. No, that's fine. Yeah, we started with a starter kit because I think we're going to need all the help we can get. So I don't actually know where we are. Now, I've gone a little bit different this time as well. We don't know the map. we got a mini map, but we don't know the map. So I've, I guess we're like, oh, I don't know, actually. What? Muldra here, maybe? I don't know. But I suppose first things first, we got to uh, we got to find somewhere to pitch up our tent, haven't we? Actually, let's have a look. What are how what condition our vehicles in? Um, so it's okay. It's not in the best condition, but we do have mechanics free, so that's not a problem. It's the engine that's going to be a problem. But we only need mechanics four, so I think books. We're going to need books, aren't we? So yeah, I don't actually know where we are. Settings for this, we've gone a little bit different. Standard zombie settings. We started in March, which is a bit different. So it's going to still be cold. The set to 10 months later on the apocalypse set. And the helicopter is coming sometimes. So we're going to need a little radio or a Walkman or something to know. And we also have become desensitized, but the setting is... 2000 to 5000 so i suppose we better go we better go and head off and try and find ourselves some food i mean worst case we could forage we need somewhere to tent it we need to know what the closest town is i suppose well we found ourselves a farm so let's deal with these bastards see if we can get some food um, yeah, I will leave a little bit at the end of this video just to show you my settings. I believe, I could be wrong, but I've set the zombies to normal except for, I think, their sight or their memory. Maybe one lower. Oh, okay, well, what a, what a start. We may be able to get some food. Oh, and the loot is set to insanely rare. We will take the holster and also the pistol because we do have advanced trajectory on again. Let's actually test out the crossbow. Let's have a let's give it a little test run, shall we? Oh, we'll take a pen as well because we need to mark where our camp is. Now with the crossbow mod, we are using Kitsons, I believe it's called. We are able to collect the bolts back, but we do only have five, so. You can craft more, but you need the recipe for it, which we do not start with knowing. So just to give it a little bit of balance there. Bolt's broken. Can you repair it? No. Okay, well, I didn't know they actually broke. Um, but that's fine. That's fine. Again, balances it a little bit for us, doesn't it? And then there's a lot down here, so it probably wasn't even worth coming in here. 
We'll try and get some ripped sheets for bandages if we need them. God, I hate, uh, I hate claustrophobic. That beer will take, good for calories. I'm gonna actually take the pot as well, because then we can boil water if we find a river. Okay, let's go and have a look down here. Let's kill a couple of zombies. Let's also check this mailbox as well, because we don't know how to use a generator. Let's go check this car, there might be a bottle in there. Don't actually know where we are. Not exactly, anyway. Oh, there's a house here, we'll check. Oh, lighter, yes please. There is a lot of zombies around. Do we take the turtleneck just because the polo? Because it might get a little bit cold. Let's take it. We might need it. We might not. Okay, so we found a radio with the emergency broadcast. So we're, we're going to grab that quick. There is a zombie in here though. And we're bloody claustrophobic. So this is not good. Crowbar. Yep, yeah, we'll have that. Ah, and do we wear a fedora? I think we do. I think we do. All right, let's have a look upstairs. Shotgun shells. Okay, we'll take them. All right, let's get out of here. It's getting late. We're going to have to find somewhere to, uh, to camp up, I think. We've got a few bits and bobs as well, so that's good. Can we get anything from this barn, actually, while we're here? Shovel. Hmm, probably not going to be worth anything. Oh, we got cigarettes. Yes, okay. Okay, so we need somewhere to camp up for the, for the first 10-ish days. Where is going to be safe? It all looks a bit busy around here. You know what, I'm thinking maybe we just go up here. Maybe we go here. Let's let's give this a go. Could be a really bad idea, but we'll soon find out. Okay, let's set up tent here. We'll see how we get on. Let's actually mark the emergency broadcast down. Turn the bloody volume down. Because, what is it, 90... Point two. Oh, wrong button. We're going to have to put it there. <laughs> 90. Oh, no, that's wrong anyway. It's 90. Oh, God. That's fine. That's fine. Right. Uh, let's pause it. Let's actually put a picture of a tent here because this will be our temporary base. Let's go this. There we go. We got a picture of a tent there. So, yeah, this is this is where we are. <laughs> We're going to need books. Books are what we need. Why have we got sneakers on us? I don't actually know. Let's have a smoke so we don't get stressed out. Temperature's not too bad. I think we do put this on though because it is going to get cold. There we go. Bit of protection as well. Oh, we do, yeah, we do have the crowbar as well, don't we? That's good. That's going to be big actually. Okay, so I think we'll do a little bit of foraging for the rest of the day. Because we do have, what, two levels in foraging? Yeah. Oh, no, actually, let's give it a shout and see if there's any zombies around that we need to clear out. There's one down here. Let's go deal with these. <laughs> Okay, we're all starting a little bit hungry, so let's eat some chips. Let's get them in us. Let's summon at least. But yeah, there we go. First night. Oh, out in the sticks. Look at it. It's good. It's good. I like it. I like it. I think we should be okay for zombies. We're going to actually leave, not bring our car, uh, sorry, our motorbike onto the rough grass because it'll wreck our tires. How is the uh, condition of it again? I think it's okay condition. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad, but we're going to get a bed. Hopefully we survive the night and tomorrow we're going to explore a little bit around and see if we can find some in and stuff like that. So we'll, uh, we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day two. We have survived. We have survived the first night and we got fog. So I think the plan today is we're going to go on foot just up here and along here just to scope out the area a little bit. We're not going to take the bike because fuel is, well, the fuel is low. Let's pop that in our bag, the crossbow, and let's put the crowbar on our back. And we could probably leave the saw at home, I think. We'll walk through the forest just to make sure there's no zombies around. Oh, we got water there. Oh, maybe, maybe we come up here. Maybe we base up here. Okay, well, at least we know where there's some fresh water. So we've been walking all day around here. Not found much, but it looks like we could be in for a farm here. I have been doing a little bit of foraging as we go. We have got stones, which could be used to make axes and spears. So it's not been a complete waste of time. Oh, okay, okay. We found some warehouses. This is good. This is good. Well, not useful at all because there's nothing in there. Okay, we got some houses and what looks like a shed. A couple of cars there as well. They might have some cigarettes in them, hopefully. Gas tank. Do we need that? I don't know. Let's take it. <laughs> check these cars for anything. M1911. Probably don't need that. We will read this map though. Louisville. I don't think we'll be going there, but we'll read it anyway. Okay, what food we got down here? Pepper. I mean, we'll take it. It's going to... Oh, and a kitchen knife. Yep, that could come in handy. Cleaning liquid as well to clean our cells. Actually, should we do that now quick? Oh, yeah, bit of food there. We'll take that. Okay, there's another house there. I'm going to mark this off as we go. There 
we go. Let's let's do this house and head around. I'm just worried because we are overweight. Dog food. Well, you gotta, you gotta do what you gotta do in a zombie apocalypse. I don't look like there's anything else around here. Let's mark this off. There are some houses there, but we'll I we'll think we'll uh, we'll head back to our tent today. We will forage along the way as well. Oh, we've run into zombies. That's not good. Let's try and give them the old slipperoo. Don't really want to fight them. Oh, Jesus. We're very out of breath as well. We're tired. We're carrying this bloody stuff on us. Let's get to the main road. I mean, we do have the gun, worst case, but I don't really want to use it. Okay, we should be safe on the road here. Okay. Well, we're back at back at the uh, back at the campsite. Let's drop that. We need to rest on the floor. Jeez. Okay, we're better. We're in a better place. I mean, we're not in a good place, but we're uh, we're, we're better than we were a minute ago. Okay. What can we make with these stones? Then what can we make? Stone hammer. We don't really need. Let's chip them into chipped stone, and then I suppose we'll make. Ah, we'll keep them in. We'll keep them in in the pack here, just in case we need to make an axe or. A spear. Oh, actually, a spear for fishing. Yes, that's what we need to do. That's that's what we need to do. Let's make a spear. One. We got a fishing spear. Okay. Now, what actually is this? Is it the S10 whatever Majiga? What is the name of this vehicle? I know I said it earlier, but I can't bloody remember. My memory is awful. Oh, the SS100. Uh, fuel tank's actually in 78, but what's this one? This one's 100, so we may as well, if we can, replace that. There's still fuel in there. Okay, so we'll wait till it runs out of fuel, and then we will actually replace that. That's fine. That's fine. I feel very exposed out here. Very exposed, but that is what it is, you know. We ain't gonna worry about a helicopter yet. It's day five. It could come. All right, we're very hungry, and we are underweight. So fish would be a good, a good shout, wouldn't it? Mate, yeah. Maybe, maybe we drive up there and get a bit of fish. I think that's what we're gonna do, you know, tomorrow. But it is half past ten. We're gonna get a bed tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow we're gonna do a bit of fishing. We'll see you then. Okay, day three. We've survived another night. It is very very foggy i think what we're gonna do yeah we're gonna go up to the river we're gonna fish for the day hopefully get ourselves some nice old kipper and then also wash ourselves up there as well let's try and put this fire down okay that's fine that's fine that's good that's good so a smoke because we are a little bit stressed and feeling a little bit sad let's uh let's get up there let's go get some fish we'll take the bike and then we'll leave it on the road oh lord we got snow as well Wow. Driving a motorbike in the snow with no helmet probably isn't the best idea. Oh, so it looks like we got, what, we got a container there, we got a container behind, and we got a container there. Okay, so we got quite a bit of storage then, more than I thought. But do I want to be washing myself when it's this cold? Yeah, because we'll warm ourselves up by the fire. It's fine. It's fine. Can't see anything, though. Okay, so, so far, we've cut ourselves a medium bass and a small catfish. We're going to wash ourselves now because we are getting a bit depressed from it all. Okay, so we're nice and clean, and let's have a smoke as well to take the edge off. Okay, it's 20 past 6. We are starving to death. We have caught a fair old bit, and we're going to have to go and eat something out of our uh, out of our motorbike, I think. But at least we got a load of fish we can cook up and hopefully gain ourselves some weight. What can we eat here? Yeah, eat, eat a quarter of the brown sugar. There we go. That stopped us from starving to death anyway. Okay, we'll leave the car here. Actually, actually, we're going to need something to start the old fire, aren't we? Let's take the branches so we can find more branches that's not a problem we'll also take the axe as well maybe worth keeping the axe on us because we haven't got any firewood all right base camp let's chop this tree down it's still look okay for zombies which is nice oh we could do with a knife though to cut the fish up we had quite a good haul actually when it comes to fish look at it oh this is gonna do us for a fair old few days this all right we got our knife we dropped off the axe Let's go, let's go cook ourselves some fish. Let's go get ourselves a crappy. Okay, we got ourselves some filet. Look at that, there we go. She is roaring. Let's take the little bait fish as well. We may as well chuck that on there. Ah, oh, there we go, there we go. It's all cooked. Look at this, lovely 12 fish fillets. Get them in you, get them in you, Barry. Okay, so we have actually got one Chevy rise. Oh, 69 weight, nice, nice. But hopefully we can uh, keep that pushing up. So we got food, we got food, which is good. Probably gonna need more. Nice having level two in fishing already. But it is 22 at 12, so we're gonna get a bed. Tomorrow, tomorrow we might get down to these, these other houses here. Here. Just I think I kind of know where we are now as well. Riverside's up here. Muldra's down here. Could go to Valley Station possibly. Yeah, tomorrow we go look at them houses. I, I think that's what we're going to do. 
All right, let's go to bed anyway. We'll figure it out tomorrow. Okay, day four. Had we better listen to the radio? I see this last fillet as well. Get that in ya, boy. Ah, oh, look at this calories. 3,000. We're good, we're good. Mm, no, we'll listen to the radio when we get back. We'll probably walk down there, I think. Save the fuel. Let's do it. Let's give it a shout. Let's draw any zombies that are around to us. Jesus Christ, that made me jump. Ah, leave him in there. We got a couple of Zeds. We're going to take care of him because we may get beta blockers or cigarettes off of them. And it's increasing our levels as well, which is good. I put in some glasses on as that will help with foraging as we are short sighted, I believe. So, I mean, it's not really a good look, but. Oh, there goes the baseball bat. That's fine because we have a crowbar. Oh, and a crash helmet as well. You know what? We're going to wear it. To hell with it. Oh, that does look pretty cool, though, doesn't it? Jeez. Okay, so nothing really in here. One can of mushroom soup. We uh, could really do with getting a new bag, actually. Okay, so I think we'll we'll keep going down this road just to scope it out a little bit, see what we can see. Maybe we find a zombie with a backpack. I don't know. The day's still young. Okay, we got a house down here. Let's go and investigate this. We may as well have foraging on. That's what I'm thinking, so... Oh, yes, because we could find uh, a butter knife. We really need some books. Maybe maybe we get a wet cron, actually. That's not a bad shout. Maybe we head down Ekron when the helicopter's coming. Although, as we found out in the Horde video, Ekron is fairly busy for some reason. Empty bottle we'll take and have that for water. Okay, I think we carry on down this road just a little bit. Not a l not too much further. Oh, we got a McCoy's login. We could get some nice goodies in here. <laughs> Gloves, but they are trash, so we don't really want them. Oh, we got some nice leather gloves, though. We'll wear them. Take, uh, now we won't need another hammer. We'll take the bandage, though. No fuel in this. That's fine. Oh, first aid kit, though, but I don't think, yeah, nothing in there. Okay. Okay. Okay, so it's about 20 past two. I think we're going to start getting tired fairly soon, so we'll head back. Been pretty successful. We got ourselves some gloves, a bit of food. Yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy. I mean, foraging is getting there. We're nearly at half a level up, which is good. We, once we got the book, we'll be flying through. Oh, we got a policeman. Oh, he's got a pouch or something on him. We'll have that. Oh, a long blunt up a level. Nice. Okay. Yeah, we'll take the bulletproof vest. What does that replace, though? Ah, the leather jacket. Barrel dog's leather jacket. That's a shame, but safety first. You know how often... A vest has saved me. <laughs> Let's wear this ammo pouch. There we go. We're, we're, we're looking good. We're looking good. We will keep the barrel dog's vest, though. Wouldn't mind... Oh, yes. Scissors. We need scissors. Yes. Yes. Yeah, I wouldn't mind some more smokes, to be honest. Okay, we've made it back. Are we going to catch the last little bit of the emergency broadcast? Okay, so we have. Is it going to be air activity? Doesn't look like there's any air activity tomorrow. That is good. So tomorrow, I think we'll go and do a little bit of fishing. And I think we can probably put the crossbow in in the vehicle. Uh, yeah, because we got the pistol if, we need, if things get a bit tasty. It's kind of like a backup. I don't know how much we're going to actually use the crossbow. But all right, but it's half past 12. We're going to go to bed. Hopefully we'll be safe. I think this area is fairly safe now. But yeah, we're going to go to bed tomorrow. More fishing. Okay, so day five. We've woken up 20 to 10. Let's go. Yeah, let's go get some fish because we're very, very. We may just spend the rest of the uh, few days around here fishing, you know, because we need to get our weight up. We're on 69, I think. Thing, which is nice sometimes but uh, when it comes to the weight it's not so nice now the plan is every time the helicopter comes because it's set to come sometimes so every time it comes i think we'll have to move camp so we'll stay here till the first helicopter and then hopefully try and get somewhere around ekron because we need books and i think we can duck in and out of the bookstore there all right let's wash ourselves off first and then let's have a smoke so we don't get so bloody stressed okay it's 20 to 9 we've caught a fair old bit we got some big perch big crappy big catfish big sunfish we got a lot of fish so this this should do us a couple of days i think we can we can fill our bellies with this haul okay we're back at base let's have a little smoke let's prepare all of this fish okay lovely stuff let's pop it in the fire and let's light this bastard 
Add fuel. Yeah, we found some shoes as well while I was fishing. Let's put them on there. I didn't know you could use shoes. That's pretty good. Oh, let's turn this on, see if we get the helicopter tomorrow. Okay, so blackout. Yeah, so the power and the electric is off anyway. I set that to instantly off because we are 10 months into the apocalypse. Clear skies. That's nice. That's nice. Tomorrow, clear skies. Nice. Light fog. Not so nice. Okay, doesn't look like the helicopter's here tomorrow, so that's fine. Because what we'll do is the day it's coming, well, the day before, we'll know... And then we can pack up first thing in the morning and get the hell out of Dodge. Okay, so we got 14 bits of fillet, which are all lovely. Let's just make sure none of them are burnt. No. It's eat like kings. Let's pop these on the floor here. They'll be they'll be fine just on the floor. Okay, but it is 10 past 12. We're gonna go to bed tomorrow. Tomorrow we continue fishing, I think. We'll see you then. Okay, day six. We survived another night. Looks like our knife is about to break, so we will we'll have to craft more. Let's just get all this. Don't know why we haven't got two Chevys. Let's go and do some more fishing and maybe make a knife as well. Okay, make a stone knife. That's good. There we go. Look at that. All right, let's get fishing. Oh, and there goes the other spear. Okay, well, that'll do us for today, I think. We got... What do we got? We got quite a few bits. A lot of small fish, but it's better than nothing. Let's get some more food in us. Yeah, the good thing about Ekron as well is that there is the lake down... There is, well, Phallus Lake down there. God, look at this one. 43 hunger out here. That does us. And they, this mod is very cool. All mods are linked in the description, as always, of course. So do check it out. It's very good. I did try the Nomad there, the RV one, didn't I? Maybe about a year ago. But I thought I'd give the bike on a go because it'd be pretty cool to sleep rough i thought we are very low on smokes so we only got seven smokes left right let's fill it all this fish and we got some socks as well to hell with it we'll add them i think yeah let's just cook yeah let's cook this up ah oh, lovely look at this out in nature i love it i love it okay so we got a lot of fish don't have a lot of water we better fill up haven't we Gonna have to keep an eye on that pot of water. Be nice to have a water dispenser. <laughs> Maybe we put one in the bag, in the bike if we find one. Let's see if we got the helicopter tomorrow. Okay, tomorrow we got average temperature of eight. That's fine. Mild wind, clear skies. Mm, no helicopter. Okay, I'm not gonna complain about that. All right, but it is 12 o'clock. We're gonna go to bed. Tomorrow maybe we fill up our water possibly. I'm not too sure, but we'll see you then. Jesus Christ! Oh my God! They Jesus! They broke our tent! Oh my God! Oh, jeez! I thought we was a goner! Oh my God! Where the hell did they come from? Maintenance up. We'll take it. Jesus Christ! I, I oh, we got beta blockers at least. I nearly had a heart attack. I thought the run was over right then and there. Oh my god, we'll take the lever. Oh no, what are we going to do now though? We don't have a bloody ten. You were too close to the road, weren't we? Oh, maybe we can make another one with the tarp actually. I think maybe you just need tarp. Oh, let's give it a shout, make sure there's no other bastards around. Oh, we need twine. Oh, we can make twine with Fred. Okay, okay, all is not lost. All is not lost. Let's go get some Fred. Bloody hell. What a, what a, uh, what a way to wake up. Okay, so we need steak. So how the hell do you make a steak? I can't remember. Tree branch. Okay, so it looks like we'll be doing some foraging. Let's forage for the tree branches. And we have found berries, but I don't know which is poisonous because we haven't read the herbalist mag. God, that was such a hot little horde that come for us. Jesus. I actually thought he was a goner. Oh my god, my heart. Let's give it a shout just to bring all the bastards over to us. I think we got to go deeper on the next camp. And we could chop a tree down, but I don't really want to. Don't want to waste the axe. We'll save that for firewood. Although we can craft axes, so... Oh, we got a level in foraging. Nice. Oh, we still need more bloody steaks. You can only make that from twigs. Ah, okay. Um, oh, the hell with it. Let's just cut down some trees. But maintenance did go up a level, though. So we're on maintenance free, which is pretty good. And the axe is broken. How do we make another axe? Chipstone. Oh, tree branch. Brilliant. Um, okay, put that back in there. We're going to have to forage for the day, I think. Let's keep a bit of chipstone on us, though. Oh, can we do it? Yes, let's just do it. Let's make let's make two stakes, and then at least we got a tent. Okay, we just need our tarp, which is fine. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. Good lord, what absolute carnage. <laughs> we're going to have we gonna have the helicopter tomorrow? Oh, you're joking. We need carpentry one. Oh, you are joking me. Ah, carpentry one. 
Oh, this is not good. All right, we got the air thing. We got the, the helicopter tomorrow. We're going to have to sleep on the bloody floor. Doesn't look like we got a helicopter tomorrow. The hell am I going to bloody get carpentry one up? What's our weight? 71, okay. Okay, the only other option we got is to go and get a bed. <laughs> um... Yeah, I think that's the only option from one of the houses and bring it out here. That's what we got to do. Let's go and have a look. I mean, we can. Can we sleep in these chairs? I can't remember. Yeah, we can. Okay. I mean, it's going to be bloody risky, but I think that's that's the play here. Let's dismount some stuff, try and get carp up. Oh, we don't have our saw with us. Ah, can we do the bed? Yeah, we can. Okay, that actually gives us a lot. So, I mean, the fancy double beds are the one. Let's fill up water while we're here. This is not good. We are tired and panicked. Let's take some baits. Oh, okay, okay, okay. He did have a knife in him, which I want, though. Yeah. Oh, I'm painkillers. All right, let's get one of these bloody chairs then. Okay, let me just double check. There's no radio, uh, no, um, no helicopter tomorrow. I mean, doing that bed did give us quite a bit. So maybe we do, if there's no helicopter, maybe we go around the houses and see if we can get carpentry one. Yeah, we need to go a bit more out off the beaten path, I think. This is quite, and it seems quite busy around here as well, to be honest, for where it is. Okay, we got the broadcast, anything occurring? Okay, so it doesn't actually look like there is anything coming. Is it going to say it now? Is it going to say it now? Okay, so we don't think... Oh, temporary communication failure of West Exclusion Zone. That's fine. It doesn't look like it's coming tomorrow. Oh, it's going to be bloody risky going to sleep out here on this chair. But, I mean, we don't, don't have a choice. How is our weight? 71. Let's have some more fish in us. Get some more fish in you, boy. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go to sleep. We'll see if we survive. Oh, God. Oh, God. Day 8 and the bloody helicopter's here. What? What? Why didn't we get the bloody notification? Get it. Get all of this. Get all of this. Get it. Get it. Get it. Oh, my God. We got to go. We got to go. Oh, my God. I was not expecting this. Jesus. Get the twine. Get the twine. Come on. We got to go. We got to go. Get the food. Get the food. Pick up the radio. Come on. Oh, no. The fire. The fire. Get the fire. Oh, God. Oh, God. God. Take campfire materials. Come on. We got to go. We got to go. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Can we make it to the can we make it to the motorbike? Okay, it looks like it's fairly clear. We can't see here, but I think we're gonna be okay. Jesus Christ. Okay, let's just hang about until until zombies start coming. Let's have a smoke. We need it. We're stressed. We've only got four cigarettes. Okay, let's start going. Let's start going. We have to ditch the motorbike. We're in trouble here. I'm just gonna go slow while there's no zombies, because we don't want them to turn up where we end up being. Oh yeah, they're starting to come now. So it sounds like it's gone. Didn't stay too long, but we're getting the hell out of here anyway. My God, what a couple of days. What a start to a 100-day series. My God. We've had a bloody zombies break in our tent. We've had the helicopter that we weren't prepared for. We just grabbed everything and got the hell out of there. But now the helicopter's gone, we can at least sort of our, what we got in our backpack out and everything we just grabbed it and left my god we got a plank <laughs> we got the campfire material what else did we get we got the radio not that it's much bloody good cooking part we got the tarp we got the steaks we got the twine <laughs> ah oh wow what a what a bloody what a day already all right let's see what we got in here we got a burnt down house there's probably not gonna be a lot in here all right let's check this old barn thing here the garage or whatever it is we got some crates we can dismantle they should be pretty good for the xp okay we're getting there we are getting there maybe if we dismantle these fences that should work ah oh, okay carp one okay that's good that's good we now have somewhere to sleep oh okay okay we have the tent jeez Let's go and see if we can find Ekron. Okay, this could work. This could work down the side of here. Maybe we just got to be smart, you know? We got protection. Well, not really there, but we got protection behind us. So if we do kip behind here, that could work, actually. I mean, we could sleep in here because we're not cross folk, but I would say this is inside of a house, so... We should probably wash what we can as well with the water. Okay, so this looks like it's going to be our little temp base. Probably sort out our uh, our inventory as well, our bike inventory. Okay, so we got ourselves a little a little temp base going on. Let's get some food in us. How is our weight looking? 72. Okay, so we are getting there. We'll probably keep the cooking part of water on it or in the bike because if we see any rivers or anything, we will fill up. Okay, so we've done a little bit of sorting. So down this side, we have all the 
important stuff. On this side, we have all of our food that we have. And on the back is just, just a dumping ground for now. We look okay for Zeds around. Famous last words, I know. What's, uh, what's the old map saying? Where are we? Yeah, I feel Ekron's right over here, so we may be close. Okay, but it's 10 to 12. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We're going to scout out the area, so hopefully we survive. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day nine. We've survived the night. <laughs> Weight is looking pretty good, to be honest. I think we're out of fish. Yes, we are, but that's fine. Let's, we're down to our last smoke. Let's, 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 let's have a little walk around survey the area. We did turn this off, didn't we? Okay, right. Let's have a little walk. There is this car over here I want to have a look at. Let's walk down here. Let's not take the bike. Let's not attract any of the bastards to us. We may as well forage as well while we're at it. Actually as well, while I remember, let's put a new icon up for the base. The new temp base. We think we'll uh, we'll stay here for the time being. Hmm, there's hay bales here. So maybe, maybe there's a farm let's have a little look we haven't seen any zombies yet which i'm not complaining about but oh we have a farm or some kind of civilization okay nice house nice big house see i'm not too i'm okay with the map well, I'm pretty good with the map, I'd say, if you see my GeoGuessr Project Zomboid, but these little outbacky in the sticks area, I'm not the best at. Mm, electronics magazine, I mean, we'll take it, why not? Don't think it's going to be much use, but it's a nice old house, big house. Good for a base, actually. Oh, what have we got in here, then? Lug wrench we already have, so we don't need that. I'm actually going to dismantle this just to see what's in the other crate, because we need all the help we can get. Ooh, a compound bow. Have we got the compound? No, I don't think we have the compound. Oh, I don't know. We'll take it anyway. We might have the haze. Rotten mouse. No. Ooh, beta blockers. Yes. Thank you. Okay, so we've washed all of the blood off us, which is nice. Very nice, actually. We've got a shed over here and what looks like another house or two there. So it's worth checking them out. Hopefully we find ourselves a new bag. That'd be nice. I mean, I'd even take a torch, to be honest with you, around about now. Well, that house is burnt down, so we have one cigarette. It ain't gonna be enough. We'll We'll take that cleaver. We'll take this other pot as well because we can put it outside and it will actually collect rainwater for us. And then we can just sterilize it at the fire. All right, let's check on this burnt house. I don't think there's going to be anything here, but oh, there's a lady in a dressing gown. Oh, we got some nice tins though. Definitely worth coming in here just for them tins. Let's head home. Good job we did start with the, uh, well, the starter kit because we haven't even found no bag or anything yet. Okay, we're back home. Let's go around. Let's go around this side just to make sure there's none of the bastards waiting for us. Oh, okay, well, yeah. Wow. So the haze compound bow. Where is the other one? Where is 470? Yeah, so it is the same. Well, that's fine. We got a backup. <laughs> This is pretty good. We are running out of space, though. At least we got a nice stockpile of food, which is good. How are our calories looking? 73. Okay, so we are getting there. We could do with something. You know what? Just eat the brown sugar. Yeah, to hell with it. <laughs> well, here we are. Day nine, waiting for the broadcast. Is it going to... I mean, I don't think... Um, the helicopter's going to come straight away, but... Okay, but it's 20 to 12. We're going to get a bed tomorrow. Ooh, day 10. We've done it. We've got the first 10 done, but we'll see you then. All right, day 10. Wow. Wow. Yeah, we got thick fog, so I don't actually think we're going to do a lot today. I did want to go, like, east, but in this fog, I just... I don't... I don't... I'm not going to. I'm not doing it. Suppose we could just dismantle this stuff. We may as well. Nice that we got two lots of beta blockers. That is really nice. Need seven high in calories. 720. It's gonna have to be the chips, isn't it? What about the beer? 160. Let's have a beer as well. Okay, so that's one Chevy after the beer and chips. What a what a bloody meal for him. Oh Barry. But it's about 20 past five. Well, it is 20 past five, so we're probably not gonna do a lot for the rest of the day. Okay, guys, so we are back day 11. We are looking good. Very good indeed. Let's bring the old mappage up. Now the next 10 days, we gotta find Ekron. I think. I don't know if it's this over. No, it's probably down here. So, yeah, we've also got to be careful of the helicopter coming again. But what I have thought of, I've got an idea. What I'm thinking is maybe we put some wooden walls up here just to uh, just to give us a bit of security. Now, let's try and dismantle some stuff. And we are going to be low on nails. <laughs> I don't know how feasible this is going to be. 
but it's an idea I had. Mm. Yeah, maybe we do do that today because it's half past one already. So maybe we're just starting to dismantle these crates and see if we can get a little wall going. Well, we've dismantled a few of them. We haven't really got a lot of planks. I suppose that's because we've only got carpentry level one, but we are very hungry as well. So let's try and go and get some food. Probably the main, actually, what we'll do is we'll put walls here because that won't take as many bloody planks there, will it? Oh, what? You need carpentry too? Okay, well, there goes that idea. That's a day wasted. Brilliant. <laughs> oh, we're having a lot of trouble with this bloody carpentry, aren't we? All right, well, let's go get some food anyway. Oh, let's eat, let's eat the honey. I might even give us a little boost to our cows and get us up to 75 as well. Ah, uh, one Chevy, we'll take it. Let's have a little scope around the area. Let's walk down this road, actually. We may as well, because, yeah, we're not tired yet. We're a bit out of sync, but, hmm. Well, there's nothing really down here. There is what looks like hay bales for a farm here, so maybe up here there'll be a farm. All right, so we're back home. We didn't find anything, really, up there. There was nothing. I'm guessing them that field there was to do with that house there. So I think what we're going to have to do is just drive on down here tomorrow. We'll take the bike because we don't know how far Ekron is. Let's also check the radio. I mean, I don't think we'll be having a helicopter soon, but I would like to just double check. We need a little handheld radio. That's when a little Walkman so we can attach it to our belt. That'd be easier. Okay, well, it looks like we're fine. The weather should be clear tomorrow as well. Let's go grab some food. We're at 73, so we are getting there. I don't really want to keep using all of our stuff in here, though, because we don't have a lot, to be honest. Let's have a fruit cocktail. Why the hell not? We'll have it just before bed. Okay, so it's 11 o'clock. We're going to eat our little fruit, fruit cocktail, and then we're going to get into bed hopefully we should be safe but <laughs> we'll see we'll uh we'll see in the morning okay day 12 we have awoken now let's actually let's put this out as well in case it rains i think empty cans can collect water i believe how are we looking for water ah uh, not too bad we got that's full but i think we're going to try and push down and see if we can find some kind of civilization all right so we've got a car we're nearly at the main road here what i actually going to do as well we're not going to change we're not going to change the fuel tank anymore so i think we fill up the bike and then try and salvage any fuel we can this has none uh, i don't have anything there either that we really need let's put the let's put the fuel tank oh it's empty okay let's put that in the back there all right let's have a look on this main road i think we go right here oh let's go look at these cars down here we may get some cigarettes maybe we got a lot of stuff going on here oh we got a hand torch i will take that and a lot of louisville map i mean we've got a fuel can the first aid kit's got nothing in it by the looks of it brilliant um okay oh bit of tarp we'll take though just in case just in case all right let's see if we can salvage some fuel from any of these nope none of them had any fuel on the road again oh could get some books out of here nope get a hell of a lot of louisville maps but i don't plan on going to louisville i'll tell you that much all right let's go up here let's try up here oh we got an ambulance so maybe we find some baities or something in there maybe some antidepressants trauma bag that may we'll take the alcohol why mobile blood bag <laughs> um i don't think that's gonna be any good trauma bag though what's that capacity 1865 18 okay so that's actually better than our uh, spiffo backpack so we will wear that but at least we found ourselves a new bag which is good we will keep hold of the spiffo bag anointed map we'll read it because that could give us that gives us Muldra. crazy willie's trailer hurdy turn hope all his guns still there hmm does that actually give us Muldra now? It should do, shouldn't it? Yeah, okay, so Muldra's there. Okay, so Ekron's going to be over here somewhere. Let's just have a little scope around up here. Looks like there's a house down here. Oh, and a satchel, yes! We will take that. Oh, and the desert boots. I do love myself some desert boots. Oh, they got a hole in them, though, so we won't be taking them. Well, absolutely nothing in here. Okay, we got a house. Maybe we find something nice in here. <laughs> it's not been too good so far. Can opener will take. Can hear a zombie somewhere. I think he'll probably be upstairs. Oh, there she is. There she is. Hey, hey, lady, lady, lady. <laughs> Well, there isn't a lot in here. I am going to dismantle this bed, though. Mm, so we're at level one and a half for carp. So not horrendous, but not really where I want to be. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, so we're down here. Let me just bring up the map here. Now, this could be getting into Ekron, mate. Now, I still think Ekron's a little bit further on, but we have found a couple of houses. So let's have a little loot and see what we can see. Oh, Oh, there's a few houses here. Okay. Can chili. We'll actually eat that. Oh, we got antidepressants. That is nice. Okay, that's that house cleared. Let's move on to the next. Oh, we have found some cereal, though, which is very, very nice. Do we eat that now, you know? Yeah, I think we do, just to get them calories going. Let's do it. 
Nice, nice. We just got ourselves a needle, which is good. So we can actually do a little bit of tailoring because of course I do want to get some backpack attachments as always. So we are nearly at carpentry too. I have been dismantling the fancy, the double beds as we've been going. So hopefully we might even get that maybe today. All right, we are starting to get a little bit tired, but we got one more house to do. So I feel we should do it being as we're down here. Oh, and we got carp too. Okay, let's actually take these because these will help these planks and nails. All right, let's mark all this off on our map. So we have done it all down here. Right, let's get home. Let's get back to our bike and get home. Pretty successful looting run, I'd say. We got a new bag, which is always, always nice. And we got a satchel. We got some carpentry up. Yeah, very successful. All right, well, we got home safe and sound. Let's look at building some of these walls up. We may do that tomorrow. And then we can always come back here, you know, once. So uh, if we know it's safe here we could we could come back here in the future ah we need more nails okay all right so we got a few nails we got a few planks um i didn't really think but we this window is a bit exposed here but that's fine because we can barricade that let's see if we can actually get these walls put up yeah we can okay it's not gonna be pretty but it's gonna do the job more damn nails okay well that'll have to wait we're just gonna have to keep an eye out for nails. I feel fairly secure here, to be honest with you. Bloody planks everywhere. Oh, before we go to bed, let's just check the radio. <laughs> okay, what we got? 502, automated broadcast service. What are you saying? What are you saying? Order 74 has been issued. Tomorrow, average temperatures, blah, 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 blah. Clear skies, nice. And that's it, okay. So no air activity, even though it didn't really tell us last time. But we'll go to bed tomorrow. Tomorrow, I think we're going to finish this off. We're going to dismantle them crates. It's going to be a, a temp-based day, but uh, we'll see you in the morning. All right, day 13. We have survived another night. Right, what we're going to do, yeah, we need nails. Let's just dismantle these crates. It's going to help us with carpentry as well, even though I don't really know what we're going to need carpentry for, but we may as well get it up. Oh, these tables might have better nails, actually. Oh, yes, we got seven already from the tables. Oh, yes, we got the nails. We got the nails. We got 16 nails. That should do as a turn. She is complete. She is a monstrosity, but she is complete. How's our weight looking? Ah, still 73. We just can't get it up, can we? All right, we got a load of wood. We got a load of nails. Let's see what we can do. Can we get this all boarded off today? All right, we need three more planks, and that is that done. And then we are kind of safe. We do have this window here, but I... I think we'll be fine with that. Famous last words, I know, I know. Well, we've dismantled everything in here and we are actually missing a, uh, a plank. But that's fine. We do have a lot of firewood in there now, though, if we need it. And we're going to have to have some food. Let's have some corned beef. Let's do it. God, we need a river for some fish. Fish is the one for the calories. We will take a plank off of here, though. Oh, no. We need two more planks. Well, at least it's something. At least it's something. <laughs> How far away are we? We're not too far from the river. We could go up there for a day, you know. I do want to get into Ekron. Now. I've got a feeling it's down here. Maybe tomorrow we go down here. If no luck, then the following day we'll go do a bit of fishing, maybe. Okay, it's 20 to 12. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. Yeah, we're going to push on down that road and see if we can find some kind of civilization. But uh, we'll see you in the morning. Okay. Okay, day 14. We have awoken safe and sound. We ain't dead yet. We ain't dead yet. Let's just crack straight on. We need to keep an eye out for a plank. We could probably chop a tree down, but hopefully we'll find something something interesting down here anyway. Oh, I think I know where we are now. I think Pony Roma. Pony Roma. Yeah, okay. So Ekron should. We're not going to stop at these houses. So I think Ekron should just be down this road, maybe. God, there is a lot of bloody zombies, though. Yeah, we're definitely getting into civilization because there is a lot. Oh, that one's got a duffel bag, but I don't really want to stop. Jesus Christ, run, run! Oh my God, we've had an accident. How the hell did I not die from that? Oh God. Oh my Lord. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Where the hell are our beta blockers? Where are they? How the hell did I not die? They were ready to start munching on me. Good God, I actually paused the game because I was like, what the hell am I going to do here? Uh, maybe the bike's going to be knackered now, though. It's too crazy. i got to be careful on the bike. I've got to be careful. All right, we got the bike. We got the bike. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, God. Good Lord. we got to be careful. Now I'm thinking Ekron was a bad idea. Can we... What about here? Can we take him here? We might be able to take him. Mm, there's a couple coming. I don't know if they've actually spotted us. Maybe we take him. Maybe. Ah, there's a lot of them. Oh, God, there's a load there as well. Jesus Christ. Oh, 
Oh, my lord. Okay, we got through them. We got through them. Now, has any of them got any cigarettes or beta blockers? Was it even worth it? <laughs> no, they had nothing. I'll tell you what we're actually going to use. We're going to use the bloody crossbow here. Now, I think the bookstore should just be over here. Bastards. Look at them all. The crossbow is good. Oh, we're out of ammo. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, and I got through a couple of them. Let's, let's thin the horde out for us. got a lighter <laughs> a summon i wonder if maintenance has anything to do with how uh, often the bolts break maybe all right let's walk up let's see how we're looking crossbow is good <laughs> i like the crossbow it's just how long are the ammo gonna last another reason to get into the bookstore to try and find the recipe for it yeah, we don't need to go along that oh there is a spare tent there though do we need a spare we probably do <laughs> there it is Oh no, that's the bar. Damn it, where's the bookstore? Is it further up? Oh, we got we one broke, one broke. Damn it. Okay, there's the bookstore. Okay, let's get the crowbar for these jokers. Okay, we are in the bookstore. Please give me something useful. Let it be worth something. Oh, we got oh we can make we can make bolts. That's amazing. That is amazing. Foraging. We've already got foraging. I hear a bloody zombie. Taylor in two will take. Taylor in one would be nice. Foraging two. Yeah, yeah, we'll take that. Alright, let's get out of here. We gotta go. We gotta go. Well, at least we got the doomsday prepper, which allows us to craft bolts. Yes, craft long crossbow bolts. That is actually really good. That's gonna come in handy. So I think we'll get home. I mean it's not the reason all i wanted but it's something at least i don't know what items we need to actually craft it let's sneak here oh my god look at them all there jesus we gotta get home yeah loose respawn is off oh lord oh god oh god oh god jesus christ oh god we gotta clear this ah please no god no all right i think we're I think we're okay. Bike probably took a beating from hitting all the zombies, but then also from hitting the tree, which isn't good because if we lose the bike, well, I mean, I suppose I didn't set any rules about not taking a car, but I want to keep the bike going. Oh, there's a lot of just zombies everywhere. Ah, <sighs> well, we are home safe and sound, of, so it would seem. Let's go and assess what we've got here. Foraging, tailoring, I mean, metalworking. Mm, yeah, we should probably read that. Tailoring too, we don't need just yet. We want these mags. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, yeah, we're still not. Oh, let's get some planks. Let's get the axe. In. Ah, no, we'll do that tomorrow. We'll do that tomorrow. Ah, okay, right. Let's read this magazine, Doomsday Prepper. Oh, God. We need a bloody shaft and everything. Jesus. Long crossbow bolt scrap metal. Oh, God. We ain't going to be able to find any bloody scrap metal, are we? Why the hell can't we just make it with bloody stones or something? Scrap metal. Why the hell can't we make bloody wooden ones? Jeez. Well, that's probably pretty useless, actually, now then. <laughs> so I'm down to three bolts. <laughs> All right, but it's 12 o'clock. We're going to have some canned mushroom soup. And then I think tomorrow we're going to have to go and do a bit of fishing for the day because we need bloody, we need food. We need food. Yeah, that's what we got to do. All right, we'll go to bed. We'll see you in the morning. Ah, all right. Day 15. It's, we got a bit of rain. At least it's not snowing. Um, we're losing health for some reason. No, probably because we're carrying so much. Let's jot the books down here. Okay, okay. Now, what we need to do is we need to sort ourselves out. We need to gain weight so then we attack harder. We need to get some food. So I think we're going to have to go up and do a bit of fishing. We can drop these cross, the cross bolt and stuff off. The cross bolt, the cross bow with the bolts because we're not really going to be going anywhere busy. It's a shame we can't make more easily. And is a real shame do we have a spear no we do not but we have branches so we can craft the spear all right let's go up to our old little spot and do a bit of fishing i think we can also wash ourselves as well we will deal with this police thing because he may have a radio on him he did not but we will take his nightstick okay so we're near the river let's turn the old bike off let's get rid of some of the stuff we've got on us all right let's get let's uh we're gonna need some food aren't we because we're probably starving which isn't good yeah the food is looking very very low <laughs> we could actually go spears you know they do crit quite high okay so it's nine o'clock we have gained a level in fishing as well which is really nice we're at level three we got we got a lot of fish on us we got a lot we got enough to keep us going maybe for a day or two and maybe to get us up to that 70. See, we're down to 72 now. We were 73. It's not a, the closest place to go fishing, but uh, 
you know, desperate times and all that. Okay, so we are home. Let's drop the spear off. We've got a nice little haul of fish, which is nice. We'll pop that on the floor. We'll get a fire going tomorrow. Okay, let's free the foraging for a little bit before we do go to bed, I think. All right, it's 10 past 12. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We eat like kings. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 16. We have awoken. Look at these fish. Just look at them. We've got to fill it, all of these bad boys up. Oh, we're getting the leveling cooking. We need twigs. We need twigs to start this bad boy out. All some sheet, some rip sheet, which will be fine, which I believe we have. Yeah, we got one, so not ideal. Okay, let's light this bad boy and let's feast. Uh, the, the small little bait fish is actually cooked as well. Are they edible? Yeah, okay. Well, eat all of them. Eat all of that. Let's get them calories going. Come on. Come on, Barry. So I thought we was going to actually get more more uh, calories from that so we're gonna have to go fishing again today it's got to be done yeah this has been a tough one it's been a tough start it really has we've had a lot of near misses <laughs> okay it's nine o'clock pretty much we've had a good old haul today look at all of this look at this big catfish big crappy we got a lot this this should do us a couple of days i want to say okay home sweet home let's check the condition of the bike actually because we've been in a few scrapes with her <laughs> uh, for, oh god 35 that is not good that is not good we need mechanics up a level god damn it we just need so much but we got nothing nothing we got no books or anything it's an absolute nightmare to be honest all right let's drop all this bloody fish down let's finish the old foraging foraging could be our savior here it really could all right we got the broadcast on what's going on what's occurring what's occurring we got anything coming okay temporary communication failure I think that's it. Nothing about air activity. So I think maybe we're going to be okay. All right, it's 12 o'clock. Let's go to bed. Tomorrow we're going to finish carp. We're going to cook the fish and probably do a bit of foraging. I think we'll see you then. Okay, day 17. Let's kick the day off by filleting all of these lovely, lovely fish. Actually, does it even matter? Because I think slicing it takes away the unhappiness. But I mean, we're bloody severely depressed anyway. So does it even matter? Maybe we shouldn't have been filleting them. Just eating them. I think you get more calories that way as well. Oh, we got nothing to light the fire with. Oh, we're going to have to. Ah, we're going to have to do a bit of foraging. Let's read the rest of this quick. Okay, so we read that. Actually, we can rip in scrap paper. Can we light a fire with that? Oh, we've got 100 pieces of scrap paper. Oh, yes, we can. Okay, that's brilliant. That is amazing, actually. Okay, we got some lovely fish now then. 14. Is it burnt? No, it's not burnt, thank you. God, because we are weak stomachs, so that would not be helpful. Okay, we are 2,800 calories, so we should gain some bloody weight. So I think the rest of the day, we'll just do a little bit of foraging, I reckon. Oh, we got a level in foraging. Nice, a so level four. Do we have logs? Mm, do we? Yes, yes, we will have them because we'll we'll finish a wall. Cilantro, yeah, we'll have that. Sage, yeah, we'll have that. Nails, we always need more nails. I mean, maintenance is at nearly level three. Once we get to maintenance three, maybe then we actually do go spears, I think. All right, we got anything coming tomorrow? Hostile activity in sector 25. Mm, that's not really what we want to hear. Uh, we got a chance of snowfall, but doesn't look like any air activity. So there we go. Okay, but it is 12 o'clock. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. I'm not too sure yet, but we'll see in the morning. Okay, day 18. Wow. Okay, how are we looking? How are we looking? Food, we're okay. Calories are still going up. Still got all this fish. Not very big fish. I think, I think we're going to have to go and do some fishing again, you know. That's the plan. We'll stop at a house on the way that I saw that I want to check out. It's slow progress, but progress is progress nonetheless. Let's put this cooking pot down as well because that's ran out. Water is a little bit low, but we're going to be okay, I think. We do you need fuel as well? We are getting low on fuel. All these trips to the bloody fishing. Let's check these. I don't know if I checked these cars. Okay, yeah, so I want to check the house down here. Oh, God, and there's a party going on in here. Oh, my. God, there is a lot in here. Jeez. Okay, we got a bit of food, which is good. Some dried goods if uh, the fish goes off or anything like that. Okay, and we also have three nails. I think we need four, is it, to put the uh, the wall on there? Okay, well, we got four just in case. Well, not a bad haul in there. Not amazing, but we will mark it off anyway. Okay, we're at our little fishing spot. Let's get our spear. Okay, so we're done fishing. It's 20 past eight. We have got a hell of a lot of fish. Look at all of this. This should do us for a few days. We even got too much of that to go into our bloody main inventory. I'm really worried about the bike. Really worried. She's not in a good way. Okay, but we are home safe and sound once again. We're back at our little hovel. <laughs> oh, at least it's safe. At least it's safe. There we go. We are safe. We are safe. Okay, okay. Let's just pop this fish here for now. We don't really need to cook it up just yet. Oh, we got snow. 
<laughs> Brilliant. Oh, we got a lot of fish though. How is our fishing skill? Ah, oh, nice, nice. Uh, let's eat some of this in uh, in the fire here because we are hungry. Okay, we're gaining weight. We're gaining weight. That's good. That's good. That's what we like. That's what we like. I mean, we may as well read metal work in too because we probably will need that for vehicle repairs. So let's read some of that. But it is 20 past 12. It's time to go to bed. Hopefully we survive the night now that we've got some security. Tomorrow, I think we'll be reading on foraging. So we'll, uh, oh, get that fish out of our inventory. Um, so we'll see you tomorrow. Okay, day 19. We're looking good. Weights at 73 and rising. That is good. Let's drop the book there. We'll do a little bit of foraging for the day, I think. That's that's the plan. We're not going to go too far. Oh my god, there's a, a helicopter already? God, right. Okay, 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 okay. I know what we're doing. I know what we're doing. I've got a plan. I've got a plan. Get on the bloody bike. <laughs> that's the plan. Don't want them near this space. Come on, you bastard. Follow me up here. Let's go along this road, see what's down here, being as we're on the bike, shall we? Okay, so it sounds like the helicopter has gone, so we can head back to base. Ah, we did. We never checked the radio, did we? <laughs> we never checked the bloody radio. All right, we're back at base. Doesn't look like there's any zombos around, which is good. No, I think we're okay. Ah, stale, but oh well. Not really going to do any foraging, I don't think, because there could be zombies in the forest from the helicopter, so we'll probably just read the rest of the metal working, I reckon. All right, so just finished reading the book. We will actually rip and scramble paper for this. Drop it off in the bike, so we always have a little bit of a backup there. And also our pan, our pot, yep, should have water in it, which is good. So we will actually sterilize that tomorrow when we do with the when we cook our fish up. Okay, so it's all there ready to go. So let's go to bed tomorrow. Yeah, we'll see. Okay, day 20. Not gonna do a lot today, as always, on a 10th day. We will sort this fire going though. Light fire with the scramble bit of paper. And let's seal this cook. Okay, put the fire out. I think that should all be cooked. Yeah, and so is the pot of water. All the fish is cooked. Nice, nice. Okay, the little fish are cooked as well. This is all small fish, but it didn't really matter. Okay, and we have the cooking pots as well. Let's go put the cooking pots in the bike. But we probably won't be doing a lot for the rest of the day. Now, for the next 10 days, now we've had the helicopter, what I'm thinking I might do is we might push down to Pony Aroma and we might get in the little farm that's there because I believe there is a well and then we're close to Ekron and then we can get in there because I also want to go to the hunting store because there may be more crossbow bolts. There's all of these houses here we can hit up. Yeah, it's slow It's slow progress, but progress is progress nonetheless. Now, we're, we're moving away from our food source, the river, but there is, of course, Phallus Lake up there. So we're going to have to just try and push through. It may take 10 days to clear our way into that. I don't know. I really don't know. But it's the only option we got, to be honest. <laughs> our weight is 74, so we've nearly lost underweight just a couple more so that will help us killing the zombies absolutely but as i say we're probably not going to do a lot for the rest of the day okay guys day 21 we are back now let's have a quick look at the old mappage here we're going to pause it now i believe west point is going to be just here so what we might do is try and get to the school so we might go along here just walk in there because i think the school's to like the northeast west of it that is going to be the plan and we'll see how it is and then if it's too busy we're going to abort the mission but if we manage it happy days and then we're going to push down here and then maybe try and take over the farm here and camp up there we don't know we don't know we're gonna to have to see how it is water's looking okay not amazing but you know it is what it is let's take a little bit of this oh and what i want to do as well is actually make two spears because i want to test out the spear now that we got pretty good maintenance skill oh no we made a stake i don't want a stake our weight is 75 so we are getting there one more one more tick and we should be good let's actually take a couple of fishers with us we've also got the jerry can as well the fuel can in case we find somewhere or a vehicle with fuel in we could do with maintenance we could do with foraging we could do with a lot god we glitched out a bit then didn't we jeez just gonna take it nice and slow okay so we got some zombies here i am just gonna leave the bike here oh no we don't want to craft and we're gonna walk because i don't want to draw any zombies to us when we're in a when we get to west point as it is probably one of the busiest places okay spears are doing all right god i'm gonna take some getting used to the spears it's been a while it's been a while god we're miles away from west point okay yeah we're not walking that <laughs> Okay, so we got a few of the, uh, oh god, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, Jesus Christ, we've had to leave the car running, but at least our rear is clear, we know that. Look at them all, jeez. They're all West Point, but I do think it's going to be our best bet to get Buck, so we've got to do it. Oh, and there goes a spear, brilliant. Oh god, look at them all, bloody hell. And there goes the other spear. 
Oh, good lord, we got a lot of them. There's still a couple hanging around. See if we can get any bloody smokes or beta blockers, and look like it. Right, let's drive on a little bit further, I think. We're okay, we're okay. So I suppose our main goal is actually getting... Oh, God, look at this. Yeah, our main goal, I would say, is getting mechanics book now and up in our mechanics skill. Oh, they got a crossbow on them. I see some food as well, because we are very hungry, so that's going to be affecting our damage. Yeah, I don't know about West Point. <laughs> Oh, maintenance up, nice. Oh, okay, well, we got a crossbow anyway, and uh, another one. <laughs> I think that's actually a better one than we've got as well. Oh, we're going to walkie-talkie, we'll take that. Hopefully we can put this signal on that, and the emergency broadcast. I think we left our bike running as well. Oh, no, we didn't. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Mm, we got a March Ridge map, okay. Yeah, we'll take it. <laughs> that's about all that's useful in there. Okay, 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 okay. Now I... Oh, I think that was a better walkie-talkie. Yep, okay, we'll take that now. Oh, hello there, easy fella. Now, I think West Point may be a little bit of a bust, you know. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know if we're going to get in there. It's so busy everywhere. No, let's... Uh, it's four o'clock. We're going to start getting tired. Let's get out of here. Yeah, just eating my whole fish while I'm riding my bike here. Don't mind me, zombies, you bastards. How is our weight looking now? Probably shouldn't be messing around while we're driving. 75. Okay, so we have lost underweight. Okay, so we are home. We definitely are not ready for... West Point. That is a fact. <laughs> we just ain't. We just ain't. We will attach this walkie-talkie, though, to our belt. Uh, we got to add the emergency broadcast. Okay, so we saved the preset. So is that going to let us tune it in? Yeah, automated emergency broadcast. Okay, so we got that on us, which is good. Let's see some more. Do we need some more fish? Let's make some more spears, actually. Brilliant. There goes the knife. Rip in peace. To be fair, we don't really need the knives to fill it the fish anymore because we're just going to eat them how they are, aren't we? Put them in our backpack. Ah, oh, I wasn't reading. That's fine. We'll wait for the next one. Okay, so let's see if we got the helicopter. We shouldn't have it, but then we've said this before, haven't we? So who the hell knows? Light fog. Okay, so it doesn't look like we've got any air activity, so that is good, I suppose. Now we're gonna have to start watching our calorie i know we're setting us fine so let's eat a little see a little catfish okay but it's 12 o'clock we're gonna go to bed and tomorrow we're gonna do a bit of foraging we're gonna push down to the farm i don't know yet but we'll see you in the morning all right day 22 we got fog so that is not good i think what we're gonna do today is let's go fill our water up in the pan and we can put that outside to get some more that's the first thing we're gonna do okay so that's pretty much empty now so we'll leave that out together more why the hell are we so why have we got such a heavy load Oh, because our carry capacity is only 11, of course, because normally I take our strength's only 5. Ah! Oh, and we got all these bloody spears on us. Okay, let's put that in a backpack. Right, so let's forage today, I think. That is... Yeah, that's that's the main thing. I mean, we're not really going to find a lot. Maybe we should take our helmet off. Yeah, so that, that helps us a hell of a lot. Oh, look at this. Look at this hair. Look at it. Oh, my God. Um, yeah, so we're going to forage. It is what it is, you know. Hopefully, we can find some good stuff. Okay, so it's 10 to 5. We've done a fair bit of foraging. We have a lot of weight on us. Let's put our helmet back on. Now, we've got a few bits. we got some branches. I've crafted some more spears. we got some leek, some thyme, a slug, a centipede. So, worst case, we got some kind of food anyway. I mean, we will eat the leek now. We don't need all these branches. Let's craft these all in spears. Put some in the back of our, back of our bike here. Oh, we are running out of weight. We really are. Oh dear. Tomorrow though, tomorrow, tomorrow. Yeah, we'll go down here. We'll park up at these houses and then we'll walk down and clear them out with the spear, I think. That is the play here. Let's say we're not ready for West Point. We've got we to gotta be slow and steady on this one. It's going to win us the race, hopefully. Wait, is it 76? Okay, so we can actually eat more fish. That's fine. Do we really need the pistol on us? I mean, we could... <sighs> Maybe, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, it's, it does weigh quite a bit, actually, doesn't it? Let's also check the broadcast as well for tomorrow. Okay, emergency broadcast. What we got? Blackout. We know about the blackout. Come on, we know. Clear skies. That's today, I believe. Tomorrow, uh, we're going to have a three, minus 3.5. Not good. Mild winds. Clear skies. Cloudy spells. Okay, so let's get to bed tomorrow. Yeah, we'll push down to the farm there. Right, we'll see you in the morning.
All right, day 23, and we've got some stale fish here, but let's eat it anyway. Get it in ya. Get it in ya. All right, let's push on down to the farm. There is some banged up cars down there as well, so maybe, maybe one will have fuel. We'll see. Because we are getting low. We've got a quarter of a tank left, which isn't good. Okay, we got zombies. we got zombies. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, so spears are going to be pretty pretty useful in this playthrough, I think. And we may as well, as we are foraging. The only problem with spears is they are quite heavy, I believe. You're also going to be careful of the insta-kill animation when there's other zombies around. Siphon gas. Okay, it's looking up. It's looking up. Oh, we got a lot of gas out of that. Nice, nice. This is definitely the play, I think. What the hell was I thinking trying to go to West Point? <laughs> I hate West Point at the best of times. Okay, so that's actually gave us nearly three quarters of a tank, which is bloody good. There may even be more in the car. Oh, there is more. Okay, we'll have it. Anointed map we will have because that could give us a location. Oh, it's Louisville. <laughs> I don't want Louisville. Empty, so the car should be... Oh, look, we can take more. Okay, that looks like it now. Okay, so the, the, the bike should now be filled up with a little bit left to spare, which is which is amazing. That's, oh, that's so good. We ain't got to worry about bloody fuel for a while. What does that actually give us? Let's have a look quick. Yeah, it is full. Of course it is. Look at that. Oh. So the farm, I believe, is down there. But what we'll do is we'll clear the zombies out. Actually, yeah, let's go down to the farm now. Is that the farm over there? No, these are the houses. Um, okay, well, let's go here instead then. God, there's a lot there by the looks of it. <laughs> There goes the spears. All right, we are in the house. I can see some jam and peanut butter, which is bloody amazing. Okay, well, that's this house done. We better mark them off as we go. We got a burnt house here. and I wouldn't normally go in, but we had quite a bit of luck with the last burnt house, didn't we now? Not so much luck with this one, but that's fine. A muffler. Hmm. Don't know if we're going to need it, but well, let's take it. It's going to put it very overweight. I know it is. Yeah. And a bandage will take as well. All right, let's get out of here. Let's not uh, let's not push our luck. I mean, we are. It is ten past five, so let's go. All right, we are home, sweet home. Well, we can't uninstall. We can't replace because we need advanced mechanics. Brilliant. How did we not start that? We should be able to bloody do everything because we know how to bloody. We're the nomad. We're the biker nomad. That's one one of the traits, wasn't it? I start with mechanic or something. The vehicle nomad tools. Uh, well. <laughs> There we go, we can only repair stuff, but ah, it's not the end of the world. Can't even uninstall the bloody battery. <laughs> uh, okay, so we need a propane tank then, don't we? A propane mask and blow and um, torch. All right, well, it is what it is, you know. All right, well, we've just finished all of our fish. I think we're going to be okay, you know, for a couple of days. Wait is, uh, maybe, ooh, ew, maybe we do go up and get some fish. I don't know yet, I don't know. I do really want to get the next level of forage in. That's what I do want. All right, let's see this emergency broadcast, what we got coming. Anything? Any helicopter tomorrow? Mm, expected clouds, blah, 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 blah. Well, doesn't look like there's anything tomorrow. Or am I just reading it wrong? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> All right, it's half past 12. Let's go to bed tomorrow. I think we're finishing off the forage and we'll see you then. Okay, day 24. Wow. We're getting through them. We're getting through them. As I said, I think we're going to forage today. Maybe we'll find more as well because the weather's better today. Yeah, only a minus 4%, whereas I think it was like 20 when it was fog. <laughs> oh, we got a level in carpentry. I'll take that from crafting these spears. Nice. Oh, we got we got another level in foraging. Nice, nice. That's what we wanted. So we found some carrots and some carrot seeds. So we are in farmland, so we have got a high chance of finding food. So maybe, just maybe, we go around here. I was going to go and do a bit of fishing, but maybe we just forage around a bit up here. Maybe hopefully find ourselves some more vegetables. Oh, and look what we can f look for now. That's good. Let's look for crops then. Ah, more carrots. Yes. Ah, a daikon, whatever that is. Okay, but we are home, very overweight, but we did have quite a good haul. Look at all of this stuff. I don't even know what this is. I mean, grape leaves. Can we eat them? I would have thought so. We got some carrots. Ah, oh, look at it all. It's lovely. Okay, so I've been thinking. I think we're going to get rid of the nightstick and also the pistol as well because, I mean, ugh, are we really going to use it? If we get in trouble, we haven't used it so far and we've been in trouble a couple of times. So it's just going to save us the weight. Okay, there we go. There we go. We got, what, four spears on us? Oh, that one's only dead, but done 
don't matter. It don't matter. Okay, we got the broadcast. What we got? We got any air activity? Let's see. Mm, temperatures today. We're not too worried about that as it is 10 p.m. We'll be going to bed soon. Tomorrow, blah, 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 blah. Cloud, heavy cloud. Okay, as long as it's not fog. That's fine. Warning, pretty exciting in the afternoon. Expected light to moderate rain with a chance of snowfall. Okay, so we got rain. Oh, God, thunderstorm, five days. All right, and that looks like it. So no air activity. Let's turn that off. So tomorrow we'll push back down to the farm, I think. But it's half past seven. We're going to go to bed. We'll see you in the morning. All right, day 25. We are actually losing weight. So we're going to have some of that lovely peanut butter, I think, that we found. And then push on down to the farm there. Pony Aroma. Yeah, let's get some lovely... Oh, look at that. 2,600 calories. Um, Yeah, we eat it all. Eat it all, Barry. Well, that's leveled us off. Can we get Chevy, maybe? <sighs> It's going to be fishing it. Well, we'll go do the fish another day. Maybe tomorrow. Okay, we got one Chevy pumping. That's fine. All right, let's head down. All right, so we're at the entrance to what I believe is the farm. Let's do with these jokers over here because I keep seeing them. Ooh, we got some firemen here. Maybe they might have an axe. Maybe. Oh, they do have an axe. Let's take it. Let's have it. I ain't going to say no to an axe. That's for sure. Oh, West Point map. Let's read that. All right, so let's have a quick look at the map. So where was West Point? Yeah, so we nearly, nearly... God, we was camping so close to West Point. Ooh, you know what? When we attack, when we attempt West Point, maybe the gated houses up there could be pretty good because, well, they're gated. We They'd be easy to secure. Okay, that's options. That's options. How have none of these bloody zombies got cigarettes on them? Jeez. Anointed map will read because that could give us... Oh, it gives us rosewood. Nice. Kind of want the propane tank, but... Yeah, it's too heavy. We will actually mark it, though. There. Look at that. I love these added map symbols. They are amazing. But we made it to the farm. Now, what my plan is... Oh, yeah, we can. When we move down here, we're going to camp on the roof. That's a perfect location, I think. <laughs> Oh, we got a party house, so then there should be cigarettes, maybe? Let's give it a shout. Let's get them out. Uh, they don't want to play nice, do they? Oh, God, look at them all in there. Oh, and he's got a crowbar. Ah, they're being awkward. And we will take that crowbar, absolutely. Painkillers, we will have. Now, can we get on the roof here? Is it safe? Yes. Okay, so yeah, we can actually camp on here. Okay, I mean, I think that's fair. We're not inside, so <laughs> we are technically outside. We're just in a very good location. Now, is there actually a well here? I thought there was. Ah, yes, here it is, hidden. Oh, amazing. Look at this. We'll actually wash ourselves as well. Unlimited water. Oh. We're clean. We are clean. No zombie guts on us. Right, let's go and have a look in this little shed thing here. Oh, another propane tank. Let's mark it. Let's mark it. There we go. Look at that. Wow. Okay, so not, you know, not really stuff we need right now, but I will not say no to any of that. And we know where it is as well. Okay, I'm thinking, do we do we move down here? We just move down here. We're close to Ekron. We're getting there. We're moving away from West Point, but the only problem I can foresee is food. But we might just be able to forage it all because I guess in that is classed as farmland down there. But maybe tomorrow before we move, we do go and get a load of fish. And we have been in our current base quite a while now. We did say we we're going to keep moving. So I think that's the next, that is definitely the next location. All right. So we are home. Let's put our spare. We are, we are running out of space. Uh, oh, the can doesn't collect water. That's fine. All right, let's get the radio on, see what he's saying tomorrow. Okay, here we go. And I'm just thinking we don't actually need the radio anymore because we've got the handheld. So, and I think there's one at the farm. So we'll actually leave this one here. Okay, this is today. Clouds, blah, 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 blah. Tomorrow, average temperature is minus six. Okay, that's going to be a bit chilly. Heavy cloud cover. Okay, so no air activity, but we've been caught out so many times before. But if we keep this place here, you know, worst case, we can sleep on the floor here if we need to just escape from the farm. All right, it's 20 to 12. We got snow. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. Bit of fishing. We'll see you then. Okay, day 26. We have got bloody snow. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know how much fish we're going to catch today, but that is the goal. We have a spear on us. That's fine. I'll seem to get rid of this tailoring book as well. Well, let's put the cooking pot. How oh, we do it? No, we'll leave the cooking pot here because if we are in a pinch, we've got a little bit of a source of water here because we can make a campfire fairly easy, I reckon. I mean, are we really going to need tailoring for? Probably not, but 
we'll keep it anyway. All right, let's go get some fish. All right, we're at our spot. Let's get off. Let's go get ourselves some fish. All right, so we have fished all of the abundance out of the river. We got a fair old bit with us. We get to get rid of these socks. We're very overweight, so let's get back. Oh, so we can actually make a campfire with a sheet of paper which we have a hell of a lot of. So we'll leave the campfire there as well, but take the tent. Okay, we are home. We're going to have to cook some of this up, I think, and eat it because we don't have space for it anywhere. And we are hungry as well and our calories. We are a uh, minus. We're in a deficit for calories, so we better get cracking and uh, cook this bad boy up. Cook, well, these bad boys up. Okay, there they are. Nice and cooked. Put the fire out and let's feast. Oh. That has done the trick, that has. Yep, we are gaining weight again, which is good. We'll save that one for tomorrow. Okay, light to moderate rain with a chance of snowfall. That's fine. Clear skies, I think, tomorrow. Severe weather warning, three days for a thunderstorm. Hmm. That's not going to be good, is it? But it is 12 o'clock. It's time to go to bed tomorrow. We move camp. Let's do it. Okay, day 27. Let's take down this bad boy. Let's just get on with it, shall we? We got the tent kit there. Lovely, lovely. Let's... We're not hungry yet, so let's not eat the fish. Let's actually put the tent kit... What does that weigh? Three. Uh, let's actually put that in our backpack. Oh, we got a we got a, sun, a small sunfish there as well. Okay, happy days. All right, let's get moving. Actually, we will eat the fish now because we want more calories. Goodbye, old base. You've been good to us. You really have. Okay, so we're near our new potential base. We are going to drive the bike down there plan is to not actually leave here on the bike for a while well i suppose until until the helicopter <laughs> let's get it ready to go if we do need to escape right we've made a campfire we've got our tent we've taken the books out just to give us a little bit more uh, space in the car there now i'm thinking i don't know if this is going to set on fire so i don't want to risk it so we're just going to put we're just going to put the campfire here you know how is our tailoring um abysmal okay well is what it is we got plenty of water inside here as well which is nice oh do we not look in here now i'm sure there was a radio yeah okay let's grab this and put this on the roof with us all right put up the tent oh no oh no oh no the plan oh whew. okay okay that's fine <laughs> i thought the plan was gonna fail then before it had even started look at that lovely stuff lovely Let's put the radio there. Oh, and it's got the emergency broadcast ready for us. Lovely stuff. Okay, I am feeling, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling really good, you know. Right, I have ripped a load of clothes because now that we have water, let's put this fish in here very quickly, actually. Now that we have water, we can wash clothes and we can make thread. So it's going to be slow tailoring, but, you know, we, we got no choice. We ain't got a book. We ain't got a book. We could still do with a couple of levels to get them attachments and stuff which will help with our weight. So, I mean, it goes a little bit, actually. More than I was expecting. And we do have farm there to forage. So this is good. This is good. I'm liking this location. So I think for the rest of the day, actually, we will forage. Let's maybe look for trash. Oh, extremely rare. Okay, because maybe with trash, we could find cigarettes. But let's just look for some food. Oh, we got a millipede. We'll have that. All right. Well, we're back at the base. Let's put these fish in the fire to save some space in the backpack. Put our little uh, creepy crawlies in there. Uh, we don't really need... To, uh, I mean, we could plant the seeds. Do we actually have an axe? I don't think so. That's broken. Let's make a stone axe. Okay, we have a, an axe. Oh, we do have the fire axe, but I don't really want to be using that for chopping trees and stuff like that. I want to use that for killing zombies. How are the calories looking? 70, so we could do with a little bit more. So maybe we just, maybe we do just start the fire and cook this fish up and eat it, maybe. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, we got some lovely fish. Let's get some in us. Let's get them calories going. Okay. Oh, what I do want to do as well is mark these houses off here. So we have done them. So maybe tomorrow if there's no helicopter, we do go up and see what else we can find up there. Go through the woods. Uh, we got weather predicted afternoon and showers or heavy rain. Thunderstorm in two days. Okay, so we'll go up to them houses tomorrow then. And we will actually start tailoring now because uh, we are gaining it quite fast without even reading the book. So that's fine. Okay, but it's 10 to 12. We're going to go to bed. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 28. Let's just get a move on, shall we? Let's get up to, uh, to them houses. Okay, so we got up here. We got a couple of zombies. Let's deal with them because we are ripping uh, clothes and making thread as we go, which seems to be working pretty well, actually. Do a little survey of the area. Here are zombies somewhere. Oh, we got some here. Okay. Nothing in there. So we'll just close them in there. Thank you very much. We're not going to be in here long. Nope. Absolutely nothing in this house. Okay. 
Okay, so we are getting to Taylor in one. Slowly but surely, we are... Oh, we are getting there. Oh, come on, you bastards. Let's have you. Oh, I can see books in there, possibly. Oh, leveling spears, I'll take. Oh, and that was our last one broken. <laughs> Oh, we got some stuff in here. Nice. That's what I do want to do very quickly before we loot is just wash these sheets, uh, these rags, and turn them into thread. And there we go. We got a level in Taylor in. Nice. Okay. That's something. That's something. Right, let's get looting. We got a lot of stuff going on here. We got some ketchup, pepper, TV dinner cooked. Now, oh, we'll take the wine. Now, it doesn't say that it's rotten or anything, but I'm not risking it because we got weak stomach, so. Oh, herbalist amazing yes that is a resort i'll take that so now we can at least eat berries which is bloody good. oh and desert combat boots look at this look at this oh i love it i love it oh and a canteen oh yes that should hold enough water for us i think instead of having two this is a good bloody find here all right let's pop them in our backpack so we don't drink and we'll save them as a backup and this can be our primary now and we're looking in the kitchen here anything anything good a fruit cocktail i'll take oh well, the things are looking up we got all this thread on us we don't need urban area so we can actually look for trash here as well maybe a little tailoring one in here i would love i would love it so much be good to me come on lucky trait lucky trait come on did we even take lucky trait this time i can't even remember i would have thought so yeah we did mm, it's fishing magazine don't really need any of the other stuff uh we don't really need that magazine but we'll take it anyway all right let's have a little look for some trash because maybe trash we find weapons and stuff like that and we'll start foraging on the way home because yeah we are getting tired well, we didn't find anything on the way home, but that's fine. Let's put our helmet on and let's actually wash our clothes as well so we don't get panicked or, well, agitated or whatever, stress. Because we will have some zombie guts on us. Oh, this is actually classed as an urban area. Interesting. All right, let's check for some air activity, shall we? Maybe we should actually go inside because we don't want to get a cold. Oh my God, what's that? What's that activity in 28? Oh no, class four activity. Does that mean there's air activity? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Tomorrow. Let's, let's see if there's anything tomorrow. Fog. Why are we still panicked? Weather continuing expected showers, heavy rain, thunderstorm, thunderstorm imminent, two days. All right, I think that's it. We're going to have to risk it, aren't we? Oh, we are, we are freezing. That's not good. Um, let's just get to bed. Let's go to bed. We'll see you, uh, see you in the morning. Oh, sleep. Too panicked. Brilliant. Okay, there we go. Let's go to sleep. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 29. We have awoken with a nasty cold. That is not good. That is not good. Mm. So I don't think we'll be going anywhere. We can, we'll be able to get rid of the cold. That's not a problem. But don't think we're going to be going anywhere with it while we've got it. And the weather's not going to let up, is it really? Let's go and sort all this stuff out. We can live with a cold on us for the time being. We're not we're not going to go anywhere, I don't think so. Okay, we've read Herbalist. Nice. And we've read the rest of them. Okay, let's pop them down here because we will use them to start the fire. Can we, can we rip them, actually? Yes, we can. <laughs> okay, that's fine. 90 sheets to start fires because <laughs> I am the Twisted Fire starter. Uh, we are going to need some food. I did want to do a bit of foraging. Actually, you know what? We'll be fine. We've already got a cold, so what the hell does it matter? Let's do some. I want to find some trash. Probably not going to find a lot in this weather, though. But yeah, look at that. Oh, God. God, that's hideous debuffs right there. But we got nothing else to do today, so why the hell not? No, we are finding nothing. Let's just go and sit inside, I think, for the day. It's a shame, because I did want to uh, go out and do a little bit of exploring, but with a cold and this weather, it, it just ain't worth it. It ain't worth it. We're just going to be panicked inside to hell with it. Okay, so it looks like the weather, the rain stopped, so we will be able to get a little bit of a uh, little bit of foraging in by the looks. No search. Let's just go hunting. All right, so we did a little bit of foraging. We've got what do we get? A grasshopper, some tree branches. Let's make some spears with this and some dandelions. So we got a we got a fair bit. Now I'm a bit hesitant to eat this food. Ugh, actually, there's hardly any hardly anything there because I don't think there's any point in trying to get rid of this cold until the thunderstorm's been and gone. That's my plan anyway. We can eat dandelions, so that's pretty good. Well, we're panicked, but at least we're warm and dry in here. Oh, we don't actually... Oh, well, there's a spot there where we didn't get panicked. Oh, here's the thunderstorm. Okay, but it is 12 o'clock. We're going to go to bed. Hopefully we don't die of bloody pneumonia or something. But yeah, we'll see you, uh, see you tomorrow. Okay, so we have awoken. Oh, what? No! No, we've got a bloody rip in our in our poncho. No, lower torso.
Okay guys, so just started recording, we're still on day 30 and the bloody helicopter's come. <laughs> I thought it was coming tomorrow, so we're gonna have to do something about this. We've gotta get out of here now, Jesus Christ, this is not good. It's getting late as well. This is the second time this has happened to me with the helicopter. Oh, they're gonna bloody come to my base now, aren't they? Jesus. We're on the ropes here a little bit, we've got the bloody helicopter, we've got a cold. Ah, oh, it's not good, it's not good. We're in the bloody woods so we can't get away quick. Oh, okay, so we're heading out, we're heading out. Oh, jeez. What a start, what a start. <laughs> if we wait around here, then hopefully it'll draw them zombies from down near our base up here, maybe? I have gone a little bit further up the road. So it does sound like the helicopter's gone, but I feel there's going to be a lot of them at our base. I mean, we don't even have the tent. <laughs> okay, let's go and have a look what it's like down there. We might be all right. Okay, there's a... Oh, God, there's a lot of them going down there by the looks of it. Let's have a little walk down. We are tired. We are hungry, but we do have spears, so. Okay, they're not too crazy. Yeah, it looks all right, to be honest. So we'll probably get to bed, bring the bike down tomorrow, then spend a couple of days trying to get rid of this bloody cold, I think. Okay, it's half past 11. We're going to go to bed. We'll see you in the morning. <sighs> Okay, now we're on day 31, as the episode should have started. Jeez, yeah, that wasn't ideal, was it? But we'll go get our bike, and then we'll get rid of this cold. Actually, as we're going, let's chop some of these bloody trees down on the road. <laughs> and the axe is broken already. Oh, God, okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. And he walked right into them. Jeez. All right, we've dropped the bike off. We're going to need some food because we've got to be well fed. So that's fine. Have we got any fish actually going? Ah, oh, we got a small one. Let's take it. It is stale, but that's fine. Oh, we are going to have to use a lot of food, but we do have a lot of bugs, actually. We could... Yeah, let's cook them up. <laughs> let's eat them. Hopefully, this should do it. <laughs> All right, we got some lovely, lovely cooked insects. I mean, we got snails. Is that escort going, maybe? So, yeah, we're, we're, we're okay. We're okay. It is quite early in the morning, though, so we're going to need something to eat in the day. Ah, we are not looking good for bloody food. I and mean, we could plant some seeds, but yeah. I suppose we'll forage for the rest of the day. Oh yeah, we read the herbalist, didn't we? Of course. Well, that is poisonous, so we won't be eating that. What the hell is that? Oh, sage. Okay. Oh, cabbage. Look at that. Oh yes, baby. Oh, we got some nice berries here. Yes, thank you very much. More berries. All right, we're done foraging for the day. We got a fair old bit. Let's also go and clean ourselves up. Oh, we can actually got some twigs here. Okay, we are lovely and clean and a little bit tired. Okay, we have got quite a bit of... Oh, look at this. We've got eight wild berries. Oh, no, sorry. Eight sage. Okay, this should get us well fed and we should lose the cold, hopefully. Okay, so it's ten past ten. We're going to start eating this food and go to bed. Hopefully, we'll catch the broadcast. If we don't, we don't. Let's get this ketchup in us. Okay, we're full to burst in. Let's go to bed. We'll see if we can shift this cold. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, guys. Day 32. We didn't shift the cold. I think because we're sleeping outside, it's still cold. But what we're going to do is I'm going to forage again today. Hopefully, find some good stuff and give it one more night of trying. And if not, we're just going to go over to Ekron with the cold, I think. So, a foraging day. But we are getting to that next level so only level six we have a hundred percent x oh no that's just a standard xp boost isn't it oh no it's one of like our tagged skills so we should get xp boost yeah what's that from oh, i think because we started we started with foraging didn't we okay let's get on with it oh i have found a little shed here down by the bottom of the farm which could be interesting actually you know what we could do you know what we could do we could take this log burn i didn't even know this was here and put it outside our house maybe that would work we got it we got it we're very heavy but let's go let's go okay let's see if we can put this down outside our house shall we yes we can okay okay wow Brilliant, brilliant. Let's go get some stuff and get it fired up. Surely this can't burn. I mean, it's classed as an oven, but surely this can't burn. It's got 15 hours worth of fuel, so that should do us the night. All right, let's grab a little bit of scrap paper down here to fire the bad boy up. We got anything in there? Yeah, let's take the cockroach. Also carve a bowl so we can make salad. And we don't need two bowls. Okay, we got a mushroom salad. That gives us hunger 28, which is bloody good. Okay, tomorrow average temperatures, blah, 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 blah. Clear skies, cloud, that's fine. Okay, looks like that is it. Okay, so it's 10 to 10. We're going to turn this bad boy on. Let's fire her up. Okay, so we are gaining heat. Let's look, make sure we get this cockroach before it burns. So we're not cold. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So the heat is getting over here. So let's eat all of this and try and get well fed and 
Hopefully we can lose the cold. Hopefully. Let's have the mushroom salad. Lovely mushroom salad. We're well fed. Let's have the fruit cocktail. Okay, we're still well fed. Let's eat the canned peaches. Okay, we're stuffed. Let's go to bed. We'll see you in the morning. All right, it's day 33. We haven't shifted the cold. <sighs> It is, it is what it is, I suppose. We gotta, we're gonna go get some food, so, you know, we're just gonna have to go out with the cold. We'll leave all this jazz here, we don't need this. We'll keep the chipstone, actually, in case we do a bit of foraging for some more spears on the way. Yeah, let's just head towards Ekron. I mean, if we sneeze and stuff, it's gonna bring the zombies towards us, but that's actually fine. Oh, we've left our stove on. Oh, maybe we should turn that off. Save the fuel, because it's not helping us with our cold, is it? So we may as well save it. Oh no, the hunting knife's broke. <laughs> Rip, that's what we've been using to make the spears. They're not um, our chipstone, which is a bit annoying. We got a lot of bloody zeds around. But I suppose it's bringing them here from Ekron, which I'm not going to complain about. Alright, well at least we can probably get into the houses just across the road here. Why the hell is there no bloody smokes on these bastards? Okay, looks like we got a house up here. Let's go investigate. Oh, there's a shed as well. <gasps> and a generator. Okay. And a pipe wrench. Don't know how useful that's going to be, but I'll never say no to a pipe wrench. Hmm. I can't find a symbol for a generator, but we'll pop a battery down there. Because, I mean, battery is power, so that's fine. I mean, we don't know how to use the generator, but still. Okay, we got some books. Engineering will take. What does that give us? Smoke bomb, not really helpful, but neither is metalworking one or tailor in five, but we'll take it. Also, a canned potatoes, we will say. Cooking one, don't need it. And just a normal book. Brilliant. Ah, well, a short crossbow bolt will take. I mean, a is a jacket was is that going to replace anything i don't think so let's put that on then to keep us warm yeah no that didn't actually replace anything okay so that'll keep us a little bit more insulated oh baseball bat yes and fix a flat yes you know what i'm actually gonna put bat uh, nails in it high crit chance for this okay so we've actually got a fair bit down the road just by walking we're all the way well we're here so we're about halfway yeah i'm not too sure tomorrow maybe we go here pony roma yeah we gotta walk down here i'm not taking the bike it's not worth the risk you know it really isn't let's head back though okay so we got home i've washed some sheets we got 53 of them on us we're going to use that to apply it to our poncho and try and increase tailor in that way well, it's not really given as much, and we also lost the denim as well, so... Okay, it looks like we're just going to make Fred with it, to hell with it. Oh, and it's 20 to 1, so we better go to bed. Let's see if we can get ourselves some... Um, ooh, the acorns are pretty good. All right, let's see if we can get rid of it. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. We'll see you in the morning. All right, day 34. Day 34, we have not shifted this cold. We are nearly underweight again. We're not in a good way. We're not in a good way. Let's read this magazine. Let's uh, actually, you know what? Let's plant these seeds. Why not? Why the hell not? Let's just dump all that stuff there. Let's dig some furrows and plant some, car uh, some carrots. Ugh. <laughs> we don't even have enough. Uh, okay, we got to remember they're there. Let's put, this, let's put the uh, bloody hand fork there so we don't forget all right let's push up north over the road there to pony aroma and see what see what we can see up there all right we're here let's have a little look we are really up against it on this playthrough aren't we we've not had much luck at all all right looks like that's most of them anyway i'm just thinking can we i think with a mod i've got on i can craft baseball bats now they are very very good with the nails in and we're nearly at level two long blunt which i believe they count as another generator <laughs> old muffler for a motorcycle well there wasn't really anything in here is there anything further up i don't think so let's have a quick look actually let's take a board off and see if i can craft a baseball bat doesn't look like i can might have to do it with logs actually thinking about it okay okay i mean bloody hell at this rate we ain't even gonna get an ekron in the hundred days <laughs> jesus oh jesus where the hell did all these come from nothing is mightier than the spear all right, we're back home. Let's apply the fixer flat to the bike because I know one of our tires is absolutely knackered. Well, it's saying I don't have a fixer flat when I do. Oh, well, we can repair it with glue, so okay. There we go, I suppose. <laughs> Grill brush, brilliant. We don't need that. <laughs> okay, we are home, ready for bed. Let's cook up this bloody, these bloody 
critters, shall we? Put the fire out. It ain't really helping us. Is that burnt? No, it's cooked. Let's eat it. Eat the escargot. There we go. Right, we'll go to bed tomorrow. We're just going to bike it up to Equon. We can't hang around here. There's nothing here. we got to push forward. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 35. Let's go. What we're going to do anyway is move the bike onto the main road so we don't trash the tires. I mean, there's nothing really in there anyway. <laughs> um, we don't have a lot of supplies. I've got a lot of spears on me. I've got the bat with me, the spiked bat. I think we've also got another crowbar. We've got crowbar on us and also a crowbar in the bike, I think. Let's actually put this one on our back. All right, let's go. Because it's, it's going to trash the tires on here anyway. Oh, we probably should have been listening out for the helicopter, but oh well. I feel we are better equipped to take on Ek Ekron. We're not amazing, but we're, we, we're better. We have spears, we have weapons. I mean, we're underweight, I think. No, not yet. Oh, yeah, we are actually underweight. I miss the fish. But if we get to Ekron, we can fish in Phallus Lake. We will take zombies out as and when we go. Just to clear the road. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. I do want his spear with a knife on, though. Where did he go? Where did he go? I see him, the bastard. I actually put that denim shirt on because it will keep us a little bit warm. You bastard! Ah! Oh, long blunt up. Thank you. We could start doing some damage now. Bastard took a bite out of our bloody poncho, though. I know he did. Let me inspect. Yeah, right upper. Okay, we're going to have to patch that. Let's deal with this joker. Okay, so we've actually patched our shoulder, but um, no, we haven't. Okay, that's fine. We got we got denim on us, yeah, but it's dirty. Oh, let's deal with these jokers. Come on, you bastards. Okay, so we've patched up the poncho with denim. That's fine. The bat is about to die on us, though, which is not too good. But we are making progress. Still no bloody smoke, so Jesus. Okay, let's walk up there, the rest of it. Now, uh, we may as well use the last, well, the last couple of spears just to get rid of them if we're going to go bats. I think we do go bats, you know, they, they seem to be the ticket here. Yeah, we're starting to get a little bit busy, but we are getting into Ekron, which is good. So we can deal with these. That's not a problem. Hopefully, anyway. We're gonna have to take some babies. We'll get the bat out, actually. Ah, uh, no, let's use the last spear. It's got a hunting knife in it, so. There was a soldier here. Ammo pouch. So we've already got them, so we don't really need any more. Okay, maybe we have a little look in this house before we head home. We are getting tired. Oh, there's a shed here as well. Okay, let's check the barn and everything first in the shed. Brilliant. Nothing in there. And one crate in here. <laughs> All right, well, doesn't look like there's that much in there. We did get a can of tuna. I think... Yeah, it's six o'clock. Let's head back for the day. All right, so we'll leave the bike here so it is closer. We haven't got to go off roading with it. So let's get back to base. We'll search for some, let's have a look here, some firewood because I do want um, sticks to try and make, to try and be able, ah, there we go, some branches just to try and make ourselves an axe to cut down a tree to see if we can actually make a baseball bat. Because if we can, that's a game changer. A couple of stone axes. Let's get back home. Okay, so we got some logs. Can we make? Can we make a wooden bat? Yes, we can. Oh yes, look at that. And can we place some nails in it? No, we can't. That's fine. So what did I use to do that? Maybe chip stone because it won't let me carve another one. Let's try and cut another tree down. No, it won't let me. So what do we? We need what let us do it before okay we are safe and sound at home we're gonna put some denim on the rest of this stuff now that i've washed it all up no we're not because we don't have thread or something apparently there we go lovely stuff lovely stuff before we get to bed i do just want to check the old air activity tomorrow temperature is not the best hopefully it'll start warming up soon some cloud heavy cloud blah 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 warning predict start period of weather predict start a chance of snowfall okay okay that looks like it it would seem All right let's get to bed we'll see you in the morning okay day 36 we are losing health for some reason probably because we're so hungry and underweight let's open this tuna let's eat this bloody tuna now we need rip sheets now to craft more bats so let's grab that let's go and craft one before we head on out back up back up to ekron we're getting into ekron today okay carved baseball bat we are very overweight i mean do we need the crowbar probably not but 
It's fine. All right, let's go to a bike. Let's get up there. Let's not mess around. Oh, and he had beta blockers on him. I will not say no to beaties. It's a sign. It's a sign. We're taking Ekron today. Okay, so we're at this little uh, little house is where we got to yesterday. Let's go off up on foot, I think, from here and deal with them as we go. Quite nice now because behind us, our rear should be fairly clear. So the coffin will bring him to us slowly but surely, I think. Okay, our weight is actually 74. That's not good. But we will stop in at the bar because if we can get some bourbon and stuff, sorry, bourbon and stuff, we can hopefully get some cows from that. Oh, there's a lot of them there. Oh, and they're coming. <laughs> and we're overweight. Brilliant. Very heavy load, which means we'll be using stamina. Okay, we've got to be careful here. we got to drop the spear. we got to. Let's get the bat. Yeah, see, we're... Oh, no, 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 no. We're losing stamina. we got to go. we got to go. Okay, so we've rested up at the house. It looks fairly clear. So now let's just walk on up. Oh, God, yeah, look. There they are. Here they are, Jesus. Okay, that's that dealt with. This biker got any smokes on him? No. We're actually going to take this chair and put it on the road just so we have somewhere to fall back to don't sleep jesus well there's our old spear we're on a bigger and better things now though ah there goes the spiked bat okay well that's going to give us a bit more uh, less weight to carry which i'm not going to complain about i'm going to have a quick look in this mail van foraging and uh, nothing good for us shout for these guys jeez oh better take some babies Oh, we are good with the bat now. Okay, this is good. This is bloody good. We don't even need nails in it. I like the knockback of it. We have just read the Riverside map, so that's good. All right, I'm thinking maybe before we do push in to Ekron, we'll do that tomorrow because it's 20 past five, so we're going to start getting tired soon. Let's see if we can scrounge a bit of food from in one of these houses. Nothing in here. That's fine. Let's go to the next. We're not doing full loot in. We're just having a very quick look. Oh, canned vegetable soup. Okay, let's eat that. Oh, fanny pack. Yes. You love myself a fanny pack. Let's get out of here. On to the next. Ah, oh, canned corned beef. Yes. Beer. Yes, we'll take. Okay, let's not push our look. Let's get out of here. All right, we are home. We're going to check the old radio and see what that's saying. Hopefully no air activity tomorrow. We'll drink this beer because we bloody deserve it. Okay, starting the afternoon, moderate rain with chance of snowfall. That's fine. Heavy cloud cover, blah, blah, blah. Okay, it's 20 to 12. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We're going to keep on pushing up. See you then. Okay, day 37. We have awoken quite late, 20 to 11. That's not good, but we are just pushing back on up there. We've got plenty of water. Food we'll get while we're up there, hopefully. I want to get a little bit of fishing done up there if we can, but yeah, we're heading up. Okay, so we've made it to Ekron. I've actually parked just by the first house here, and I've put a hood up as well, so hopefully we don't get wet because we do have the poncho. We may as well use the most of it. Let's check these cars for any smokes or anything. <gasps> we got some bourbon. That'll be nice for calories. Okay, we're at the bar. We've dealt with them bastards. Let's see if uh, we can get in here. Any smokes, any smokes, any smokes. All right, pretty much all we got out of here was alcohol, but that's fine because that's going to give us some nice calories. Ooh, okay, we are getting through them. This is tough. So let's see if we can get a seat in here quick just to rest. Okay, well, we are up in the town there a little bit let's cough and sneeze and bring them all over to us come on you bastards i own this town now let's uh duck in one of these houses and we're gonna have to head back soon let's see if we can get some food though okay we are home we're gonna wait to 11 to catch the hold of the radio and then we're gonna drink all of this beer we have and the food and hopefully actually let's cook this popcorn while we're waiting okay we got popcorn didn't really do a lot but oh well <laughs> is what it is i suppose okay we're getting ready for the radio okay tomorrow we got temperatures minus one so it is getting warmer which is good some cloud heavy cloud light to moderate rain with a chance of snowfall okay and that's it all right well yeah let's go to bed actually let's eat all of our stuff let's see if we can get some weight going as well drink the wine drink the bourbon drink it all okay we're all stuffed so let's try and go to bed see if we can clear the cold Okay, day 38. We have not moved the cold. Now, thinking about it, I think it does have to be above a certain temperature. Can't remember what the temperature is, though. Okay, let's, 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 let's get rid of all these hunting knives. All right, let's get up Ekron for one more time in this 10 days, I think. One last time into the fray, old boy. Now, I'm going to get this spear because we may 
we may be able to get to the lake today. Maybe. Maybe. Do we have a spear? No, we have a branch though. Okay. Probably should have gone short blade. We got so many of them. Okay, we are in Ekron. Let's go. We will have a little duck in the pharmacy because we may be able to get some more baities and some antidepressants. No, nothing in here. That's fine. No, that's fine. The river. The river. If we can clear out around here, we can get some fish. Okay, well, we have got to the tip of Phallus <laughs> Lake. There is a car here. There is a lot of zombies, so we'll probably spend the day clearing this area out. How is our weight looking? 73, but it's stable. Okay. Oh, God, there's a few coming. Okay, this ain't good. This ain't good. Let's pop the baiters. Let's do it. All right, that's a lot of them taken care of. I'll tell you what we will do while we're here in close to water. We're going to rip all these sheets and make it into thread. Okay, so we have about 60, what, 67 bits of sh uh, sheet on us. So if we clean it and then rip it, we may get a nice few uh, bit of XP from that. Why can we not clean it all? Ah, oh, you can't even clean it in the... Ah, oh, God damn it. okay. Well, there goes that idea. Okay, okay, let's... Yeah, let's bring the bike up. I think we can do it, you know. Let's see if this truck has fuel while we're here. It does not. Okay, that's fine. Okay, we've done some fishing. We got quite a bit. We got a nice big bass with us. Yeah, we got some good old food here. Let's let's pop the spear back in the bike. It is quite late, <laughs> but that's fine. Let's get home. We have a food source now. Amazing, amazing. Oh no, what have we done? We bloody cut off foot or something. Oh, we scratched our leg. No, damn it. I was pressing auto walk. We shouldn't have caught any branches. That's bloody thin skin for you. Jeez. Ah, that's not good. Don't know if we've got any painkillers at home either. Always bloody something. We've probably trashed our trousers now as well then, haven't we? Oh no, maybe the poncho? Yeah, left, sh left shin. Damn it. This poncho's taking a beating. All right, well, it's bloody late, so we're going to go to bed. We're just going to go straight to bed, I think. Can we sleep? No, too panicked. Okay, that'll go, that'll go. Right, we'll go to bed. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 39. We got fog. We're in pain. We are not in a good way. Hopefully, there's no helicopter coming. Let's add some fuel, i.e. socks and the shoes. <laughs> Let's get all this fish on there. Let's also patch up our bloody poncho here we could also patch up like some of our what did we get a denim shirt as well okay so we're out of denim but we patched a few things how is taylor in oh, it's getting there it is actually getting there okay but let's let's cook this fish up have we got anything else to cook uh, no not really okay okay fish is cooked put out the fire let's see the big old bass come on oh yeah look at that Get it in yet. Why the hell are all these dandelions or whatever all over the place? I don't even know. What are they? Black sage. Provides mild, mild pain relief. Okay. That's good to know. Can we get some... Can we get calories pump in here? Yes. We have a chevron up. I'll take it. I'll take it. Let's go and wash ourselves. Actually, let's just do it in the house here. Uh, not enough water for it all. Temperature is rising. It's what? Nearly 12 degrees? That is pretty good, to be honest with you. Okay. We're all nice and clean. The poncho. Yeah. I mean, I think I do have a mod on that that allows us to repair all clothing. So... Yeah, it does put it to full health, apparently, which is quite good. I mean, do we do a little bit of foraging for the day? I don't really want to go out of base today and try and gain some weight. Yeah, let's do a bit of foraging. Well, we found absolutely nothing, which is a bit of a shame. Right, let's get the old radio on, see if we've got anything coming tomorrow. Okay, doesn't look like there's any air activity. That's fine. So we might be able to shift this cold tonight. Okay, so it's half 11. We're going to eat all the fish we can. Let's get it in us. What does that give us? Full to bursting. Okay, let's go to sleep now. Let's try to go to sleep. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 40. We have not lost the cold. <laughs> oh, when will we lose it? Let's put our food up here. Yeah, we have not lost it. That's fine, though. No, that's fine. We are gaining calories, which I do want. I want to get a nice little buffer of calories. Stats-wise, we're looking okay, you know. Cooking's, <laughs> it's cooking the highest stat nearly, yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, no, no. Foraging's a bit better. Long Blunt is getting there. We do have that Fire Axe as well. Yeah, so we're probably not going to do a lot for the rest of the day, to be honest with you. 
Okay guys, day 41, we still have our nasty cold, weight is rising, we are out of fish. I think what we're going to do today, we're going to hang around and listen to the radio and see what we've got going on. Actually, you know what, let's get up to Ekron, we've got our radio on us, that should be fine, let's turn that on actually. Okay, so it doesn't look like we've got any air activity, that's fine. I meant to check during recordings how to actually get rid of the cold. I can't really remember. Oh, God, there's a zombie. And he's so slow getting on the bike. Get out of here. So let me know in the comments what, what the actual... What you actually need to get rid of it. I thought it was f full to bursting or as f full as you can get and in a warm location. So maybe we try and get... Well, the temperature is rising, so outside should be warm enough, hopefully. Okay, we've got a few Zeds around here. Let's take care of them because we are going to have to go slow through this truck here. So we don't have any nasty surprises. Oh, yeah, I forgot we damaged our shin, didn't we? <laughs> Going through the bushes. See if we can get some gas while we stopped here from these cars. No. Maybe this truck, this truck looks in good condition. Okay, so we got a little bit of gas out of it. Not a lot, but it's enough. Okay, so we'll park the bike here because we'll do a little bit of loot and then we'll come back and finish off with some fishing, I think. Okay, so here's the rural supply store. Hopefully we can get some goodies in there. Maybe a couple of crossbow bolts or something. Uh, potato seeds. Okay, I mean, we'll take them. We'll take them. Uh, strawberry seeds. Okay, we'll take. Broccoli seeds, yeah. <sighs> oh my god. Yes, we will take that. <laughs> Do we take the army trousers? Oh, look at that. Yeah, we do. <laughs> well, no crossbow bolts, but we have got some new trousers. I don't know how I feel about them, actually. Actually, I think baggy jeans slow you down, don't they? Yeah, so we we'll probably will keep these, as these do not, but offer the same protection. Oh, wow. <laughs> we got an AK-47. Oh, and a shotgun. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, and cabbage seeds. Tent kit, I mean... Oh, yes, a crossbow bolt. Oh, yeah, we got some new pants, and they look a hell of a lot better. Um, okay, okay, so we got a few little bits. Got a few bits, not as uh, good as I was hoping. Wood glue will take, though. Okay, do, I mean, do we take the shotty out? I don't know. It's risky. Oh, my God, we got a bike. Could we get some stuff for our bike off of it, or what? Okay, let's go. And, oh, we're getting tired, so we're going to have to get out of here soon. Let's just check this van. Ah, not what we need. Let's check this bike. I mean, I don't think there's any storage on this bike, which isn't good, but it, we could salvage some bits. Oh, yeah, look at this. I mean, we can take all of this. <laughs> yeah, we can. Wow. Ah, oh, but can we, though? No, we need the bloody recipe. Jeez. Ah, oh, that's annoying. That is very annoying. What we will do, though, we will put some markers down. Put the bike there. And we've also done the hunting store and the pharmacy. Okay. Okay, this is getting too busy. Let's go. All right, let's 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 get the machete out. Um, yeah, I do want to do a bit of fishing. We are out of breath and tired. So not the best situation. No, we're not in any state. we got to go. Let's get out of here. Come on. Let's grab some food for when we get home because we are hungry. Let's take... You know what? Let's take the dog food. <laughs> it's not going to make us sad, but we ain't the happiest anyway, so... How is our weight now? We are still underweight, so we're not gaining weight anymore, but... All right, we are home sweet home. Okay, let's eat our dog food. Let's get rid of them baggy jeans. Oh, and all these seeds as well. Let's just get them planted because we don't know how long we're going to be here. Let's get them planted before we do go to bed while it's raining as well. Why not, eh? Let's get the cabbage planted. Oh, cabbage always comes through for us, doesn't it? All right, but let's eat our dog food. <laughs> Why the hell not? We'll actually get the fire going. Turn the fire on. Light fire. Scrambled paper. And we'll go to bed. We'll see if we can get rid of the cold. We might not be able to. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 42. No shifting of the cold, but I didn't think we would anyway. It's going to be a tough one to get rid of. Maybe we need some antibiotics or something, maybe. But I think what we're going to do is just do a little bit of fishing today. Have we got any water left in any of this? Yeah, let's fill our camping canteen up. Turn the radio on as well, just to make sure any air activity. Ah, and also, thank you, Anon, in the comments for letting me know when this actually lets us know about air activity. So it lets you know for the day you're on after the, after the 9 o'clock broadcast, I believe. So thank you for that. So that's why we haven't been able to see what's been coming. So hopefully in 10 minutes we'll know. Okay, so we've got showers coming. That's fine. Okay, so it doesn't look like there's any air activity. That is fine. Because air activity is the last thing you want when you want a nice relaxing day of fishing. Spear fishing at that. Ah, oh, so we can actually take the storage off. We could change it over, but we need bloody... 
we need basic mechanics. Jeez. You would have thought with him being a veteran vehicle nomad, he'd know some kind of mechanical skill, which is a little bit annoying, actually. That's maybe a little oversight with the mod, because you start with the tools, but the tools are pretty useless because we don't know how to take anything off. So, I mean, we start with free and mechanics, so you would have thought, you know, we would be able to take stuff off. That's very annoying. All right, well, let's do some fishing. Okay, so we've done fishing. We've got a hell of a lot of fish, which is good. We can actually get rid of some of this stuff, can't we? We can get rid of that. Get rid of the bolt as well. Shoes we don't really need. Machete. Mm, no, we'll wait till we got a bag attachment for that. Oh, let's get home. Okay, we are home. We've dropped off the fish. We got a lot of it. That should do us a few days, I think. But we're going to go to bed because it is 12 o'clock. And we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 43. Oh, let's turn the radio on. Being as it is 9 o'clock. See if we've got some air activity. We'll also cook this up, I think. Oh, no, let's, watch, let's listen to the radio first. Period of weather predicted start in the evening. Blah, 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 blah. Air activity detected. Okay, well, there we go. Doesn't look like we're, uh, we're hanging around. Damn it. Let's get some potatoes, open them, let's eat them. Let's get the other can as well, actually. Oh, we got beer there as well. Oh, there goes our nice little base day. <laughs> okay, so let's let's just head up towards our old base, I think. Let's get up there somewhere. Let's eat this chili as well. Okay, so we got the air activity. The helicopter is here. We're just in a little little bit of off-roading, kind of, while, uh, while we wait for it. Okay. So it sounds like it's gone. It wasn't here very long. I'm not going to complain about that. No, sir. Oh, Jesus. Come back. Oh, well, let's just get on the road here. Okay, looks like it's gone again. Okay, we are home. I did a little bit of foraging on the way home, and we did actually find ourselves some, some berries, some mushrooms, and some parsley. So we can make a salad. And I've been thinking maybe, just maybe, this might turn into our first 200 days. I mean... We're nearly halfway through and we haven't made hardly any progress of visiting the towns, even the modern towns. I mean, we're on day 43 and we've pretty much just been along here. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. See how far we get. But, I mean, it's a struggle. It is a struggle with Insanely Rare. I'm not going to lie. Okay, we've got nice, lovely mushroom salad with parsley. Because why not? <laughs> Let's get that in you. Get that in you, Barry. You old bastard. Ah, oh, we got a berry salad as well. Get that in you as well. All right, we're going to go to bed. Let's see this salad. Let's see if we can finally shift this cold. I doubt it, but we'll see. We'll see in the morning. Okay, day 44. God, we still have the cold. Oh, well, it is what it is, you know. We're used to it now. We've got all this fish. How is our weight actually dropping? Okay, well, let's cook. Let's cook this fish up. Ah, oh, it's ran out of fuel. Add the baggy jeans. There we go. Put out the fire. We didn't start the fire. And we got a level in cooking. Look at this. Look at this. Our highest skill nearly. Wow. Okay, get a get 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 a small catfish in your boy. Okay, we got a Chevy. We're gaining weight. Let's lose this bloody underweight trait for once now. I think because yeah, let's just do a bit of foraging today. All right, we didn't really find a lot, to be honest with you. What I do want to do is chop some trees down there for some more firewood. Oh, there goes the axe. All right, but it's 20 to 11. We're going to eat um, these small fish. Yeah, let's eat these. Hopefully gain a Chevy, yep. Yeah. All right, we'll go to bed tomorrow. Back to Ekron. We'll see you in the morning. All right, day 45. Wow, we have slept late. It's only 12 o'clock and it's foggy. So I don't think we will be going to Ekron today. Let's see if there's some stuff we can do around a base. Any clothes we haven't seen that we can tear up to make? Yep, to make some sheets. Also, any curtains around maybe? Nope, they don't believe in curtains in this house. Well, I suppose they're in the middle of nowhere. So what do they need to, uh, you know, curtains for, I suppose? Oh, yeah, look at this. We will not be going out in this. Bit annoying because it's a wasted day, but nothing we can do about it, really. Oh, I've got logs here as well. I'll tell you what, though, this trauma bag, what a save. I think it's a modded in bag as well. Let me just have a quick look. Uh, no, I don't think it is, actually, it would say. Hmm, interesting. Well, we have lost underweight, though, which is good. So, what the plan is, I want to get to Ekron because I want some books. We may have to clear the whole of the houses to look for some books because I was actually planning on getting books early on and then, you know, building up some skills like mechanics, tailoring. But it's been a real setback. It really has. But, you know, I guess that's the... the the price you pay for insanely rare loot so you know it is what it is really nothing we can really do about it but oh well we're so close to taylor maybe we go and have a little look around see if we can let's not waste a day yeah let's go and see if we can get some zombies or something or the ones we've killed to get some sheets something like that actually i know that there was some sheets i would like to get taylor in too can we bloody find them in this weather though that's the question cotton balls <laughs> 
really what we wanted. We are actually finding quite a bit with our helmet on and the fog. So, yeah, foraging for the win. Oh, <laughs> we're finding loads and some zombies. Oh, we got some sheets here. Nice. We may be able to do it because we've got some denim to put on our clothes and we've also got some sheets to rip. So let's get home. Yes, we've done it. We've bloody done it. All right, let's get back. Let's get back to base. Add some attachments. Happy days. Not a wasted day in the end after. That's one milestone done. Ah, the lever is at the bike. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. Nearly got another level in foraging as well, which would be nice. Oh, you watch. We won't even be able to add anything to this bag. <laughs> Imagine. Imagine. Well, I don't believe it. We actually can't. Unbelievable. We can add it to our school bag. Oh, we left our school bag. Ah, God damn it. It's just one thing after another. Well, we need a new bag then. As well as all the other stuff we need. Ah, we'll get there. We'll get there. Right, let's make a quick salad. No, let's eat some fish. See a medium perch. Ah, uh, see a small. No, let's see a medium perch. Okay, that's giving us some calories. Let's go to bed tomorrow. We are going to Ekron. Oh wow, we woke up very early on day 46. <laughs> oh, we got a salad, mushroom salad. We got any other mushrooms? On? We got yeah. Okay, okay. We got mushrooms for food. We don't need the centipede on us. Let's head on up to uh, to Ekron. Oh, we've got fog, which isn't good <laughs> at all. Just gonna take it nice and steady. Don't think there's any more wrecks on the road. All right, let's park in this car park. This will be fine. How many Zeds have we killed? 730, okay. Well, not amazing numbers, but... At least we don't have to worry about ripping their clothes anymore. Okay, so what we got here then? Oh yeah, this is the restaurant, isn't it? I shouldn't know all this, being as the last series was the 100 Days of Horde Night <laughs> in Ekron. There's the shop there. That's where we're going. There's also a hardware store here as well. Doesn't look like there's a lot in there. Can of oats, yes. Take the victories. Take the little wins. Oh, Jesus Christ. <sighs> oh, we'll take it. We'll take it. I don't think it's the one we need, but we will take it. Performance cars, I think. Oh, vegetable. That's going to be good for calories. <laughs> uh, okay, nothing else in here. So we got a few bits. We got a few little bits. I mean, this this lane's auto manual. Uh, it teaches advanced mechanics. So I think we can actually do repairs with that or at least remove parts. I think we're just going to go ahead and drink this vegetable oil. <laughs> yep, that's gave us calories, all right. See if we can get around the back or at least see what's around the back. Don't be running into an ambush, do we? Metalworking mag, we'll take it. Alright, we got any machetes or anything up here? Oh, sledgehammer. Oh, nails as well. Ah, do we want a sledgehammer? Not really, I don't think, to be honest. Hmm, not a lot in here, to be perfectly honest with you. Right, let's go up to the gas station. Oh, here we go. We're not actually getting as panicked as soon now as well. Ah, long blunt's getting there as well, which is nice. Oh, look at all of this. Yes, yes, yes. No magazines, though. Unfortunate. Oh, cigarettes. God damn it. <gasps> cigarettes. Yes. Oh, we got we got some stuff here. I mean, we'll take it. Don't really need it, but we'll take it. Oh, baseball bat. Yeah. Well, looks like we've done up here. Let's see if we can go into the residential a little bit and see and look for some bookcases. Let's mark this all off, actually. There we go. Actually, let's do these bookcases. Uh, let's do these houses the other side of the river there. All right, let's get in one of these houses. We are a little bit exhausted. We'll rest on this bench, actually. Okay, so I've actually made, hopefully, a spiked baseball bat. Yep, okay, let's use that. Oh, we got a lot of zombies and we are a little bit tired, so we've got to be careful here. Oh, maintenance up as well. Okay, now I do want to get in this house before we head back, because we are tired now. Oh, we got chips, we got chips. Hunting guide. What the hell's this? Is this for aiming? Oh yeah, it gives you XP for aiming. Ah, oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's mark that house off quickly. All right, we're home. Now, can we put attachments on the satchel? No, we cannot. Okay. Okay, so I've read the magazine. Now, it looks like we can do everything to it now. We can take stuff off. We can repair stuff. So that is good. But we can't remove the storage. So what we might do is strip everything from the other bike and put it on our bike. <laughs> Except the engine, which is probably the most important part. Then saying that, 
we've got an XP boost anyway, don't we? What we got? 125%. So we may be able to, you know, level it up. Okay, we are clean. Let us have a cigarette now. Praise the Lord, we can smoke. Also take some antidepressants now as well. We're going to need more than one dose. All right, let's read the mags for the rest of the day. Oh, we're actually at 76. Wait, bloody hell, we are. We're making it, guys. We're making it. How the turntables. That's all I can say. Okay, it's 11 o'clock. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We're going to look at improving our bike. That's the plan. We'll see you then. Okay, day 47. We're looking good. We are actually looking good now. Weight is gaining. We have food. We have smokes for the time being. We're not depressed. Yeah, we're looking good. Now, what we also want to do is try and fix. Let's make a salad for when we get a little bit hungry with our uh, mushrooms. Okay, there we go. Now, let's, yeah, try and get up there and see if we can do some work on our bike. Oh, an onion. We'll take that. Right, let's make sure we've got everything we need in. So, we've got a wrench. We've got a lug wrench. We've got a jack. Do we need a jack? We've got a tire pump. Oh, we do have the school bag still. 15, 6, 18, 65. You know what? I think we take the school bag. I think we do, you know. But it doesn't look like we've got a jack for the tires, which is very annoying. Ah, oh, yes, we can add stuff. Okay. Oh, I need a short weapon slot. Let's do it. Okay, so we got a, a side spot and a flashlight spot. We'll keep hold of the trauma bag. We'll put our drinks container on there, which is fine. That is very annoying. We don't have a jack, but let's get up there and see anyway. There isn't one in this car, is there by any chance? No, I have seen one somewhere. I just don't know where. I can't remember. <laughs> oh, we found someone with a bloody duffel bag. Oh, let's move up a little bit because it takes a while to get off the bike. Thank you very much, lady. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. Okay, we got some stuff to do when we get back to base, but that's fine. We'll leave we'll leave the Spiffo bag. We go on we're on a bigger and better things now. We're fine, we're fine. Trauma bag can go in the back though. Amazing. There's a bloody duffel bag there the whole time. Uh, 1865. That is that is nice. That is nice. Alright, let's see what we can do here. Ah yeah, we need a jack. God damn it. It's got a load of fuel in it. Oh, I'd rather have this bike, you know. Right, let's do the houses. We might be able to find some magazines. Let's not repair it just yet. I mean, let's not transfer the stuff over just yet. Oh no, the bat. Nothing there. Do you have some chips though? And wine, good for calories. Oh, they were having some kind of bloody party in here. Oh, look at all of this. Look at it all. We just needed to get into a bloody town. Now we're laughing for food. Ah, oh, do you want books though? That's the problem. <laughs> Another sledgehammer. Brilliant. Okay, let's do a couple more houses. It's getting late though. Oh, nearly at long blunt free. Once we get that, geez, we're going to be unstoppable. All right, let's go to this house. I got a good feeling about it. Yeah, we are starting to get exhausted, so we've got to be careful here. Oh, peas. Yes, dried split peas. They are good for cows. <gasps> Bookshelves, come on. Oh, yes. How to use generators. Intermediate mechanics. Commercial vehicles. We'll take it. Dance magazine. No, thank you. Okay, so we are getting a little bit tired. Let's eat some food. We are long. Let's eat... Uh, how are our calories? Seven. Okay, so let's eat some cereal. Yeah, that's bumped us up a bit. Let's... Uh, we are oh, there's a little little cupboard here okay let's get out of it yeah i think we're gonna have to do these houses you know see if we can get some leather oh look at this how to use a generator we have generator as well um oh my god this is good at least we got fuel now if we need it Whew. i would have preferred basic mechanics but i'm not gonna argue i'm not gonna moan all right so we've got home it's one o'clock we did stop off at the lake uh, sorry the well to wash ourselves okay yeah let's eat some of this before it goes off get them calories going again right let's go to bed we'll see you in the morning okay Day 48. We've got a lot of stuff on us. We've got a lot to do. It's going to be a base day. We're going to read all these lovely magazines. Get them read, Barry, old boy. we got all this food on us, which I didn't actually realise. We should have left all this in the, in, the, uh, in the bike. But we're also... I mean... Let's rip all these paper out of this. De rip all the paper. It's annoying me. It all been out all over the place. <laughs> all these magazines. We got a hundred. Oh God, put it, put it in the fire. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Yeah, we're going to go and wash all of our strips. Do a bit of 
bit of care, a bit of self-care to ourselves. Add all these backpack attachments, which is going to be lovely. Finally have them. Oh, we should probably look out for the radio as well. Oh, I can only add short weapon slots. Why is that? Oh, I can add a couple. Maybe the mod's been updated, actually. Oh, we got the broadcast. Anything coming today? Okay, so it doesn't look like we've got any air activity, which is nice. Let's turn that off then. Okay, so we've added some stuff. Doesn't look like we can put... No, okay, that is a little bit annoying that we can only add short weapons. I don't know if that's just the duffel bags. I don't think I normally upgrade the duffel bag, but it is what it is. Let's go back up to the bike because I think we left our flashlight up there and also we can drop some of this food off. Right, we got rid of the spear with the hunting knife. Oh, look at all this food we got. Let's have a little clear out, actually. Let's get rid of the fedora. We don't need all this stuff in here. Let's get rid of the vest as well. Rip in peace, but we got bloody loads of crowbars kicking around. Okay, so we've cleared that out. <laughs> look at all the stuff everywhere. Yeah, we could attach the nightstick to the short weapon, but oh, we don't really need it. It's just more weight. Now, where the hell did I put my flashlight? It's an ongoing theme, me and flashlights, isn't it? I could have sworn I put it in one of my backpacks. Maybe it's back at the back at base. Ah, oh, you bastard! Jesus Christ! God damn it! Oh, what the hell did he have a bite out of? Probably the poncho, yep. <laughs> oh, God. My Lord, that has saved us more than once. God damn it. Damn it. All to get whatever this is. Mushrooms. All right, let's get back up to the... Back up to the bike and bloody... Oh, God, there's another one here. Let's get back up to the bike and patch it up with leather. God damn it. This poncho has been a lifesaver this game. Let's patch it all up with leather. Oh, it already is. Okay. You know what? Let's do our jacket as well with leather. And our polo shirt as well to hell with it, you know? All right, let's not do any stupid mistakes again. Ah, enjoying a nice cigarette. We bloody deserve it. You deserve it, Barry. Oh, the cabbage is actually growing. Weight is gaining nicely as well. Okay, we should probably... Yes, let's eat this. It's stale. It's not rotten yet. That's fine. Probably eat half of this as well. We'll have the rest in the morning. Yeah. Okay, right. We'll go to bed. We'll see you tomorrow. All right, day 49. Let's eat the catfish. That's that gone. Let's pour this on the ground. We don't need it. Let's make a salad with mushrooms. Oh, no, we've added too much. I knew it. Why did I do it? Why did I do it? I don't know. Anyway, we're going to try and get into some more houses to look for some more books, I think. Thing is, I want to move on. We're in a good location and we're in a good position with our character, but the bike is the problem. So I want to find basic, basic mechanics to at least take the storage off and change over to the new bike. But because we don't even have a jack to change the tires. I mean, I take the a jack all basic mechanics, but hopefully the houses will find something. Foraging is nearly at, what, level six, which will be good. Oh, we never look for the bloody flashlight. I don't think we found a zombie with cigarettes on them. Okay, let's go in through this way, see what we can do here. Hand torch. We'll attach that one. If we can't find the other one, we'll take that one instead. Thank you. Oh, the toilet paper house. <laughs> oh, yes. Hilarious. <laughs> Not what we want. Now we're finding all the bloody duffel bags. Metal working will take. Vegetable oil, yes. Good for the calories. Fix a flat, yeah, even though the other one didn't seem to work. Oh, I see bookcases and chips. We got a party house. Antibiotics mm, and antidepressants. Okay, maybe we can shift this cold. Cereal, canned corn. Don't think we need any more food. Oh, long blunt upper level. Yes, please. Uh, metal working okay, we'll take it. Oh, we're gonna start getting tired, but we'll do one more house. Okay, so we've done, we're getting through the houses. We are getting through them, slowly but surely. All right, so we're home, we're at the well. We're gonna wash ourselves off. We're on 77, nice. That is nice weight. <sighs> yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there, aren't we? Let's read this stuff. Okay, it's half past 10. I mean, we've got food here to be well fed. We'll also take these antibiotics as well, and we'll try and shift the cold. I don't know if it's gonna go, but we try, we try. All right, let's go to bed. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 50. Wow, wow. Well, we didn't shift the cold. That's probably because we are slow healer as well, aren't we, actually? Yeah. Um, That's annoying. Why is the ammo pouch is glitching out? Okay, there you go. There's our bloody hand torch. Yeah, we won't be doing a lot today as it is a 10th day. 
we're we're making progress. I mean, I just don't know. I don't know. We haven't got very far in 50 days. We're always bloody against it, though. Always. Are these ready to harvest? Young cabbage, yeah. So we could actually get cabbage. Wow. We've been here that long. <laughs> but at least it's kind of like a wilderness playthrough, I suppose. But as I said, we may turn into a 200-dayer. Could do. Could do. Because it's a lot of fun to play. Even though it's been tough, it has been a lot of fun. But as always, we don't really do a lot on a 10th day anyway. Okay guys, day 51, we are getting through them. Now the plan for the next 10 days, I think is going to be to get in all these houses. Now I want to get out of Ecuador, I do want to push on to another town, but we need to repair our bike. But if we can't find the magazine we're looking for in these houses, well, we're just going to move on. So let's just crack on with it. All right, let's get the radio on just to see if we got anything coming. I have also been foraging for berries while we've been walking up here. We have got quite a lot, like 11 berries, wow. Okay, we got the broadcast, we got the helicopter today. This could change everything. Okay, it doesn't look like we got the helicopter today, which is nice. All right, let's leave the bike here. We'll go in on foot to these houses. Why the hell not? I don't want to risk banging it on one of these cars trying to get through there, to be honest. Oh, that was a few more than I was expecting up here. Jeez. Still no bloody cigarettes, though. Oh, God, there's a few of them coming here. Jeez, okay, okay. Let's calm down, calm down. I to escape out the door. But we're not having much luck so far trying to find this bloody magazine. We found a load of food, but, I mean, we don't actually need food for once. All right, let's go check out the only two-story house in Ekron. We might get lucky. There could be a few Zeds around here as well. Let's try this car for cigarettes, actually. Nope, no cigarettes in there, but a few zombies coming. Ah, electronics, not what we wanted. Ah, nope, no magazine in here. We're getting through them. We're bloody getting through them. Right, let's check the shed as well while we're in. Nothing that we really need from the shed, but is that another generator? Oh, that's a zombie. Jeez. All right, it's going to start getting late. Do you know what we do? We take this generator, and I think we put it up by the petrol station, you know. Then we got fuel. We may, we may have to move on, you know, and just come back for the bike when we find the magazine, possibly. God, it looks a bit busy up here all of a sudden, doesn't it? All right, let's get off. Let's just drop that there and finish that off tomorrow. Let's get out of here. Okay, we are home. We've brought a couple of logs up because I do want to make some more bats. We don't have any cloth, though, which is a little bit annoying, but... We can find that tomorrow. So it's 20 to 12. I think we're going to go to bed tomorrow. One last try in Ekron. If not, I think we're going to push down a Rosewood. But we'll see you in the morning. All right, day 52. We have awoken at 10 to 11. We're going to have a smoke. We better get that radio on as well. Where is it? Let's get this on. Turn on. And we should catch the broadcast. Okay, so no air activity today. That is fine by me. We do have thick fog tomorrow, though, which... Uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to get out tomorrow then with the fog. God damn it. Ah. Ah, that is annoying. What is this? This oh, this is one we've read, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Right, let's get up to the gas station. We'll fill everything up and we'll see how we get on tomorrow to move. We may find a mag, possibly. I mean, I think Rosewood's a good shout because we got the school, we got the houses, but we've also got the bookstore as well. So, yeah, the only problem is I've got some modern towns on. So you've got Pit Stop, Blackwood, and I can't remember the other one. So all all uh, directions into Rosewood are have towns now. So, um, and the main one I would probably go through is Blackwood, but that is very busy. So I'm not looking forward to that, especially in the fog. So, yeah, thinking about it, I don't think we are going to go out to Rosewood in the fog. We come into Ekron again if we need to, but I'm not risking it in uh, road to get to Rosewood in there. All right, let's get to work. Okay, we dropped the journey off. There's one joker here. Come on, you bastard. Let's have you. Oh, there's a few of them. Okay. <laughs> oh, good lord. All right, let's go do some houses over this side now then, shall we? Crowbar is good. Good durability, but I think the... Nailed baseball bat has a lot better crit chance, which is what we want, really. And this car looks in good condition. Louisville. What another Louisville map we haven't read. All right, let's go look at some of these houses then. So we haven't actually been at this side of town, so we've got to be careful because the coffin and season will draw some of the bastards to us. Short work for the trusty crowbar, though. Oh, sounds like there's a few in here. This is boarded up a lot as well. Oh, the sound like there is a bloody lot of them in here. Good 
God, there's some banging. Oh, mechanics four. Don't think we need that just yet, but we'll take it. Oh, oh, this is a survivor house. Okay. Well, we'll take the machete. What else we got in here then? I thought it might be just because of the, the amount of zombies inside, but then also also the how much it was boarded up. We'll take the beta blockers. I mean, we don't really need a Mac 10, or do we? Maybe. Yeah, we've got a pistol, so. All right, well, we've cleared this one out. Let's get out of here. Let's check the shed. Don't think we really need anything, but we'll check it anyway. You never know. Nope, nothing in there. <sighs> no magazine in there. Right, it's getting late as well. Maybe in this be good to me in this letter box. Nope, be good to me. Ugh. Let's do one more. Let's do this one down here. Let's mark these off, actually. No, let's let's get out of here. No, there's a lot of them coming. Let's go, let's go. Let's check this last mailbox. Ah, oh, oh, we'll take that, but no, not what we wanted, but we'll have it. You never know. We might find another bike in Rosewood anyway, to be fair. Oh, there's a few more there than I was expecting. There's still plenty more coming. Okay, we have our gas can full. The bike is full. Let's turn this off. We've dropped the trauma bag because I just don't think we need it, you know. Don't really need the nightstick either. Let's get rid of some of this trash we've got. Do we need two crossbows? Probably not. Or a club hammer? Probably not. We'll take the bourbon because we'll get some calories tonight. I and mean, we could just eat the split peas. Yeah, let's eat them. Gonna make a sab, but it's gonna give us them calories and it'll bump us up a little bit. Yeah, it'll get us to 80. We'll have the bourbon as well tonight, actually. The hell with it. We're celebrating. We're moving on. We can always come back and get the bike. We know where it is. All right, we've parked up. We will grab these sheets, actually, as well, because then we'll make some bats. We'll wash them up and make some, uh, yes, yeah, some nailed bats, I think. But we're always finding berries now, which is quite good, actually. We're always good for food. Oh, yes. Look at that. Level six. Wow. Okay, we are home. It is 20 to 12. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. It could be a base day if it's foggy. We'll see. We'll see. But we'll see in the morning. Okay, day 53. Yes, it is very foggy. So it probably is going to be a base day, unfortunately. But tomorrow we are moving on. Let's craft these bats we wanted. Ah, you know what else we may as well do while we're here? Drink the bloody bourbon. Why the hell not? Get it in you. If it's a base day, we may as well have a good time doing it. Just realised we didn't check the bloody radio today. <laughs> okay, we got light fog tomorrow. Okay, no air activity either. Let's turn this off. All right, it's 11 o'clock. Let's go to bed. We'll see what the weather's looking like tomorrow. We'll, uh, we'll see you then. All right, day 54. Looks like we got fog again. Ah, okay. Well, we're going to have to hold off traveling. I'm not risking it, you know. It's not worth it. Okay, so Blackwood is around here, I think. So we're going to have to go down here. And Pit Stop is here. The other town is here. So we're going to get to Ring uh, Rosewood at some point. And I think we're going to camp in here, you know. It's secure. It's walled off. Hit up all the main POIs. Yeah, I think that's the plan. we just got to clear it out. This can be a little bit busy. Maybe we drive and park down this road and then work our way up and clear it maybe we'll have to see we'll have to see but we ain't going nowhere today it's a shame i really wanted to get out and get exploring in rosewood today but well in these 10 days look at all this cabbage we got as well <laughs> we've been here that long the cabbage has grown can we not just take the well with us <laughs> no oh, we want to keep an ear out for the broadcast as well don't we well we may as well harvest them aren't we jesus 10 cabbage <laughs> maybe we try and shift the cold you know to get to sleep inside i mean we probably could then it's it doesn't i wasn't supposed to be sleeping inside but we could do a shift in this cold okay so no helicopter today anyway we are full to burst in what about if we sleep in the barn i mean it's not technically in a house let's see what the temperature's like i mean i think a barn's okay yeah you know what let's do it you gotta get rid of this bloody cold i mean it's even bloody riskier sleeping in this barn than it is you know anywhere else i would say than our current location. I mean, technically it is classes inside, but I, you know, we've, I'm, I'm gonna do it. I'm doing it. Okay, well there, there is the tent in the barn. Now uh, the fog's actually moved on, but we're gonna have to. Yeah, we should be able to click sleep here, and we should because we're clicking outside. The panic shouldn't affect us. We do have beta blockers anyway, to be fair. Weight has actually got to 78, which is bloody good. How many kills? A thousand kills. So another thousand, and we can be in it with a chance to lose the uh, to gain desensitized. But it does affect your skills, so we'll probably get it towards the end of towards the upper limit. So three thousand probably, because we're claustrophobic. All this stuff that makes us panic. 
will hinder us getting it. Okay, it's 20 past 11. We're gonna eat the cabbage. Hopefully get full to burst so we don't get panicked. Stuffed, let's have another salad. Full to burst and okay. And let's sleep in the tent. We'll see you in the morning. All right, day 55, we've shifted the cold. Oh my God, and we survived the night. Right, and it's not foggy. Let's take down the tent. Let's get the hell out of Dodge. Come on, let's do it. Oh, we finally got rid of that bastard in cold. Hallelujah. Things are looking up. Oh, and look at this guy coming and welcoming. Yeah, we don't have a cold anymore, buddy. Yeah, have some of that. So hopefully our damage and everything should be better now. Right, let's drop some of this stuff off because we do have like a, all this stuff with us. I will not put the tent kit in there, but that's fine. I'd like to get rid of the tent kit, to be honest. All right, well, let's go anyway. Let's try and get down to Rosewood. Uh, we should probably have the radio on as well for the broadcast. See if the helicopter's coming. Oh, we got heavy rain coming. Okay, so it looks like we've been blessed with no air activity. Let's turn that off. And I think we're actually going to go down this way. Oh, okay, we got someone here. Now, there is a lot of zombies, but one of them has an Alice bag by the looks of it. Oh, yes, he does. Yes! Ah, oh, this guy had an axe. We'll take that. But what we really want is this guy over here. Thank you very much, sir. Yes! Let's have a look see if we can get some leather. I can't remember if we have any in our car, in our bike. They had a leather coat, but it's wrecked. <laughs> oh, leather gloves. Uh, okay, we got four. That's that's fine. We got leather in the bike here. Can't actually remember. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, that's fine. That is big. That is big. Let's just bring the map up because I don't actually know where we are. <laughs> okay, yeah, so it looks like this is the right road to be on. Yeah, we're going to go through Blackwood though, which isn't amazing, but it's not ideal. Oh, I don't like the look of this. Oh, Jesus, there isn't even a road here we're gonna have to go down that way aren't we okay i really don't want to go through pit stop because it's so congested okay we've hit a main road which is good so let's follow that oh good lord look at all of them jeez i don't want to get involved with them oh god where are we oh no this is blackwood but we're the other side of it oh no this is not good we need to get out of here we can't actually drive through blackwood i don't think oh god oh god oh the roads are so busy well i don't actually know where the hell we are now <laughs> we're gonna have to ugh, it looks like we're gonna have to come down through pit stop we needed to be on a road down here but yeah i don't know we're not too far from the bloody our old base jesus well, at least it's quieter down this way <laughs> this is actually taking us to more I think. Yeah, we're nearly at bloody Muldra. Maybe we get a Muldra instead. Let's pull up over here somewhere. Let's camp up out here. All right, this is where we are for the time being, it looks like. All right, let's get the lever. Let's change our bags over anyway. Add a left slot for a drinks container. That's the first thing we're going to do. Can't add a weapon slot. That's fine. We'll add a flashlight instead. For now, we need more lever, I believe. We'll leave the duffel bag. We don't really need it. Oh, yes. Look at this. Okay. Uh, you know what? We could get a McCoy's or the relay station. Right, well, let's go and scope out down here. I think we are going to get tired soon. So let's go and kill these zombies down here. Put up a temporary base i think oh an axe yes okay let's um let's 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 check this car for smokes no it's locked okay okay yeah let's let's head into the forest and camp out i think we'll give it a little shout see if there's anything around no nothing comes so i think we should be okay here for the night i hope how is our weight so we're nearly at 80 this bloody backpack oh this is gonna be a lifesaver we look pretty good all in green as well just need a camp in uh the green water container okay so it's 20 to 11 we're gonna go to bed hopefully we survive the night we'll see you in the morning hopefully okay day 56 we have actually survived the night which is bloody amazing let's take down the tent and i suppose we'll try and find mccoy's really want this tent on us but we don't have a choice won't fit in our on our bike so don't actually know where mccoy's is to be honest i know roughly but worst case we do head to the relay set oh could it be up here could be up here i think it's like here i think it's there um yeah let's go this road anyway the relay station won't be a bad shout either okay yeah we got it we got it is this it here well i don't know but this might do you know instead i'm gonna clear it out but let's take the axe for a spin shall we oh yes yeah, maybe we maybe we hamp out of this construction site for a bit. It's fairly secure, I'd say. Can we drop the tent kit? Access for the win, baby. Alright, let's take some beta blockers. Calm down, calm down. Let's get what we're good at the back. Let's go and have a look in this construction site. Is it secure? I don't think I've ever been here, you know. 
Now, there is an entrance over there by the looks. If we can clear it out, I would be happy staying here for a night, I think. Okay, let's see if we can... Oh, no, we don't have... Oh, we do have Fred. Okay, let's see if we can add a weapon attachment to the bag. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. Okay, we've got two bats and our axe on us. That's good. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. Oh, did we check the radio? No. <laughs> okay. Oh, we might be able to catch it now quick. Showers, heavy rain. That's fine. Heavy rain. Chance of snowfall. Blah, blah, blah. Friendly activity. It was an air activity, so let's use this bat up. It's making us heavy. All this stuff we've got. Oh, we need to put our bloody drinks thing on as well. What is this place? I don't remember this place. I know Muldra okay. I mean, it's not, you know, I'm not amazing at Muldra, but I know the few areas. Ah, let's take some antidepressants. This depression is was so slow, but we are going to get depressed again with, of course, having the blood on us, but it's so slow with everything. It'd be okay if we had more smokes. Oh, we got more antidepressants, which I will say. Okay, let's go and clear out, make sure the construction site's clear. Let's actually go this way. Hmm, you know what we could do? We could put some log walls there, just to be safe. Yeah, shall we do that? Let's use this axe to chop some stuff. <gasps> Cigarettes. Yeah, we can build some log wall. Oh, no, look. How many can we even build? Ah, it's probably not worth it. I did see a zombie creeping around in here. Give it a shout. Let's try and get him to us. And there's one down there. Ah, let's see. There's windows in it. This is bloody risky. I mean, we could sleep in the truck, to be fair. Well, we actually found a zombie. The first zombie that had cigarettes on them. <laughs> yeah, you know what? I think we're going to sleep in the truck. There's no rules about not sleeping in vehicles. It's still pretty risky. What's the window like on it? It's in pretty good condition. Yeah, that's the play. Now maybe tomorrow we go and board the windows up around the construction site here. Okay, it's 10 past 10. Yeah, we're going to sleep in the truck. Tomorrow we'll try and push into old um, Muldra. But we'll, uh, we'll see you then if we make it. If we make it. Okay, day 57. We have survived. That's not a bad shout, sleeping in the tent there. Uh, in the truck, sorry. Right, okay, yeah. I think that's what we're going to do while we're here, just for the time being. Let's go and get our tent kit, though. Let's put the tent up here. Just leave these leather strips and thread here. We don't really need them. A little base for the time being. Well, we didn't get a rosewood. We went to we went to Bloody Mulder instead. Well, at least there's a bookstore here, and I believe a school, but it's not a very good school. Yeah, let's turn this on to make sure there's no helicopter. Oh my god, there's a lot of zombies. Okay, let's just walk up here. Let's hear the broadcast. Okay, we got heavy rain, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so it doesn't look like we got anything tomorrow, which is fine. Oh, okay, we are getting through them. Ah, so I think I've found McCoy's, which is good. Let's go and see if we can clear it out before we bring the bike up here. Is this McCoy's? I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah, it is. It is. Oh, I tell you what there is in uh, Muldra. There is the car garage, which may have the magazine as well. Okay, so we're in McCoy's. It looks fairly clear, to be fair. We need to have a smoke. Good tent up around here, couldn't we? Don't want to be a little hidden hoard somewhere. That's the problem. I reckon we could perch up there. We got water. Yeah, I think that's the play. Let's get back. All right, we've washed ourselves off. We've had a smoke, so we won't be getting depressed. Grab our tent. Grab these as well. Well, the old girl's still going strong. I suppose I've been driving bloody carefully, though, because I know she's early on her way out. But she's, she's done it. You know, we might not even need the other bike. Probably best we do, but... <laughs> well, I mean, if we can find a jack and increase our, you know, the next mechanics book then you know that does help or oh, maybe even a vhs you know we just need a generator that's doable there is the vhs store in mall draft after all isn't there okay we'll park the bike there can we get anything in in the bike that we carry in like these bloody books or a hatchet do i need three survival knives probably not do i need two crossbows probably not probably don't need a kitchen knife we don't need the shotgun shells either. Got any food on us? No. You know what? I think up in this corner would be okay. They have to maneuver for all these bloody logs to get us. We're not sneezing or coughing or anything. Yeah, I think that's good. Right, let's go and have a look up at these warehouses. Also clear some of these bastards out as well. Ah, yeah, take some baities. It's busy up here. Oh god, we're getting tired and I've just shouted. That's not good. 
Oh god, and we're exhausted as well. Okay, uh, let's walk away. We can take a couple on, no more though. Ah, well, we've got a foothold in Mulder anyway. Let's bring the map up, see what we're looking like. Okay, yeah, so I believe the garage is like here maybe or here. You've got the VHS store here and then the bookstore like here maybe. But it's a long old trip down Mulder High Street there. I'm glad we've left Ekron. I'm excited for Mulder. Okay, but it's 20 to 11. We're going to go to bed. Maybe we have the helicopters tomorrow. I don't know, but we'll see in the morning. Hopefully we'll be safe. I think we are here, but we'll see. Okay. Day 58. We're looking good. We're looking good. We don't need to put the radio on just yet. Let's get back up to them warehouses, I think. Oh, we need a smoke and we are very hungry, actually. Let's go grab some food. How is our weight looking? 78 and dropping, so maybe some high calorie stuff. I know we had some cereals somewhere. Oh, we got 10 packets of chips as well. Nice, nice. Should be able to get plenty of food in Mulder anyway, I think. And I don't think finding berries is going to be a problem either. Oh, this truck looks in good condition. That guy's got a crowbar. Don't really need a crowbar, to be honest. Don't really know what I'm expecting to find in here. A load of crates. Do we really need carpentry? Not really. Maybe we look for a new bike in the car park. Daddy and the boy. Oh, yes. No bike. Maybe cigarettes, though. Good old daddy and the boy. There's a key for a titan on the zombie and a key on the uh, on the floor there. Why not? I'll take it. I'll take it. Empty canteen. Don't know if that holds more water. We'll see. I don't mind having two actually. Or is that too crazy? Because we can't really... We're always overweight as it is. And one seems to work. Yeah, we'll get rid of that. I think one should be sufficient. Right, let's have a little look in here. And of course it's going to be all logs. We don't really need logs. We need magazines. We'll take another box of nails though. Maybe some food? Oh, let's put the radio on. Ah, I think we've missed it. Oh no, this guy's okay. Yeah, air activity would not be uh, would not be ideal. Oh, there's another water collector there. Water dispenser. Doesn't look like we got air activity. Ah, and there goes the bat. Well, at least that'll save us some weight. Let's actually use the axe. Now, what I do want to get is this water dispenser. Okay, there we go. What uh, location are we in here? Okay, food. Let's look for some food then. Or trash. Let's do a bit of foraging. All right, well, all we found was chip stone and stuff like that, so we're not going to bother. Is there a water dispenser in here, maybe? Yes, there is. Okay, well, we'll grab it, because I think we're probably going to be in Martridge. Uh, not Martridge, bloody Mulder a while. Look at that. Two of the beauties. All right, it's 10 to 11. We're gonna go to bed tomorrow we're gonna to see if the helicopter's coming if not we're gonna try and push into a little bit of Muldra. so we'll see in the morning okay day 59 we've awoken fairly early but that's fine we just gotta to remember to uh, check the radio let's have a smoke oh we got some drifters coming how is our axe skill looking? Um, us getting there, no, no, level one. Yeah, let's eat some ketchup. It's going to make us sad, but we could do with the calories. Let's take some antidepressants. we got loads of them now anyway. Well, now, being as we did find smokes on us on a zombie, it does give me some kind of hope that we'll find more. God, you need like three doses of antidepressants to actually get rid of it. And we are starting to get hot as well. There we go. We can breathe a little now. It wasn't listening to the broadcast, but we got time. We got time. Oh, air activity. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, we got to get back. All right, let's get out of here for a day. I think down this way should be fairly clear. God, there's nothing down here. All right, so I'm literally in the middle of nowhere. So hopefully this will be okay for the helicopter, but we shall see. Okay, here it comes. So I think it's on its final flyby. We seem to have been okay for Zed so far. We are tired, but it is what it is. Okay, so I think it's gone. So that's fine. It's pretty uh, not horrendous, to be honest. Let's get back home because we are tired. So glad we got rid of that bloody cold. I actually brought a few over by the looks of it. All right, it's 20 past 10. Let's get to bed. And tomorrow, well, tomorrow's another day. We'll see you then. All right. Day 60, we have survived. Probably going to wash ourselves, I think. Ah, nice and clean. Lovely and clean. Have a smoke. You deserve it, Barry. We are bloody... Whew. We're getting there. We're getting there. We haven't done any of these. Foraging's getting good. We need we need to repair our bike, don't we? That is the, uh, the issue that we're having. Complete change of plan from going to Rosewood. We've ended up in Maltra. <laughs> but I think we're okay to handle it, you know? VHSs could be a 
big win as well. And we're getting close to that two. For, well, we're getting to that 2,000. Not closer. We are getting there. So hopefully get desensitized. We'd actually lose, I think, Fear of Blood, Claustrophobic. Yeah, I think that's it. But I'll take it. I'll take it. As usual, we don't really do a lot on a 10th day. We're probably just going to hang around base, I think, and prepare for the next 10 days where we will push into Muldra. Is it going to be successful? I don't know, to be honest with you. Okay, guys, here we are, day 61. Now, it's a little bit late in the day, so I'm not sure what we're going to do. We're probably just going to hang around base, but the goal for the next 10 days is actually to get down here, get down this area, and get into the VHS store and the bookstore. That is the goal. Now, I'll take another some clothes off because we, it is warming up a little bit. So, yeah, I think we're going to try and do a little bit of foraging, I think. And then tomorrow, push down into Muldra, hopefully. No, we just gained a level in something. I think sneaking, maybe? Yeah, we got a level in sneaking. Okay, we'll take it. <laughs> oh, just got a level in axe. That is very nice. We will take that. Thank you. All right, so we've been foraging for the day. We've got a few berries. We've, what we got here? We've got six berries, so that's pretty good. We can put them in our bowl, make a salad. How is our weight looking? Uh, 78 and dropping. Okay, so, oh, we got we got chipstone here. We may as well take the XP. And I see some chips. Try and get them cows. We've got to start walking through bushes because it is wrecking our clothes. But, oh, well, it's the quickest way. We need some leather to patch up what we got as well with leather. So, yeah, from the poll, it looks like a lot of people wanted to see this turn into a 200-day series, which I am more than happy to do because I'm really enjoying this playthrough. But... We do have to survive the first 100 days. Nothing is guaranteed in Project Zomboid, as we all know. But hopefully, this should turn into a 200-day series, which is really, really looking forward to that. But on that bombshell, it's 20 to 12. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We'll push into more, just so we'll, uh, we'll see you then. Okay, day 62, we have survived the night. We are a little bit hungry, so we're probably going to make a little salad. I mean, it's very early. It's 10 to 5 in the morning, so it's probably going to be an early night tonight. But let's make this salad up. Lovely fruit salad. Only hunger 15, but they were smaller berries by the looks of it. Right, let's get that in us. All right, so we're probably going to push down into Mordra. Let's bring the old mappage up. So we're going to go down here, possibly. We're going to go on foot, I think, just to try and clear it out a little bit. See what it is. It may be... Might take us all 10 days to uh, to actually get into Maldra because it is very busy and we're past peak day now by a long way. So it's going to be interesting. Uh, we probably should have gone through McCoy's the other way, actually. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, and we got a fog coming, which isn't good, but I think we'll be okay. We're just going to take it nice and steady today. Still keeping an eye out for cigarettes, as I know they do now drop on zombies. So we'll also keep using the axe as well, because it's. Uh, I like the axe. And if we can get a couple of levels, we've got options then as well. God, this fog has really come in, hasn't it? Do have an ambulance down there, so we could get some more beta blockers, anti the God, look at them. They're coming out of the woods everywhere. Jeez. I think this is probably the safest way to do it because the high street is going to be busy. Okay, keep pushing on down. Oh, we can get a bit of leather as well, which will be nice. Two lots, apparently. Oh, look at that. 12 pieces. Well, 13 pieces. Nice. We don't actually seem to be getting as panicked from the blood as well, which is nice. I think, I don't know if that's a thing. It doesn't seem, maybe it's in my head, but it doesn't seem like we are anyway. Stress. Yeah, 14. So maybe that's starting to like work. Because I know some of the traits do kind of get less impactful the longer you survive and the more zombies you kill. Oh, we can get some leather off of this guy. Ooh, okay. Okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. I mean, we're we're getting tired and it's only 10 past 10 to 10 so yeah we're gonna we're a bit out of sync we slept in a little bit yesterday now i think we'll be okay for the helicopter for a few days as well because i believe it came on the second to the last day of the last 10 days so hopefully we should be okay we will check tomorrow though okay so we are getting down there um <laughs> slowly but surely it's a slow process but let's say you gotta do it in some boards you know you can't you can't just rush in Man, it looks like the fog's starting to clear, which is a good thing. But we're probably going to have to go home soon because we're going to start getting tired. All right, we're getting there. We're getting there. Let's have a smoke. Save us getting depressed. All right, we're getting exhausted. We're probably going to start getting tired. So let's walk on home, I think, for the day. Okay, so we're back at base. I do want to get some. What did I want to get? I can't remember. Well, we need to wash our leather. 
Ah, duct tape, yes, to repair the axe. Not going to do a lot, but it's better than nothing. Okay, there we go. Right, let's go and wash off these leather strips and hopefully put some leather stuff on our clothing, which will offer, give us more protection, which is always a good thing. How is our tailor in level, actually? Ah, uh, it's getting there, because we did read the book, didn't we? Okay, we are all levered up, which is good stuff. What else? Uh, let's make a quick salad. Okay, we're in a good spot. We've got 33 cigarettes as well. Let's have a quick look at the map. So where do we get to? Okay, so we, we're about halfway, so we're going to power through here tomorrow. Come out about here um, and hopefully, yeah, get across. We'll go through this little gap in the woods here, it seems. And go from there, really. Let's, uh, yeah, there's also some warehouses as well we can look at to hopefully get a propane tank. A mask, possibly, but yeah, we got a lot to do in Muldra. Okay, but it is 11 o'clock. We're going to have a little smoke and we're going to go to bed. So we'll, uh, we're very tired, ridiculously tired. So we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 63. We are very stressed. Let's get a smoke in us now that we got plenty of them. Should also go and see if we got any calorie food back at the bike because we are losing calories, which isn't good. We don't have fog, which is good though. Mm, we don't really have any. I mean, we, oh, can of oats. Okay, yeah, get that in you. Get that in you, Barry, old boy. Uh, we're still at a deficit, so yeah, let's, I don't know, let's take some chilli with us or something. <laughs> Alright, we've eaten our chilli, we're still at minus 250, that's fine now, and drop in, but let's get on down, get into Muldra, let's do it. Now, we are getting stressed very quickly now, because we probably have a lot of blood on us from yesterday, so yeah, this not, doesn't seem to be going, that trait, but that's fine. The axe is definitely putting in the work, I mean, we're nearly at level 2 with it, so that is bloody good. Oh, it's an ambush, but he's got a splitting axe on him. Amazing. Oh, amazing stuff. In good condition as well. Yep, we will have that. Thank you. Oh, okay. We. Oh, yeah, we should probably put the uh, walkie-talkie on, shouldn't we? Let's check it. Okay, what we got? We got rain, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so it doesn't look like anything's coming. That's fine. Let's turn that off. Let's get the axe back. Okay, looks like we're into uncharted territory here. I don't know if we're gonna, we might have to start driving down here, you know. Oh, we got a leveling axe, amazing, amazing. Will we get in today though? That is the question. Let's slowly make our way over. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna. Oh yes, there's a few of them. Let's try and disperse them. This is a fair few. Oh, okay. Oh, and the axe just broke. That's fine. We'll drop that because it has been repaired a fair few amount of time. So it's probably not going to be any good, but we have got a brand new one. Now let's get in these shops. Oh, he's got an axe in him as well. We'll have that. I actually think it's a lady. Sorry, lady. It's starting to get late, which isn't very good, but we may actually try and commandeer this van to, to take us up and down that road there. Oh, jeez. Okay. Gonna need some baities here. This is what I mean with Muldra. There's so many. Oh, and we're tired as well. This ain't good. All right. We're gonna have to go and rest somewhere because being tired means death. We've got a heavy load. See some food. Okay, so we're not actually gaining stamina because of how heavy we are. Just by standing still, we'd have to sit down. Okay. I sat down for a little bit. We are safe. Let's have a smoke again. Now, it is 20 past 7. We're going to start getting tired, so maybe we just see if we can get in that van and drive that home, possibly. Oh, yeah, look, there's still a few of them over there. Let's see if we can kite a few. Now we're tired. Let's not risk it. Let's get home. We're coming back tomorrow. Good Lord. So we finally got home, but it's 12 o'clock. Jesus, it took us ages to walk back. But we're, I've stopped off here because I do want to get some wine and some bourbon for the calories. And we're actually going to drop the axe off as well because it's just given us too much weight. All right, let's uh, drown our sorrows. Let's get this in us and see how we get on. Uh, we are absolutely hammered. <laughs> but, and it didn't even really give us that many calories. Oh, God. All right, let's go to bed. We'll carry on pushing down there tomorrow. We'll see you in the morning. All right, day 64. God, 12 o'clock we've woken up. <laughs> that is not good. We're just going to get straight on down there. We haven't got time to waste today. I don't know if I brought any... Oh, no, we don't even have any food on us. Hopefully, we can get some chips and stuff from the VHS store, though, maybe. Come on, you bastards. I'm just trying to get some VHSs. Why are you always got to be in my way? Jeez, you bastards. How many kills are we on now, actually? 1,400. Okay, so we are getting there. Desensitize. We may even get it before we leave Muldra. That would be a bloody godsend, that would. 
Okay, so we're back down at the VHS store. Let's uh, deal with these bastards. Let's take some baities now. Because we're going to need them. Yeah, there's a lot. There is a lot. Looks like we got a bloody storm coming as well. Ah, short work for old Barry Bixon and his axe. Uh, maybe we should put the poncho over us. I don't know if that affects how much rain it takes, but we don't want to get a cold again, do we? All right, well, it looks like we're here. We don't have the key for this, but we can hotwire. Ah, it's got no bloody battery. Hmm. Well, I don't think we will be using this then, will we? In good condition as well. That's a shame. Well, we got woodcraft. <laughs> Don't think that's going to be much use. Well, it was completely pointless. Oh, cigarettes, though. Yeah, other than the cigarettes, this was a complete waste of time because there is nothing down here. But let's see if we can get a car just to speed things up a little bit. We did get carpentry, but that is probably the most useless VHS we could have got. Oh, the batteries are dead on everything. Oh, because it's bloody 10 months later. Okay, so we are back home, pretty much. House is just, well, temp or tent is just here. Let's bring the map up. Let's mark that off. That is a bloody shame that we couldn't uh, get anything from in there. There we go. That's fine. Okay, so maybe we look in these industrial areas here. But yeah, because we can just go up here, can't we? That's a lot quicker. We may find our mechanics magazine. Now, the problem is that bike up here probably isn't going to have a battery but that's fine because we can change oh where are we we can put our old battery in there so that's not a problem so that's an option but i think tomorrow what we're actually going to do is a little bit of forage we don't even need this woodcraft do we really let's be honest but we're going to go back so we don't wake up too late again so we'll uh see you in the morning okay day 65 we have awoken safe and sound i'm feeling pretty good about this location you know we wrote well i shouldn't have jinxed it should i overconfidence is how how you die in zomboid but let's do a little bit of foraging today i think look for some berries also get some high try and get some high calorie food from our from our bike maybe if we look for animals we can i don't know i don't know if i've actually ever looked for animals maybe you can um animals or maybe you can find like mice and stuff which would be good for calories maybe a rabbit or something i don't know nothing really in here that's actually going to give us calories well the milk actually evaporated milk better than nothing all right let's get foraging see if we can find some animals we don't have a fire but we can make one of them i'm sure we got plenty of logs around here oh berries i mean rose hips i don't know what that is but we'll take it what is this oh potato yeah we'll have that and we are finding berries though no poisonous ones in a while how is our foraging skill looking pretty good not 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 close to the next level but that's fine let's speak of the devil we got some poisonous ones i'll switch to mushrooms because it is common here well normal actually oh let's put the radio on check for that air activity all right we got any air activity i doubt it no it doesn't look like we do which is good and the weather's getting quite bad now look at that minus 47 percent ah we got an onion all right so let's take stock of what we've got here we got some mushrooms we got some potatoes we got quite a quite a nice amount what does that do that is food okay i think that's seasoning ah broken bones okay well we don't really need that all right well let's head back we are getting exhausted and all that kind of jazz 43 smoke so that is good that is good and i think the rain rain wash mod would also wash the blood off of our clothes which is even better oh we got a potato mushroom salad with rose hip <laughs> let's eat it okay but it's half past 10 we're gonna get out of bed tomorrow tomorrow i think we are actually gonna try and push up onto here into these industrial units we may be able to find something good in there oh that pond could be good as well it's gonna be tricky getting a getting the bike there hmm. but we'll uh we'll see in the morning okay Day 66, we have awoken, safe and sound. Let's fill our water up while we're here. These have been quite a uh, quite a lifesaver, to be honest. We didn't need to put water in there. All right, now let's go and investigate over there that way to the industrial area. Oh, there is a school up here as well, isn't there, I think? Up towards the north side. Oh, nimble upper level. I would actually take that. Not that it makes that much of a difference, but we'll still have it. Right, going through here is going to be a little bit risky, I feel. Could go down through that way. Probably be better. Oh my god, we found a katana. Oh my god, yes please. Well, if there's ever a better time to use a katana, I think it's Muldra. Because we do have a couple of machetes, and this may increase our long blade quite a bit. Don't get overconfident, I know, just because you got a katana. It's probably going to be busy over here. Yep, very busy. Oh jeez. God 
down the katana slays. Jeez. Right, let's do some clearing out. Nice shop along here. We can look how many zombies there are. The katana is taking an absolute beating, but <laughs> it's worth it. Do we want a, ban a balaclava? No, nah, because it's going to start getting warmer. It is getting warmer, so... Oh, we will take this ketchup, though. Yes, please. Yeah, we're going to have to take some antidepressants to counter that, but that's fine. Yeah, we may as well clear this area out with the katana, you know. Wouldn't mind another Zed with a little cheeky katana on him. Come on, you bastards. Oh, no, it's broken. Ripping. Can we repair that, actually? No. I think you need a higher maintenance. What is our maintenance? Bloody hell. Four and a half. Jeez. How many did we kill with the katana? Let's have a look quick. 50, 51 with the katana. Nice, nice. Oh, we may be able to find a generator here as well. If we find a generator in there and a battery charger in here or something in here, maybe the magazine. <laughs> absolutely nothing by the looks of it. Nope, absolutely nothing. <laughs> well, we found a generator. Okay, that's good to know. Right, let's start marking some of this stuff off. So we've done there. We'll put the power symbol there to show there's a generator. Okay, okay. Not a lot in there either. Okay, on to the next. Okay, we're in the final one. Anything good? Not really. Paint. We could do some magazines. Ooh, take that food though. Oh, I thought we, was, I thought we found it. I thought we found it then. Okay, I have just found a pickaxe. I'm not sure if we're going to use it. I don't know. It is a bloody good weapon, especially if we, go, we are going axes. Oh, and another axe. Okay. Another antique oven. Uh, I think we should probably get back. We have got a lot of weight on us. Okay, we are home. We are home. Let's have a smoke because we are getting a little bit panicked. We need to drop off all this bloody, all these weapons we found. Now I'm thinking, do we, um, do we give her the old machete a go? We do have a space on our back. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, so our weight is a fairly heavy load. That's, that's not a problem. We can deal with that. Hmm, so maybe... Just maybe the plan is. Wouldn't mind getting to this lake here, you know. But I feel that's going to be hard to do on the bike. Still want to get to the bookstore. There's some storage units there. There's also the police station and all these houses. And also the school as well, actually. Where the hell is the school? It's got to be like here. This, this, it's near the field. So yeah, that's probably the school there. But it's 11 o'clock. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. I think we're going to keep on pushing down. So we'll see you then. Okay, day 67. We are very stressed. We could do with having a bit of rain to wash the blood off. But we also need to check the radio. We haven't done it in a while. Broadcast is coming on now. We're also going to keep pushing up into Mordor as well while that's playing. But no air activity, which is a bloody bonus. Let's actually check the battery on our bike while we're here. Well, it's charged, but it doesn't have very good condition. Let's get the old machete for a test drive, shall we? So Longblade is actually building as well. We are gaining some a fair few skills here. Kills are on 1600, which is good. Don't like walking through these bloody woods. Oh, we're not even at the right place. Oh, Jesus. Run, run. Okay, so we've come out here. Um, yeah, let's deal with these bastards. Oh, he's got a crossbow on him. Maybe we got some arrows. Oh, there's a motorbike down there. Let's go have a look at it. Machete is taking a beating. Oh, we can actually repair it, though. Oh, we did. Oh, we don't have the torch or anything. Duct tape seems to be the one. We got more of that back at the bike, I believe. The axe probably is getting better crits at the minute, but we have higher levels in that. But, you know, once we get some levels in this, the machete should be good. Oh, there's two bikes down here, but there's a bloody lot of zombies. I had an axe on him. Don't really need the axe, to be honest. We got plenty of them. Oh, we got a zippy mark as well. Okay. Oh, it looks like this bike was in a bit of a collision here. Ah, oh, long blade up. Nice, nice. So we've dealt with them bastards. Now, the machete is taking a beating. That's fine. Okay, it doesn't look like there's any storage on this bike, but it does look in good condition. So we can find the magazine in... Moldra. We don't have to go back to Ekron. It's not in the best condition, but it is better than ours. No gas in it. That's fine. Okay. Motorbike bag. Yeah. Oh no, it's got to be its own its own bag. Okay. Well, we'll put a little marker there anyway, I think. Looking for any ketchup or anything in here. I make us sad, but it's also going to give us... Jesus, look how many are in here. Oh my god. 
Mm, don't really want to fight them in there, to be honest. All right, let's push on into the shop. Right, what we got occurring in here then? Looks pretty bare. I hear a lot of zombies. Let's get out. Let's make sure it's safe. Oh, bookcase. They're in there. Ah, I didn't mean to climb through there. Damn it. God damn it. We've cut something. What is it? Oh, our left hand. Okay, that should be fine. Shouldn't affect our swing now. We're in a bit of pain, but all to get in this bookcase, which all it has is a bloody magazine. Jesus. Oh, they've broken through here. Oh, there is some magazines here as well. Beef jerky will take. I'll swing. Uh, we're not doing that much damage because we are in pain. Any smokes? Oh, yes. Do we have painkillers on us? Yes, we do. Okay. It's only a little scratch, so it shouldn't affect us too much. Uh, let's mark these bad boys off. Yeah, let's go and kill some of these bastards and see if we can get in spiffos and find some high-calorie ketchup or something. I can see stuff on the table already. Wow, we got a lot of them here. We're not doing a lot of damage either. Mm. No, I think we retreat. Yeah, I think we got a retreat here. Right, let's see if we got any duct tape while we're here, because we will, uh, wood glue, repair our duct tape, yeah. Repair our machete. So we can actually repair stuff on the bike, but we need a propane. Well, it's mainly the engine I'm worried about, so we need the, at least the next mechanics book. Mechanics 2 to get the boost. Yeah, and then maybe we can look at working on some wrecked cars around us, maybe. Okay, we are getting a bit low on beta blockers as well, which isn't good. We got an onion. We may as well eat it. Let's eat this stuff as well for some cows. It's for 76. That's not good. But it is 20 to 11. We're going to go to bed. Tomorrow, I think we're going to try and get in the bookstore. That's, that's the play here. Yeah, we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 60. Eight. Now, what we're going to do today, we woke up quite early, which is good. What we're going to do is try and get in the books that we need to start making progress. We ain't making no... Oh, and we got fog. I think it's only light, though. Yeah, we need to get in here. That's the goal for today. It's going to be slow getting down there, but we need progress. We need to take Mordra for all it's got and get the hell out of here. Move on to the next one. Well, we haven't even done two towns in nearly 70 days. <laughs> it's a lot of fun, though, this playthrough. Really enjoying it. Well, you know what, actually? The goal is just to survive the 100 days and then potentially the 200 days. So whatever progress we make, we make. If we don't, we don't, you know? Okay, so we've made it to the high street. Let's go and see how we're looking. Uh, we do have a heavy load, which is stopping us regaining stamina. Don't have any food on us either. Okay, well, here are the shops, so that's fine. Also considering getting a shotgun from the police station, but I don't know if that's a good idea in Muldra, to be honest with you. Okay, there is the bookstore, and here is a hoard. Let's deal with them. I'd probably take any book, to be honest with you. All right, let's get in here. Okay, we are in. <gasps> oh my God, yes, I think we found it. Oh my God, yes, yes, yes. Oh Jesus. Where did you come from, buddy? Okay, I think, does that is that enough? Motorcycle mechanics, that should do it, shouldn't it? Surely. All right, let's not push our luck, let's get out. Long blades then at level two. Maybe when this this machete dies, we get rid of the bat and go machetes, just because it will help with our carry capacity. Because we're not really using the bat, so do we really need it on us? Thing is, with the machete and the axe we've got, they're probably going to break fairly soon. So, all right, so we are home. Let's read this magazine and see if we can do what we want to do. Okay, that's red. Get rid of it. Let's see if we can remove this stuff now. Oh, tent storage. Oh, you are joking. Basic mechanics. Oh, for God's sake. God damn it. Okay. Well, looks like we're, uh, we're staying in Mulder then. I did want to get on, go to Ekron, and then maybe push on to Rosewood. But actually, let's bring the map up. Could come into Rosewood from the south, actually. Down here. And pit stops around here. We'll avoid that. Just come down, go past Martridge. And into Rosewood, maybe. Hmm. It's a tough one. It's a tough one. Can't believe we can't even do it with that magazine. Oh, so it allows, it gives us the recipes to make stuff. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. That's an option. So we can make the stuff, but are we going to be able to fit it? That's that's the question. <laughs> Probably not. And that's to, you can get there with tailor, oh no, metal working, sorry, tailoring. 
But then that's gonna we need level five. Yeah, we're not at level three. Maybe, maybe. But it's ten o'clock. We're probably gonna go to bed. We got any food in us? No. Okay, so we're gonna go to bed tomorrow. It's probably gonna be a base day foraging while I figure out what we're gonna do. Oh, we're very heavy load because we're very hungry. All right, let's go to bed. We'll see you in the morning. Day sixty nine. Yeah, foraging today. We're a nervous wreck. Let's have a smoke. Yeah, let's do a bit of foraging. We're not going far. And then tomorrow, I think we're going to do the plan I said. Push on to Rosewood from the south, I think. Yeah, that's the play. See if we can find some berries. That's what we're going to need. I can actually... Yeah, let's actually put our, uh, our bat away for the time being. We're very hungry. That'll give us a bit more carry weight. Oh, we should probably check for air activity as well. We'll wait till the 9 o'clock broadcast. Okay, what we got? What we got? Okay, we got light fog tomorrow. No air activity, which I am not going to complain about. Oh, long blade up. Nice. All right, let's uh, let's forage on here, see if we can find some trash. And then also, we'll have a look in this building. So, do want to wash ourselves. We could actually find a mask in here or a propane torch to repair something on the bike, at least. Yeah, this machete is nearly done for anyway, which isn't a bad thing. Served its purpose, that's for sure. Okay, we can wash ourselves here and have a little victory smoke. Oh, no, don't drop them. Jesus, no. I mean, I'd even take a bloody jack. Oh, yes. Yes. Okay, that is good. That is bloody good, actually. We just need a mask now. Now, we might get lucky with one on a zombie, maybe. Or one in one of these boxes. Sledgehammer. Mm, I can, the one thing we don't need, probably one of the... Re oh, my God, yes. Okay. All right, let's see if we can get some metal sheets and get home. So we can repair something, at least. I know that. Don't know what, but... Might also increase our mechanic skill, possibly. But we can also... Metal sheet. We can also, oh, and pipes as well we need, don't we? Bars and stuff. Um, yeah, we can also go to the laundromat in Ekron to, to dismantle the stuff to get metal sheets and increase our metal working. All right, well, let's get out of here anyway. All right, let's see what we can actually do here, shall we? Maybe the brakes. I think we got some pipes somewhere, haven't we? Let's see. I just want to see if it increases our mechanic skill. Can't actually remember. Well, I can't find the bloody pipes. I don't think we've got any. Okay, mm, I'm just trying to think. Is there a laundry place? in rosewood hmm it's a tough decision it really is but we can do go through the houses in rosewood and there's also the bookstore there yeah i think we do rosewood you know going through the south we have a propane tank and well propane torch and mask now which is really good you know if i remember back our rv nomad it was in the pretty much the same situation we trashed our rv within like the first i don't know five days maybe but it's 11 o'clock we're gonna go to bed we'll see you in the morning okay day 70 we got fog so we won't be going anywhere today we never do anything on a 10th day anyway normally we gotta wait for the broadcast and we are gonna get underweight but at Rosewood, there is the little lake down here, which we can fish. So if we kind of base up in here, which would be kind of safe. Yeah, the lake's like here near the petrol, near the fuel station. Maybe we stop off on the way through. I d it's normally quite busy down there, to be honest with you. And this road here is an absolute nightmare. So maybe we actually go along here, park up there over the fence. Yeah, we got options. There's also the school there. Yeah, I think Rose Rosewood's the play here. Right, let's get this radio on, see if we got air activity. Oh, air activity detected. Oh, okay. Okay. Right. Let's um well, you know what we gotta do? We gotta get the hell out of here. We go to our little spot we went to before. Oh, it's foggy as well. This ain't good. At least the next ten should be nice and clear for us though. Let's get on the old girl. God, I've got to get used to driving this thing again. Okay, let's grab some food and let... Oh, we got berries. Let's head off into the woods. Oh, God, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. I want that vest, though. I want that, the webbing. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, jeez. Okay, so I think the helicopter is gone. It did bring a couple to us. I don't know what it's going to be like in the woods, but let's get back anyway. Oh, my God, there's a few around. Let's get out of here. Oh, God, yeah, that's brought a few to us. Jesus, brought quite a few to us. There's the bike. Come on, let's go, let's go. Oh, she starts. Let's go. Okay, so we are home. We have survived another 10 days. So probably not going to do anything for the rest of today. Okay, guys, here we are. Day 71. Wow. Okay, so what we got to do is we're going to Rosewood. So I think we're just going to pack straight up. The weather looks okay. We're going to we're gonna come along here. Power, power all the way down this road, maybe, instead of going through Maldra. Not going to go to Pit Stop, which is along there. We're going to keep going further down along this road and come up through here. That's the plan anyway. 
<laughs> yeah, we're gonna get get to it. We are underweight now as well, which isn't ideal. We're gonna pack this tent up as well. Right, let's fill everything up for well, we'll fill the canteen up. We have washed ourselves as well. We should have enough water to be fair. Now let's get out of here. Oh, we got some zombies here. That's not ideal because we have got a big old weight on us, but we should be able to deal with them. Yep. Right, let's see if we can get this tent in anything. Doesn't look like we can. That's annoying. Right, well, let's let's take some of this food out there we go okay mm, just thinking do we put the other machete on our back because these are nearly dead yeah let's do it because it could get a little bit tasty down in rosewood there all right let's uh let's go hopefully it goes smoothly but <laughs> we'll see so it looks like the helicopter has stirred them all up actually as well so it's probably a good job we are getting out of muldra god there's loads of them yeah that helicopter definitely stir them up let's get the hell out of here all right we are out of muldra at least in one piece we did have to run over a couple of bloody zombies but we're okay okay so we're at the crossroads let's bring up the map here let's center on us where are we now i think we need to go down here i believe because that is pit stop which we don't we do not want pit stop oh no all right we're on the highway baby yeah so i think this is actually pit stop here oh god yeah so it's the outskirts of it yeah let's get the hell out of here we don't win uh, we're not tangling with pit stop not today oh no oh it's a campsite there but there's too many bloody zombies around for my liking okay so yeah i think we're we're on the right tracks so we'll go right here this should take us to rosewood past old march ridge yeah march ridge is down there we're not going to march ridge highway's pretty clear to be honest maybe the way to travel you know okay so we got signs for rosewood this is good there is the cinema by the looks of it to our right the drive-in cinema now, i do want to get into this gas station but i don't know how busy it's gonna be that road has a blockage already that's why i hate that that road that little road there oh god let's oh god let's just no we're not staying around here let's wing it we may come back down here to clear it out but we're not staying here now okay so there's the little lake that is an option for food okay so we are on the right road this this route is a hell of a lot safer than the more direct route okay so it should just be up here okay we're gonna kill the bike here deal with some zeds if we need to Okay, not too bad so far. I don't just want to jump over the fence there, so we are going to walk around it, I think, and have a look at the main gate. Oh, car battery, heavy duty. That, that is interesting, actually. Let's pop that on the floor. I do like Rosewood. I spent a lot of time here when I first started out playing PZ. Okay, so there is a few over here. There's quite a few, but that's fine. We can, we can deal with them. We're still early. Oh, yeah, this machete is not going to last much longer. And we'll probably just get rid of it when it dies. we got some pipes here as well that the zombies have kindly left for us, you bastards. So we can actually do some uh, repairs. There goes the machete. And um, we can actually do some repairs to our bike. All right, let's see what we're dealing with in here. Oh, Jesus Christ. Where the hell did they come from? What I might do, actually, is build some log some log walls there possibly that could be the play just go and inspect the rest of this area i think there's a propane tank up here as well maybe or i know there's some kind of barbecue oh yes there is perfect maybe even a water dispenser in one of these i can't actually remember well there's nothing in this little little hut thing we're not actually getting panicked that's still claustrophobic, so we must be getting used to it. So I know the effects do lessen, I believe, the longer you survive. Okay, so no water dispenser in these, but that's fine, because I know there is one at the fire station. Okay, we've got some zombies in here. We better clear them out before we sleep. Okay, we're down to our last pack of beta blockers as well, which isn't good. But we have got the pharmacy here, so... Not the pharmacy, sorry, the doctor's clinic. Rosewood Doctors. Nothing coming in behind us. Good, good, good. Well, this is our new home. Okay, so we've built one log wall. We're going to have to dismantle this. That's fine, though, because it helps with our metal working. We are very tired, so let's go and rest in this hut. Okay, I think it's safe to bring the bike up, I reckon. Okay, we brought the bike up. I'm going to grab these pipes here just so I don't forget them. Okay, so we're going to pitch up here, I think. Hopefully, this will be safe over in the corner here. What I will do is chop some trees down, though, ready for tomorrow. Because I think tomorrow what we're going to do is secure this area. Okay, so it's 10 o'clock. Uh, after chopping the trees down, no zombies came. So I think we'll probably be safe. So we're going to go to sleep and hopefully we'll survive. And tomorrow we're going to secure our little temporary base. But uh, we'll see you uh, see in the morning.
All right, day 72. What we're going to do first of all, we are going to go and wash ourselves so we don't get panic. Let's get on that straight away. Don't think there's going to be enough water in here, actually, to be honest. No, there wasn't. Okay. I can't be doing with being depressed again. We're so slow when we move stuff. There's a zombie somewhere. Oh, we got soap here. That should make it quicker. Okay, so we're, we're a little bit clean. I can hear a zombie. I just don't know where the hell he is. I don't want him sneaking up on us. Is he behind here somewhere? There he is. I see you, bastard. Ah, have some of that. All right, so we have drained the whole of the water from these buildings. What little water there was, but that's fine. Let's get the old propane torch and mask go because we will dismantle this stuff here we can actually put the sheets on the floor as well oh look at this sneaky bastard where the hell did he come from i don't even know good job we didn't get us while we were sleeping wait can we dismantle this stuff have i got to be wearing the mask doesn't want to play that side let's try this side sure you could dismantle these unless it dismantle the uh the fence so no it doesn't let us ah that's annoying okay we'll have to build up round it then jeez that is very annoying. And actually, yes, yeah, so we're going to have to build use three where we could have just used one. Okay, so that one's done. We have got some zombies coming in. We are very tired as well. Let's try and get in this house and rest up. Okay, so we've rested up. We're going to deal with these zombies in a minute. We're just going to try and get as many clean rags as I can. Okay, we got 21 rags. That might be enough. Clean rags anyway. We'll chop this tr these trees down here. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there let's ah uh, yeah let uh, i don't really want to use a splitting axe let's see if we can go and repair this with some wood glue or something actually repairs it quite a lot as well look at that it's only at full health i mean it will degrade quicker now but at least we'll have enough to uh to chop our trees all right we have done it we have walled off this area we got a load of thread on and stuff we don't need do we need this soap probably not let's get rid of it okay 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 we're looking good we're looking good let's go drop this axe off actually let's uh let's sit down and rest a little bit okay so we had two crossbows so i actually dropped one of them off as well so we don't need that we are low on food actually jesus what i want to potentially do as well though is bits of trapping we can We've got a hand fork. What we can do is dig up some worms and then go plant some bird traps. Wait, can we make stick traps <laughs> before I get this idea? No, we cannot. Okay, so we won't be doing any trapping. Brilliant. <laughs> but at least we've got a little safe haven in Rosewood, which is good. Okay, but it's half past ten. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We might have a little look, see what Rosewood's looking like. But uh, we'll see you, uh, see you in the morning. Okay, guys, day 73. What we're going to try and do today is push up to to the fire station get the water dispenser out of there i think and see if we can get any food while we're going so that's the plan let's see how we get on now ah looks like we got a welcome party already come on you bastards we all right so i think we can actually go over that way now when we come to rosewood i think i think it'll be safe famous last words i know but we'll see okay there's the fire station don't look too busy there's some around here but we'll make short work of them Okay, we're at the fire station. I can see a bike. Doesn't look like it has any storage on it. And there's a few Zeds down there, but we'll see how we get on. Okay, that's them dealt with. Happy days. Now, I think we did pick the key up for this bike. <gasps> An axe. We're going to take it, you know. And we'll actually take this duct tape and repair this axe now. All right, let's check this bike, see how it's looking. Oh, my God, it's in perfect condition. Moto bag left. Mm. We could craft these potentially but we'll need Taylor and five and also yeah our bike can have three containers where it looks like that one. Oh my god there's another axe there but right, let's get in and out of this fire station don't want to hang around in here to be honest i want to get this and get out of here for the day okay can we jump over this with this heavy load we'll see ah oh, no i don't think we can ah oh, damn it okay oh and i hear zombies oh god they're coming they're coming oh jesus where the hell did this guy come from Okay, we're back at base. We're going to put the water dispenser down here because we're not going to be able to lift it over the fence, I doubt. So that's fine. All right, let's have a little look at some foraging. What can we actually get here? Urban area. Well, let's just give it a go anyway, just for a little bit, see what we can find. No, we didn't find anything. Oh, well. Oh, what's this I found? A cooler. <laughs> oh, we don't really need that. That's pretty good. Oh, my Lord. Look at all this we're finding. Saw, some nails. I don't really need any of it, but it's still pretty cool. Toilet roll. What else are we going to find? A plate. Nice. All right, but it's 10 past 11. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. I'm not too sure yet. I'm not too sure. Maybe we go and have a look at some of these houses because food is drastically low before we tackle the police station. But we'll see. We'll, uh, we'll see how we feel. We'll see in the morning. 
Okay, day 74. We better have something to eat because we are getting a little bit hungry. I don't know what we're going to do about these calories. I did. Oh, you know what? You know what? Oh, I don't know. It's risky. I was going to say we could go and do some fishing, but it's busy down there. We could cut across though, couldn't we? We could drive down to that house and then walk across, but oh, it's risky. It is risky. We do need calories though. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's just check this mailbox while we are here. Oh, damn, have we run out of beta blockers? Damn, I think we have. Oh, that's not good. Ah, oh, and there goes the axe. Right, let's get rid of that. Give us some weight. I swear we had more beta blockers. I guess not. Right, let's grab our spear. Clear the zombies out. Uh, actually, we might be all right. Okay, there's the river. So it's actually a pretty clear path down here. Let's deal with these zombies over here. All right, so I've given it a little shout. Now, that's to drill all the zombies around the area to us. So hopefully now we might be able to fish in peace. Or not. Okay, so we've done some fishing. We've got, we haven't got an amazing amount, but we've got enough. So we're actually going to uh, leave the spear here. And let's go back. Actually, now let's stay fishing a little bit longer, you know. Okay, we got to load now. Let's put these socks. Oh, and I can hear a zombie right when we're very overweight. Brilliant. And we're tired. Let's get out of here. Hopefully we'll lose them in the bush. There is a lot of zombies following us, but if we can get away. So not in any condition of fight, really. We'll go over the fence. That'll slow them down. All right, we made it to the bike. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Mission complete. Are we going to be able to get over the fence here? I don't know. No. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Bloody hell, there's a lot of zombies. Them chairs. We'll rest on the chairs. It's our only option. Oh, he stood on them all. Thank you very much, sir. Oh, that was a bit touch and go. Okay, we've rested. We're not really recovering any because we're so tired. Let's see if we can get over the fence here. Yeah, okay, that's fine. We'll go get our fish tomorrow. What I did want to do as well is make another spear. All right, let's go to bed. Was oh, I've cut myself. How have I cut myself? On what? What have I cut myself on? Ah, my right hand. Ah, damn it. Okay, that's going to slow our swing speed down. Okay, okay. Well, it is what it is. Let's drop these fish off here to have a smoke. We deserve it after all that carnage. Right, let's go to bed. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 75. We are bloody hungry. We got all these spears on us. Right, what we need to do, what we need to do. Well, that needs to go in there for a start. What we need to do is go and get our fish, clear the zombies out, have some food, have some antidepressants, maybe clean ourselves up. I don't know. No, let's just, let's just smoke. <laughs> we need to get scrap paper to make a fire. What is it to make a fire again? Twig or sheet of paper? Well, we got loads of sheets of paper. I can hear a zombie banging on something. Hey, buddy, get off my wall, you bastard. Jesus Christ. Oh, we got a load of paper somewhere. And we got logs as well, so we're fine, we're fine. God, we are struggling to get over this bloody wall. All right, we're very weak, so we need to have some kind of food. All right, we got candy on us, so <laughs> eat some of that. Spears can go back in the bloody bike. Why the hell have we got them on us? We should. Oh, now we're, now we're too exhausted. <laughs> God damn it, there's always something. Just want to eat my fish. That's it. Can we do it? Can we do it? Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay. Okay, I think we'll put our fire here. Lovely. We've dropped some paper down to start it with when we need to. We'll chuck... Get that catfish on there. We will chuck these logs on for fuel. 12 hours for two logs, nice. All right, let's go get the rest of our fish. We do have, well, I imagine we have a hole in our in our gloves. So we need to keep an eye out for some new gloves. We could patch it, but I mean, it would do nothing. So we can't go fighting with our right hand. Oh, it's actually still pretty quick, but I still don't want to go fighting any zombies while our hand is injured. Oh, look at all this food. Right, let's cook it up. And let's get some calories going. Oh, lovely. Look at it all right. Put out fire. Put out fire. Don't burn it. Look at this. Look at this. Amazing. Right, let's get a. Uh, let's get the biggest catfish in us. What the hell not? Oh, look at that. Get in. We need more. We need more. Eat another catfish. Eat a big perch. Oh, 3,600 calories. That is good. Look at that. We're gaining. We're gaining weight. Oh, what a meal we've had. Bloody hell. Oh, let's listen out for the broadcast, actually. I mean, it's a bit too late if it's coming today. Oh, we got thunderstorm coming in three days. That's not good. But no air activity. That's fine. Okay, but it's 10 past 11. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. Hmm. You know what? I think we might go fishing again just to get a stockpile. And then we're, you know, we're happy days. And yeah, we don't have anything in trapping, so we can't make any trap. Fishing's nearly at another level, which would be good. But yeah, I think fishing, just so we have a stockpile, we need to sort these calories out. We really do. But we'll go to bed. We'll see you in the morning.
Okay, day 76. Calories are still pumping. That's fine. Let's take a little uh, small... No, let's see the small bass now. Nice, nice, nice. Right, let's get on. Yeah, we're going to go do a bit more fishing, I think. Oh, look at all of these. Jeez, let's get the axe on them. All right, that's them dealt with. The axe is the way forward, I think. <laughs> And this machete is all right, but it just doesn't do the damage we need. Let's check it on the bike. We'll axe it from now on, I think. Let's check air activity as well. Thunderstorms in two days. Okay, that's fine. Okay, no air activity by the looks, which is good. Okay, we've washed ourselves. Let's get to fishing. Okay, we've got a good old haul. Nice, nice haul here. Let's drop this and leave this here, I think. They're easy enough to make. Right, let's get out of here. Any zombies waiting for us? Doesn't look like it. The bike has stalled, but that's fine. We'll get off here. Hopefully, we can get over the fence with this stuff on us. I think we'll be able to. <sighs> no, we can't. All right, let's drop half of it. Should be able to now. Yeah. Well, we're not going to cook these up yet because they'll spoil quicker. So we can leave it there till they're, I suppose, stale, and then we cook them. Let's go get our other, our other fish. All right, we are home. We have fish. We have fish in a fire. Fish on the floor, fish everywhere. I love it. Right, let's eat some of this. Are we gaining weight? 73. We'll see if we gain any weight overnight. But it's 10 to 11. We're going to get a bed. Tomorrow, we're going to have to check for our activity. But if it's all good, we're going to push into Rosewood. So we'll uh, see you in the morning. Okay, day 77. We're all good. Weight is still at 73. But I think we were at 72 for a while, weren't we? So that's good. Right, let's push on into Rosewood. Maybe clear out the fire station. See if we can get some more axes and things like that. And possibly even the police station as well. Because there is another uh, water dispenser in there, I believe. And it is on the way to the bookstore. Which is one of the main reasons we come here. Wait a minute. Where the hell is our water dispenser? Didn't I put it down here? I'm sure I did to have have water when we when we were leaving unless the bloody zombies destroyed it god damn it i think they've destroyed it am i just being stupid or did i drop it up here somewhere oh let's go and have a little look i think a bloody zombies destroyed it you bastards ah right we're gonna have to go to the police station now all right is it safe to jump over this fence well we're doing it anyway oh yeah, it is. Let's go and start on the police station and to hell with it. God, look at him. Oh my God, that guy's got a massive backpack on though. We'll be going for that. Right, let's try and kite that guy with a massive backpack. There he is, look. Look at it. Never seen that before. And also, we've just gone over the 2,000 kills. So, any time now, we should be able to get a decent size. 3,000, we get it automatically, I think. God, the fire axe is so good. Keep an eye out for gloves, actually tactical gloves um well they got a hole in them but so have ours and they offer better protection so we're gonna actually wear them gi duffel bag ah doesn't look that good actually 30 25 i don't think it is 30 20 no <laughs> okay well we don't want that oh look at them all around here come on you bastards let's have ya oh look at this i'm trying to sneak up it's got an m16 on him with ammo mm. as tempting as it is it's too it's too risky we're probably at another level, near enough for that, a level for... Ah, uh, yeah, we are nearly at level three axe. Nice. All right, should we duck in and out and get the water dispenser? Ah, we got a lot on us. Let's get out of here. We need to drop this. They are attacking it as well. Get off it, you bastards. Okay, we've regained our stamina. Let's pick it up. Let's go. So we're going to get it over this fence. Is it going to let us jump with it? Ah, no, it's not. Okay, let's just drop... Oh, God, 41. That weighs 30. We ain't going to get over there, are we? Let's put it in the house to hell with it. There we go. That's fine. Fill it up. Let's unbarricade this as well. Right, we're back at base. How's our weight? Look, it's still 73. I don't understand why we can't get two chevrons going up. I don't know. Is it... Something to do with our traits, maybe? I'm not sure. But we're going to have a sunfish anyway. And another sunfish. Okay, it's heavy rain, but it's 20 degrees. So we're not in no risk of getting a cold, which is nice. But it's 10 past 11. We're going to get to bed tomorrow. We're going to keep on pushing a rosewood. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 78. We've woken up at 20 past 8. I've just realized we have now become desensitized. I don't know if that was there yesterday. I don't remember, but I've noticed it today. So we are desensitized, which is bloody amazing. We can uh, we can go to town now. Absolutely. Two fast. 1,120 kills got us there. Nice, nice. So we've actually lost claustrophobic as well. And fear of blood. Oh my god, this... This is amazing. This is a game changer. This is where the real game begins. That is bloody amazing. We can save on our smokes now. Oh, desensitized, baby. Let's go kill some bastards. God, this is a horrible weather. Hey, hey, I'm desensitized. Bring it on, you bastards. 
I don't care about your blood anymore. Or you need any beta blockers. I actually seem to be doing less damage with the axe since we've become desensitized. All right, let's get in the fire station for the broadcast, and we'll see if we can find any good stuff in here as well. Ah, oh, look, we can just go in buildings now. We don't have to worry about being claustrophobic. Ah, oh, we're still going to stay in the tent. We're not going to sleep in beds, but, you know, it's still nice. All right, we got the broadcast. What's this saying? Anything? No air activity. That's what we like to see. I can hear zombies in here, but that's fine. We can deal with them. Oh, we can come and dismantle this stuff in here, though, when it's time. It's nice being inside without the throbbing noise. Jeez. It's another sledgehammer. So many sledgehammers this run. That's so that's so weird because it's, everything's insanely rare except bloody sledgehammers. Jesus, he made me jump. Okay, we've done the fire station. That's fine. Let's actually mark that off. There we go. We could push up to the school as well, you know. Yeah, let's push to the school instead of the bookstore. I feel that's going to be the path of least resistance, to be honest. Okay, well, the school's in sight. I'm actually going to go up this way and try and go in the side there, because we can get straight to the library that way. Okay, we are exhausted from running over the fences there. So, oh, the zombies. Let's try and rest in this car if we can. We have been in worse predicament, so I'm not worried. Oh, cigarettes. Yes. All right, we're on 87. That should be fine. Let's get in and out. Okay, I think it's this window here, maybe, or that one, possibly. Oh, I nearly jumped through there then without removing the glass. God damn it. Okay, nothing. Oh, fishing. We'll t Wait, do we need fishing? No. Well, we will do. We'll take it. <gasps> Mechanics 2. Yes. Yes. Okay, okay. Getting somewhere. Mechanics 3. Yes, we'll take it. Okay, so no magazine. But now that we can read mechanics, we can do some little bits on the cars just to gain the levels. Okay, we are home. Let's, 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 let's... Let's go in here just to read the book, just in case. I don't think we can get a car. I mean, we're only a little bit. We're only wet. We're not, like, drenched or anything. So let's read mechanics. Okay, it's half past 11. We are very hungry. Um, are we starving? No, very hungry. Okay, that's fine. We're going to have a base day tomorrow anyway. We'll cook up some fish. God, we can't see nothing. Yeah, we'll cook up some fish. We'll finish mechanics. And we'll try and do repair something on the bike, maybe. But uh, we'll see you uh, We'll see you in the morning. Okay. Day 79, yeah, look, our calories are dropping. I haven't been looking at them. We're at 74, though, but let's cook all this lovely fish up. Okay, fish is cooked. Let's eat, uh, God, look at that, 141. Jesus, 102. Let's eat the small stuff. Uh, actually, no, let's have something big. Let's have the big perch. Oh, God, look how many calories that gave us. Jesus, okay. All right, let's finish mechanics. Yeah, we should probably listen for air activity as well. We do not want the helicopter in this weather. Okay, so it doesn't look like air activity. That is fine by me. Let's finish reading. Okay, we finished reading that. Let's rip it up. Drop that there. That's fine. Are we hungry? Yes, but we're okay for calories. Right, oh, this light is empty. Think we have more, do we? Do we have matches or something? Oh, God, no, we don't. Okay, let's go and have a look at the in the bikes. If not, we'll have to fill that back up. Thought we had more matches or something. Oh, yeah, we we, get, we do, we do. Let's move this bike a little bit further up here and we'll see if we can repair anything. I want to see if it increases our mechanic skill, to be honest. Okay, so we can repair the suspension. Can we repair the brakes? No. That's fine, though. Suspension or the muffler. Yeah, maybe uh, potential repair 25%. Probably the suspension, then. That does 50 metal pipe. Okay, let's have a look, then. So what is our mechanic skill on? XP 1079. Let's see. Okay, so that does increase it. Okay, okay. Okay, so we need small metal sheets. That's fine okay what can we repair duct tape we could repair the muffler should we have a look okay so tomorrow what we're gonna do let's get rid of these ramen noodles jesus i mean they're pretty pointless even having them on us we are very low on food as well um okay wait can we repair our satchels so they hold more yeah we duct tape or screws wood glue this is just this is just crazy i mean basic mechanics we can't even take our tent off Okay, so we've done the old uninstall and reinstall, and it seems to have actually given us a bit of XP. Now, we could do with a jack, but we will fill our tires up as well. Okay, so we are going there, because when we get to the next level, we can actually, we can repair and we can remove. Okay, that's what we want. And then once the engine's up and running, I'll feel a hell of a lot better. Oh, wire, we can repair the battery as well. Okay, a lot to, a lot to ponder on. What I did want to try and do with this duct tape is repair some seats that's normally a good one in cars for 
increase in mechanics early on. Let's go and see if we can do it on these wrecks down here. I don't think... We couldn't repair our seat. Oh, oh no, we can't. But we can uninstall and reinstall. That's what we'll do. Okay, so in a day, we've got like half a level, so that's fine. We can probably get there tomorrow. Oh, a maintenance nearly up a level. Nice. Okay, so we're actually looking pretty good. Pretty good, to be honest. How is our weight? We're looking very good, actually. We're 75, so we're going to lose underweight soon. Okay, but it's 11, 11 o'clock. We're going to go to bed. We'll uh, see you tomorrow. Okay, day 80. Wow, we are there. Right, we're getting to that level today. We don't normally do a lot on the 10th day, but I want to get that level of mechanics. Well, I think we can do it. We get the wrench as well. We can start taking stuff off, off of the cars down the road there as well. All right, let's grab our wrench. Oh, we've done it. We've done it. Wow, wow. We have done it. Mechanics 4, amazing. Right, let's get the radio on just to make sure there is no air activity. And we'll actually take some engine parts from here while we're here. One engine part, happy days. <laughs> okay, didn't look like our activity, fine by me. Let's go and see what one engine part will do to our to our bike. Do have the overhauled vehicle mechanics mod on. Now I know vanilla repairs it like 1%, but I believe this mod repairs it a little bit more, maybe five or 10, which is fine by me. Okay, well we're on 30%, let's repair, see what it gives us. Please give me 5% or something. Ugh, it gives me 1%. Okay, well, that's that's not too good, to be honest with you. But, well, at least it's something, I suppose. So we're going to have to keep a wrench with us now. Can we put that on our belt? Yeah, put it on our belt. Okay, but we're making, we're making progress, which is good. I think a higher mechanics will increase it more. We should probably read the next book as well if we're going to be messing around with engines. So we're just going to read this for the rest of the day, I think. So that's probably going to be it for the day. Okay, guys, we have awoken on day 81. We're looking bloody good. Now, what I do want to do, we don't want to miss the air activity because it probably is due. I also want to finish this mechanics book. So that's probably what we're going to do for today. We're very hungry. This has all gone stale as well, which isn't ideal. So we're probably going to need some more food at some point as well. But yeah, what we're going to do is just finish this book at least for the next hour. All right, let's see if we've got any air activity today. Hopefully not, because I do want to get out and about. All right, here we go. Here we go. Okay, so we've got good weather, which is good. Okay, so it doesn't look like we've got air activity. That is nice. That's very nice, actually. I think once we do get air activity, I think what we're going to do... It's probably run down here on foot, I think. Okay, so we just finished mechanics. Let's just chuck that there for wastage. Now, what I want to do is get up into Rosewood, dismantle some engines. That is the goal for today. We're going to go on foot and also see if we can get any food from the houses and stuff. So we'll probably go down this way on the way to the school again. I think I remember seeing a couple of cars there. There's also the cars in the school car park. So we'll head up that way. Yeah, because we want to get some repairs done on the bike now that we can actually repair our engine. We'll hit up a couple of houses as we go as well, as I say, just to keep an eye out for some food. Well, nothing in this house. Ah, oh, having desensitized is so nice. Oh, we got a level in axe. Nice, nice. We'll probably get another level in maintenance soon as well. Yeah, very soon. Oh, we got a bookcase. Uh, nothing we really need in there. We're looking for food, though. Well, and of course, the... Basic Mechanics magazine. Oh, a couple of bookcases. We got anything? <gasps> oh, my God. We've actually got it. Oh, my God. We've got it. We've got it. We've done it. We've done it. That is amazing. That is bloody amazing. I can't believe we finally found it. So we could go all the way back to Ekron and change our bike. But I think we repair it now, you know. <laughs> all that and we finally... But by the time we actually found it... We can just bloody repair it anyway. Okay, well, we're not being too lucky with food, so let's let's try one more house, and then if not, we'll just power power up to the car to get the engine part. <gasps> maple syrup, yes. All right, so we got a little bit out of there. We got some pineapple, and we also got the maple syrup, of course. So let's let's push on up to the cars. Oh, he's got some leather gloves that have no holes in. We're gonna wear them. Over, over our tactical gloves. Medium Alice pack, what have we got? Medium Alice pack, okay. Okay, we're back at the school car park. We got any zombies following it? Yeah, we got one here. Let's deal with this bastard. Oh, we can't take him from there. We need mechanics five. Okay, so we can only take him from what? Probably standard vehicles. Damn it. Oh, maintenance up though. Well, that's a little annoying. So it's standard vehicles and it'll be heavy duty for level five. Ah, probably six for sports vehicles. All right, so back at base, we're going to read this book finally, this magazine. Ah, oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Right, let's get rid of that. Let's see what we can do now. Let's pick all this stuff up. And we can actually repair our fuel tank. 
I mean, the fuel tank's okay. Let's let's repair the suspension again. Okay, there we go. Oh, we can actually uninstall stuff. Ah, it's amazing. Oh, leather strips. We can repair the storage boxes. The ones on the side. Okay. Okay. Interesting. So we need leather, but we also need engine parts. All right, it's 11 o'clock. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We're going to push it to the fire station with the welding mass, the welding torch, hopefully dismount some stuff, get our metal working up, and hopefully find some engine parts as well that we can take. But we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 82. We're just eating some pike. Not all of it, a little bit of it. Let's get rid of that just to uh, take our hunger away. Now, we're going to go up to the fire department with our welding mask and torch, dismount some stuff, and hopefully find ourselves some engine parts. Oh, Jesus, there's a lot there. Let's get them out in the open here. Okay, let's see if we can take the engine parts from this bike. Take engine parts. Yep, okay, let's do it. Rip in peace. Just wondering if we can put... We could probably put the suspension and everything on, but we don't have a bloody jack. Okay, well, we got a car there that looks in pretty good condition that we'll take the engine parts from. Okay, so we got 29% on this one. It'll do. Oh, we didn't listen to it for air activity. That's not good. All right, let's get the radio on. Ooh, okay, no air activity, luckily. We've got to be careful, that, because it's due any day now. Well, there's a couple of cars here that looks like we can get engine parts from, which is nice. Maybe some cigarettes as well. Okay, so far we've got 21 engine parts, which is pretty nice. Okay, so we've got 26 engine parts. So, I mean, what are we on? We was on, what, 31%? So this will at least get us to 50% of the engine, which is good. We're going to drop this axe because it's about to die. Because we do have this one with us as well. Okay, so we've got some small metal sheets from dismantling. We've also got some leather. Okay, let's get back, see what we can do now. I'll tell you what, though, having desensitized is so nice. And our metal working is increasing very fast as well. Oh, we got leveling metal working. Thank you. Right, let's see what we can do here. Right, let's repair the engine. So it's on 31. How many p engine parts do we have? 26. Okay. Oh, 57. And it gives a lot of mechanics. That is bloody good. We can repair our brakes. They're what we need to do as well. Small metal sheet. Yeah, let's do it. Amazing stuff. Amazing. Look, we're doing it. We're doing it. All right. Well, very successful day anyway. How are our calories looking? 77. Okay. Okay. That's good. Yes, yeah, so our engine is, is getting there. It's getting there. The whole bike is, to be honest. Okay, so we are out of out of fish as well. Oh, no, we got a little bit left. Should probably read metal work in for the rest of the day. Okay, so it's half past 11. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 83. Let's get the broadcast on. We do not want to be missing that today because I tell you, it's due. That helicopter's due. Okay, we got the broadcast. What we say and what we say. All personnel, temporary communication failure, East Exclusion Zone. Okay, didn't know that we got air activity. Perfect. Okay, so what I wouldn't mind doing is I want to finish, I think it's metal working we're reading, but then also maybe a little bit of foraging as well, just to have some food that aren't high in calories. We'll put our maple syrup in here. Yeah, let's get down a little bit of foraging all right we're finding some berries this is nice 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 what the hell is this thing we found a caterpillar uh no we don't want a caterpillar and we are getting to another level in foraging as well all right we are home and what a haul we have got look at this 12 berries tomato a leek oh lovely stuff Oh, look at this. Vegetable salad. Get that in your barry, old boy. How are our calories and our weight looking? 78 and rice. Once we get to 80, I'll be happy. I'll be happy. Okay, so it's 11 o'clock. We're going to have a smoke. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We might try and push up to the mechanic shop to try and look for a jack. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll, uh, we'll see in the morning. Okay, so we've awoken on day 84 very early in the morning, actually. We're going to hang around just to see if the helicopter is coming. Okay, so we got the broadcast. What we got? What we got? I got a feeling we're going to have the helicopter today. Although, I have had that feeling. Oh, oh no. Oh, is that air activity? Oh, air activity detected. Yeah, we got it. Okay, right. We got berries. Let's fill our water up. We're going to just go into, over into that field where we was uh, foraging yesterday. Oh, I forgot we opened the door, didn't we? Right, let's go. Let's not mess around, let's go. And go as far away as we can on foot. We don't want to be over here. Jeez, okay. Um, let's go down here a little bit. Oh, yeah, I know where we are. Okay, yeah, let's hang around here. See if we can get some engine parts, actually. Could we wait it out in this house? This little hut. Generator, brilliant. Well, what about in here? 
I mean, there's no, there's no windows, so maybe. Ah, and a light is out of gas. That's not good. Okay, here's the helicopter. Let's see if we can hide in here. Sounds like it's doing flyby, so I don't think it spotted us. And it's actually gone. <laughs> wow. Okay. Brilliant. Do we want to take the generator? No. Let's let's mark it on the map so we know it's here. I mean, I'm sure we'll find another one in Rosewood, but just in case. Go. Yeah, right. Let's head. Let's head home. Bit anticlimactic, but oh well. Okay. So our weight has leveled off at 78. So maybe we do a bit of fishing tomorrow. We test out the new and improved bike and get down to our little fishing spot. Yeah, I think we do that. And then the following day, we will push up to the mechanic shop, I promise. Okay, well, we've made it home, all safe and sound. Oh, yes, let's get, let's get a new lighter. I and mean, we do have gas to refill it, but I don't really see the point if we have a lighter. They're a bit low though, aren't they? Um, Let's keep them in there. Let's, yeah, let's, oh, we've got a full lighter there, that'll do. That'll do, pig. Get rid of that empty one, because we can, once we're down at one light, we can just keep refilling it, it's not a problem. Okay, so we just finished off the last bit of metal working, which is nice. Let's have a little smoke. You deserve it, Barry. What a, what a way we've come. What a journey it's been so far. We're not doing too bad on the skills either, you know. Mechanics is close to another level. And then we can take engine parts from everything. Yeah, wow. Wow, I'm looking forward to another 100 days because we're now at a position where we are fairly powerful. Well, you know, you can't be overconfident in projects on wood. But, you know, we're desensitized. We can fix our bike. We're looking good. So we can tackle, attack and tackle the, the modded town as well so it's 11 o'clock we're gonna go to bed tomorrow we're gonna go do a bit of fishing we'll see you in the morning okay day 85 looking good 9 a.m ain't gonna worry about the helicopter because that ain't coming because we had it yesterday so let's get some salad going i mean i'm just thinking do we even need these ammo pouches we're not really they're just adding weight to us and we don't really keep anything in them yeah so it does actually drop it quite a bit so we're actually gonna get rid of them right let's go down to our watering hole and get ourselves some fish on the new and improved bike. Oh, she purrs. She purrs. Just a bit worried about the tires. We need a jack. That's what we need. Let's clear them out for when we come back up here. I think we left the spear down there, didn't we? I believe so. Let's move the bike down closer because we could have some uh, zombies trying to follow us on the way back up. All right, let's get down there. Ah, yes, here's our spear. All right, let's get fishing. Okay, so it's 8 o'clock. We've got a fairly good haul. Yeah, we got quite a bit, actually. We've also got some shoes, which we can rip into clothing. I never knew you could do that, rip it into leather. Is that new? I don't know. But let's drop our spear. We have gained a level in fishing as well, which is nice. I think ripping the shoes into leather is from a mod, to be honest with you. All right, we are home. Let's actually have a look at while we're here. Maybe repairing another part of our backpack on our on our storage even. Yeah, I mean, so it is, it is 79 now. It's also be increasing our tailoring maybe. Yeah, tailoring is only at level three. And our mechanics, nice, nice. Good stuff, good stuff. Oh, but we got all this bloody fish. Let me get over the fence. I think we'll be able to. Yeah, look at that. We have got a reef fishing free. Now what I want to do, I want to cook fish as I go. So we'll do these two and the crappy i think we'll get them fired up ah nice campfire nice evening campfire 10 past 10 cooking ourselves some fish oh put it out put it out don't let it burn didn't really do a lot calorie wise but we'll have some berries as well now we are still losing calories what else can we cook sunfish and a small catfish as well okay let's eat these not really going to give us much just level us off maybe we could eat the syrup as well okay so anyway, well we are still struggling with bloody with calories oh well right well, let's have a smoke we'll go to bed tomorrow we're pushing up we can stop off in the supermarket as well we might better find some cereals some dried beans stuff like that which will help but we will see you in the morning okay day 86 let's 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 i think we're gonna drive up there you know we're gonna bike it up there why not we'll also stop off at the other bike see what the battery's like and if we can put it in our bike now that the old girl's got some some life in her again i don't feel too bad taking her around town right, let's have a little look at this okay so it does have some good condition i wonder if we could take the muffler let's uninstall it See, I don't think we'll be able to fit this on, you know. No, we can't. That's fine, that's fine. I didn't think so. We should be able to take the battery, though, because I believe that's just classed as a car battery. Yeah, see, just car battery. So the suspension and brakes are all the same. So we could take stuff like that, but we don't have a bloody jack. Yeah, car battery, get it in, 75%. Okay, and it's got 80% remaining. Nice, nice, nice. Let's drop that down. All right, let's go up on foot, I think. Ah, good old Mama McFudgentons. You know what, I should have brought the welding mask because we need small sheets, don't we, to repair to repair our brake pads. Oh, there's another water dispenser in there. Oh, level and sprinting will take. 
more cigarettes. Look at this. We got 78 of the bastards now. That'll do us. That will do us. Right, we get any good food from here? Oh, candy, chips, yes. Hunting magazine. Ooh, we can make a trap box. Uh, we'll take it. We'll take it. I'd like a stick trap. But beggars can't be choosers. We got Rosewood Medical. We don't actually need any from, from in there. Maybe some antidepressants we take, but we do have like three packets. Get anything good in here that we need? Take fishing full. Hunting guide. What's this do then? Oh yeah, that's for uh for aiming, isn't it? We don't really need that. Foraging free. Doomsday preppers. Craft metal crossbow. Oh, Craft wooden crossbow bolt. That's what we need. Ah, so you can craft wooden ones then. Okay, so we got a fair few items. Some good, some useful stuff. I actually nearly gained a level in strength. <laughs> I don't think I've actually ever gained a level in strength. Or fitness. Oh, look at all these cars. Let's try and clear this out a little bit. God, we made short work of them. <laughs> oh, 78 on the engine. Let's take that. Right, let's see if we can get some high cal stuff in the old supermarket. Oh, peanut butter. Yes, eat that. Okay, so we got a few bits. This place is by no means completely cleared, but I want to get back. I want to repair our bike a little bit more and also read these magazines and look at making crossbow bolts. But we have got a load of food that we can restock our bike up with now. Plus our calories from the peanut butter, so we should be gaining... Yeah, I want to get to like 81, 82, something like that. I mean, we may as well do the work on the engine while we're here, to be honest. So we're on 57, let's repair. Oh, 65, and we gained a level. So now we should be able to take it from heavy-duty cars. Let's have a look. Yes, we can amazing and it's probably going to repair it more as well okay, how many parts we got eight parts what we're we on 65 73 okay so 65 eight. oh so it is only one percent still but it don't matter because it's working it's working all right let's fire the bad boy up let's go oh nice new battery nice engine repair look at her she's flying wait oh careful oh my god look at all these maybe we should deal with these all right let's put some of this stuff away all this tin food, which will be good for if we get into us, find ourselves in a pinch. I also want to put, there's all the propane stuff. I want to put that in the, in the bikes. We may do a little bit of welding up there or a little bit of dismantling. Let's fill it up first though. Actually, let's just bring this down here instead of having it up here. Okay, so Doomsday Prepper can craft wooden crossbow, craft metal crossbow, can craft wooden crossbow bolts. Okay, let's just have a little look then. Well, sturdy stick and chip stone. Let's actually try that. Three sturdy sticks, three chip stone. Right, let's go grab that chip stone, see what we're dealing with. Uh, no. <laughs> it doesn't. Okay, well, that is uh, pointless then. I suppose it's for the little crossbows. Do we really need a crossbow though, to be honest? Probably not. Oh, well, at least we had a look. These are still fresh, so we don't actually need to cook them up just yet. Okay, but it's 10 o'clock. We did a little bit of trapping. We're going to we're gonna have a lollipop. Why the hell not? We're going to have a smoke, and then we're going to go to bed, and then we're going to push back up to the mechanic shop. So we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 87. Let's eat some candy. Weight is at 79. It's bloody good. We got a bit of rain, but that don't worry me. I was going to get rid of the pepper, but it actually takes 10 hunger off. So it's actually worth keeping just in case. All right, let's hit the road. All right, let's park up here. We will check all of these as well because we may get lucky and find a jack. I mean, there's a few cars here, so surely one of them will have a jack. Oh, we found a jack. Okay, okay, that's good. That's good. Oh, thank God. Okay, so we have a hell of a lot of engine parts as well. We've got 19 there and 18 there, plus the jack. Oh, amazing. Let's repair this engine. 100%. 100%, baby. We still have 10 engine parts left. We don't actually need them. Do want to put our jack in there, though. Get rid of the soap. We don't need that anymore. Okay, let's push up a little bit, because why not? We might be able to find something in the uh, mechanics place. There's some zombies here, but we can deal with them bastards. Right, let's see if there's anything in here. It looks pretty bare, to be honest. So, good job we did find the jack already. Oh, we've got one of them. 
Let's take it. Okay, so there wasn't really anything up here, but that's fine because, well, we got a new seat, but we got the jack anyway. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get back down there and start changing some bits over. Okay, let's get everything we need. we got to be careful because we could get uh, the zombies could ambush us here. So we just got to be cautious. So this is all on 73, 67, 88, 88. Yeah, so this is all a hell of a lot better. We'll take this off, uninstall. Oh, I don't think we can put them on there. Let's see if we can put the brake pads on. They just, yeah, they're just normal brake pads. Okay. Ah, no, we can't. Okay. Okay, what's the suspension like on this? 88, we're having it. Okay, so what can we actually repair these with? Fix a flat. Glue. Wood glue. How about the seat? Yeah, let's uninstall that and put the new one on. Oh, yes. Well, we're getting there. We're getting there. Let's do a little bit of dismantling. Just, let's actually, let's put all this stuff away. Let's see if we can get some pipes in the fire station here, just so we can repair our muffler. Okay, so we've got three small metal sheets. That's nice. And two metal pipes. Okay, we can probably do something with this. Yes, we can. Okay, small metal sheet. Let's do it. Oh, look at that. And we can do stuff to our storage as well. Yes. Looking good. What have we got in here now? 25 in that one, 33, 32 in that one, 25 in that one. Okay, so not amazing, but you know what? We'll take it. Don't need the wrench on us anymore because our engine is fully fixed. Got some metal pipes there just in case, I suppose. How is our mechanic skill now? It's getting there. It's getting there. So is our metal working. Right, we are home. Let's just fill our torch up. We'll also move that over to there. No, we can't. There's a zombie coming. Come on. Oh, she was in here. All right, let's go back. We're going to read read some books, I think. Also make a salad. How's our fish looking? Still fresh. Wow, okay. Box of screws. I think we need that. We can repair something with that. Don't know what, but we'll have a look tomorrow. <laughs> okay, but it's 11 o'clock. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. Probably read in and see what we can do with these screws. So we'll uh, see you in the morning. Okay, day 88. Wow, look at this weather. Wow. Okay, let's go see what we can repair with these screws. I'm sure there was something. Maybe maybe a storage container on the bike there, possibly. Oh, yeah, we can actually repair the side bits. It really give us a lot, but it's worth it. Six screws. How many screws have we got? 64. We could probably get this all up to 100%. Okay, so we've done it. So they're up to 87 each. It actually gives us what? Still only 25 in there. All right, let's go read for the rest of the day. Get rid of them screws to hell with it. Uh, let's get rid of some of these smokes on us as well. Because we don't need 75 now that we don't need them so often. Okay, 13. Yeah, 13 will do. Okay, so we finished trapping. It's nice. What can we do with trapping, actually, now that we've read that magazine? Okay, so we can make a box. Oh, we can't because we don't have any levels in trapping. Um, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Weight is at 79, so I wouldn't mind getting it up a little bit. Um, small perches, medium bass. Yeah, let's kick the medium bass up. There we go. Get that in your boy. There we go. That's that's pumping us. Well, that should hopefully get us to 80. Okay, but it's 10 past 11. We're going to have a smoke. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. I think it's going to be another base day. Probably finish reading Fishing Free. Wait, can we read Fishing Free? Yeah. Okay, yeah, we'll read Fishing Free. Yeah, that'd be nice. And we'll also check for the air activity. It's probably on its way around again, maybe. But uh, we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 89. We are good. We are good. We're not... Uh, we don't have that much food around, but we got all this fish. So let's cook these up to do us for the day. There we go. Put that out. Put out the fire barrel, boy. This actually gives us quite a bit of hunger. Let's eat a full for that. That'll do us. We'll keep that on us. Right, let's read fishing. Actually, let's check the radio. Okay, so we got good weather by the looks of it tomorrow, which is good. We got air activity today, though. No, we do not. It's fine by me. Okay, so it's half past nine. We've just finished reading fishing, which is nice. That's that done with. We are very hungry. Let's eat this perch and probably this small pike as well. But yeah, nice children. It's 20 past 10. Just a little base day today. We are getting to the... Oh, we just hit 80 weight as well, which is good. We are getting to the point now where we're going to be moving on from Rosewood. But we'll have a look what our plan is tomorrow. But for now, we're going to get to bed. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 90. We've woken up at 20 past 6. Not ideal. Let's bring this old map up. Okay, yeah. So you got Blackwood here. you got Pit Stop here. And I can never remember what this one's called. But you got another one there. So it's about time we moved on i think but we'll mark that off because we've done the garage that's fine is there anything else we need to do around here probably not school's pretty much done book naked is done we've got oh maybe maybe the laundromat's there i can't remember i cannot remember let me know in the comments is there a laundromat in rosewood i cannot remember so maybe we push in a blackwood over the next 10 days we're probably still going to have to camp out in rosewood i think 
but yeah, we'll have to see, won't we? We'll see. We will listen to the radio today, just in case. How many batteries do we have? Oh, we got three. That's fine. Why is duct tape in there? I have no idea. I have no idea. Okay, well, we got the broadcast anyway. Okay, we got good weather by the looks. The skies. Okay, so it doesn't look like we got air activity. No. So yeah, well, day 90. We've uh, we've come a long way. We nearly hit the first of the milestone, which is 100 days. But I am going to run this this one for 200 days because I am really enjoying it. And we've got loads more to see. We've got to see all the add-on towns and everything like that. But we're probably not going to do a lot for the rest of the day, as we never really do on a 10th day. Okay, guys, so we are back. Day 91. Wow. Wow. Day 91. We're nearly there. 100 days. 100 days coming up very soon. Now, what we're going to do for these 10 days, maybe push into Blackwood. Maybe. We could slowly start to drive up here and see what it's all about. Possibly. Possibly. First things first, we do need to get some food. And I have been hearing some zombies around. So we're going to go and clear clear around this area. Weight is looking bloody good. We're on 81. And our calories are still pumping. I mean, let's, 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 let's. Uh, yeah, let's start eating some of this bloody old trash here. I mean, it's not going to do a lot. But let's just try and start clearing out our bike here. We may as well eat it as opposed to throwing it on the floor as well. Haven't we? Uh, we'll eat the ramens as well. Why the hell not? It's going to make us sad, but we got antidepressants. Okay, let's have a little walk around the perimeter. Nothing too crazy today, I don't think. I do want to see if we got air activity as well. Oh yeah, we got some jokers here. I thought I heard them. Let's take care of them. Easy work. Easy work for old Barry. All right, so we cleared all these bastards out from around our base. We do want to listen to see if we've got air activity. I'm thinking maybe actually we push into Rosewood and just see if we can find any any goodies while we're up there before we do push into Blackwood, maybe. Yeah, I think we'll do that. See if we can get some food. We've got the radio anyway. Let's see if we've got any air activity. I don't think we will today, but you never know. Okay, so we've got light rain. That's not a problem. Okay, so have we got any air, air activity? Let's see, let's see. It doesn't look like it. That's nice. That is nice. Okay. Let's get the old axe out. Let's push into Rosewood, I think. What I'm really looking for is just some odd bits of food. What we will do as well, we'll fill our canteen up with toilet water as we are here. Why the hell not? Dog food. Uh, we'll take it, you know. We do have a generator, which will be quite nice because we can take that. Ah, oh, and small metal sheets. Yes, we'll have them as well. We will come back for this generator because we'll take it up to the fuel station. Maybe that's a job for tomorrow, actually. Oh, God, where the hell did all these come from? They're all hiding in the bloody trees. Come on, you bastards. All right, that's them taken care of. Let's have a look in this house, see if we got anything. Basic mechanics. We found two of them in bloody Rosewood. Should have come here all along. I would actually open a spaghetti and eat it, I think. There is also actually... A, oh, is that a aiming book? Yes, but for levels three to four, okay. Um, yeah, so there is actually a, book, a VHS store in pit stop as well which we could potentially get get some nice vhs's but do we really need them you know do we need them that's the question oh no i've just realized we've got a hole in our bloody boots that's not good uh, oh no wait no we haven't no we haven't okay they are a little bit damaged but they don't have a hole in which is good oh cereal yes we will take that Evaporated milk, yeah. Okay, so we've done a we've done a fair few houses. Let's just have a look. We'll mark this one off as well. There we go. So what we'll actually do is get the generator, go back to base, and tomorrow we will push up to the up into the gas station. Got some locals followed us back. Get the hell out of it, you bastards. Maybe we look at cooking that last bit of fish up as well, I think, because we are, I mean, we're 81, so we've got to be a little bit careful. But, you know, we'll, we'll cook it up. We'll cook it up. Oh, we've only got a small perch and a couple of bait fish anyway, so not a lot. Oh, they had turned stale as well, so cooking them should make them fresh, I think. No, still stale. Okay. Oh, that's good to know, I suppose. Yeah, we're a little bit depressed, but that's fine. Let's have a smoke. Maybe that'll sort us out. Uh, a little bit, a little bit. We'll take some antidepressants. Why the hell not? we got plenty of them. Okay, I think for the rest of the day, it's still early. We will go and have a look what we can do with these small metal sheets on our bike. We may be able to, may be able to repair something on there. And actually, maybe get a level in mechanics and metal working. Ah, the tyres. The tyres are the issue. I mean, we could repair our fuel tank, because then it'll hold more, or it saves it longer. I can't actually remember. Yeah, I think we do our fuel tank. Yeah, so it does increase the capacity, but then also it doesn't drain as fast, I believe. 
Okay, that's fine. 90%. I'm happy with that. Oh, look, we found a bloody football. Nice. Well, we'll discard that. 36 XP. That's not bad. What is our foraging? So we are nearly... Oh, look at all this. Oh, wow. Probably don't need any more screws or anything or any of this. But it's still good. Getting them levels up. Okay, but it's 12 o'clock. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. Yeah, we're going to go have a look at the gas station. Hopefully get the generator up there and go from there, really. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 92. We got a little bit of rain. That's fine. Let's have a little smoke and then we'll eat the last bit of this perch as well. There we go. Right, let's push up to the fuel station. Now, it could be a little bit tricky because we've got to have the generator in our hands. I don't think we'll be able to put it in anywhere on the bike. But hopefully we will be okay. We'll have a look, see we can put it somewhere on the bike. No, this ain't going nowhere. Okay, well, let's try and drive it there. If it's busy, we'll, we'll abort, but we'll have a look. Do we have a second seat on this? No. Oh, she absolutely purrs now. We've got to be careful for air activity as well. Right, I think what we'll do is we'll leave the generator here. We'll go up on foot. We'll also check for air activity as well. Because that's the last thing we want, to get caught with our pants down up at the fuel station with a helicopter coming. Okay, here we go. How are we looking? Okay, so we've got some winds, blah, 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 blah. Oh, it's moderate rain, not a problem. Okay, any air activity? Doesn't look like it. Nope, that's fine by me. Okay, let's go up on foot then with the old axe. Okay, so it didn't look too bad up here, to be honest with you. But actually driving through the gas, through the mechanics store there as well. Looks fairly clear. Well, looks like we got a lot of them. Let's have a little look inside quick. See if we can get a little bit of food as well. What VHS have we got? Anything good? No. Okay, let's go get the bike and bring the generator up as well. Okay, we dropped the generator off. Let's connect it. Okay, let's actually refill our lighter as well. So I don't forget. Okay, the bike is refueled. Let's turn that off. Let's go and see what else we can get in this gas station. Got a big old jerry can there. A bit too big, I think, though. Oh, take the chips. We'll actually take the cigarettes as well. All right, let's have a look upstairs. Oh, look at all this. Yes, please. Oh, leather gloves. Don't we have holes in ours? No, we don't. Okay, that's fine. You know what we could do, actually? We could take these curtains and put them on. Put them on the little hut near us. So when the helicopter does come, we can just duck in there. Oh, there's only one pair of curtains here. <laughs> well, we've pretty much cleared this out. Okay, so I'm happy with what we've accomplished today. So let's head back. We've got fuel. A constant supply of fuel. And this will probably be our little checkpoint area anyway. Because all the other ex mod uh, map expansions... Uh, map mods are within the area of rosewood anyway so okay home sweet home we will go and put the sheet up not that it's really going to uh, do enough but it's something i suppose tomorrow maybe we go foraging tomorrow we're okay on calories so we could do with a little you know like some berries to make a salad that would be ideal we are building up our food supply again i don't know why there's an axe in there we should probably keep that on us actually yeah we're in a bloody good position i'm really happy with where we are we're so close to 100 days i mean you know I'd, uh, normally i'd be thinking of oh, the wards the end of the series but we will be doing a 200 of this one so yeah we're halfway there i suppose but it's 11 o'clock we're gonna go to bed tomorrow yeah foraging i think tomorrow we'll uh well we'll see you in the morning okay Day 93. Wow, wow. 10 past 6 in the morning, a little bit early. We'll take the mat, the helmet off if we are foraging today. What we'll do is we'll forage towards where we hid from the helicopter last time. Uh, because then if we do get the air activity, we're close to, uh, to uh, hiding from it. Yeah, old Barry, look at him. Look at him. He's an absolute machine with his axe now. How are our skills? Nice, nice. I mean, cooking's really high. <laughs> Okay, it's nine o'clock. Let's get the old radio on, see if we do have air activity. We have got a few berries as well. Four fresh berries. Not amazing, but it's something. Okay, so it doesn't look like we've got air activity. That is fine by me. Okay, looks like a day of foraging. Oh, a lime. Yes, please. Okay, so we are home. We've had not a bad haul, to be fair. We've got, you know, ten berries, a couple of mushrooms. Let's make a... Let's make a salad. There we go. Look at that. Let's get that in us. There we are actually losing weight now, but that's fine. We're on 81. I, I can live with that for a little bit. So I think tomorrow we're going to push up just a little bit into Blackwood just to see what it's all about and assess the situation. Also, maybe look at basing up somewhere at the fuel station. I don't know if we can get on the roof there, but that's that's the plan. Okay, but it's half past 11. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We will, of course, check for our activity, but if not, we're pushing up into Blackwood. We'll see you in the morning.
Okay, day 94. Happy days. Before we do go out, let's make a salad. I do want to check the radio as well. Okay, we got the radio. What's it saying? What's it saying? All right, we got clear skies. That's fine. We got air activity. Do we have air activity? Come on, be good to us. Be good to us. Doesn't look like we have. Perfect. Right, let's push up. Okay, so I'm at the gas station. Doesn't look like we can actually get on the roof here, which is a shame. I would have liked to have based up there. We could maybe build outside. Let's go have a look upstairs. Ah, oh, you know, we could sledgehammer through. Oh, I can't remember where the hell all them... <gasps> Maple syrup? How did I miss that? I can't remember where the bloody sledgehammers were now. Jeez. Let's try and build out the door here. Out the window, sorry. So I know people are saying you could build, but I'm not sure if you can. No, you can't. Look, we'll not let you. We'll have to rethink that one. We'll have to keep an eye out for us. Where the hell was the sledgehammer? I cannot remember. Uh, I think we're actually going to drink that maple syrup because we could do with the calories. All right, let's go up on foot, I think. Now we are starting to get warm, so maybe we have to... I mean, the denim, the bloody denim shirt is ripped to hell anyway. Let's take that off. And probably, nah, I don't know. And we'll wear the poncho over shoulder head down. Yeah, now this crossroads is normally busy at the best of times without the map mods. Not too sure how far it is up here. Now we could go and look at this farmhouse actually. If it's still here. Probably the helmet that's making us hot as well. I mean, it is 21 degrees. That's pretty hot. Oh, look, we got bikes here as well. Yeah, we may have to take the jacket off. Oh, we're a bit exposed on our arms though, aren't we? Okay, so the farmhouse is up there. Now, I know these bikes, we're not going to be of any use to us. We won't be able to take the tires off them. I mean, this one's pretty cool, but it's not really any use. Okay, this looks promising. Looks like we can actually get on the roof there, possibly. Let's go and clear it out inside, see what we can find. Got a couple of sinks in here as well, so water shouldn't be a problem. Ah, we'd see, we, we could do with some new shoes, because ours are damaged and i don't want us to get a hole in it we're gonna wear them we're gonna wear them it's annoying but we've got to get rid of the combat boots and yeah, we've got loads of sinks and stuff in here we could also do a bit of metal working as well okay so it doesn't actually look like we can stand on that which is a little bit annoying mm, not too sure then let's have a little look a little bit further up because we got whatever that is there some kind of farming cow trough thing or something ah, was there a sledgehammer in the fire station i can't remember right we're back at the bike we're gonna go home we're gonna stop off at the fire station because i know we saw a, a few sledgehammers but I, I should probably go back and look at the footage but <laughs> we'll stop at the fire station and see if there's one in there and if there is then we're laughing all right we're at the fire station let's have a quick look about see i feel we found one in rosewood somewhere Yes, we did. Okay, okay. That's good. We got a plan. We got a plan. Oh, well, Sledgehammer did come in useful in the end. Okay, we're going to park the bike here because we're going to go back up there tomorrow with the sledge and smash through that wall. And then we can camp upstairs. At least it's a little bit safer. It's technically outside, so... But it's going to be a little bit safer because that is going to be a very high populated area up there. We have still also got to be careful for air activity as well. Okay, but it is half past 11. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We're going to go back up and do some alterations to hopefully move up there. But we'll uh, we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 95. We're going to start the day off by getting a lovely old salad in us. We're in a bit of pain, but that's because we slipped on our tent. Now, let's get up to that farmhouse, smash a wall down, and build a floor. we got a busy old day. Oh, air activity. Can't forget that. That wouldn't be good. Okay, we got clear skies. That's all fine. Okay, period of weather expected. Showers and all heavy rain. Any air activity? No, it doesn't look like there is. Okay, we can get stuff done today then. Okay, we have arrived. Let's get smashing. Let's destroy here. Okay, we can actually drop the sledge now because we don't... You know what? We could actually destroy the stairs. Oh, I'll tell you what we do want to bloody destroy. We want to destroy these bloody awful things here. Okay, so we've built our little platform. That will do us for the time being. Okay. Let's go and give it a shout downstairs, see if we can clear the area out a little bit before we head home. Let's also see what's in the shed over here. 
Oh, we do have a generator. Interesting. Okay, okay. Let's just pop that over here so we don't forget about it. Okay, how is our weight looking? Probably, yeah, we are losing weight. Right, let's, 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 let's head home. Right, what I also want to do now as well is just have a look about taking this tent off because if we can keep our tent here, I will do, to save on our weight, but then also as an emergency. Yes, that actually gives us a tent. Yeah, okay, okay, happy days, happy days. Put our water dispenser out here. I think tomorrow we are going to actually go and do some fishing because our calories are low. And then the day after, we'll get a good supply of fish and the day after we will we'll, we'll move on up. Okay, it's 20, 20 to 11. We're going to have a little smoke and then we're going to go to bed. And tomorrow, yeah, fishing. So we'll, uh, we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 96. We've awoken fairly early. We're not going to go down there until we know if the, we got air activity today or not. You know what? I think we can actually put this axe, our second axe here, away because, are we, you know, we, we'll know in advance if we're going to need it. Oh, we can't put it anywhere. Jeez. Okay, it's nine o'clock. Let's see if we've got air activity. Hopefully not, because I do want to get some fishing done. Okay, how are we looking? Some cloud, blah, blah, blah. Okay, here we go. We got air activity? No, we do not. Okay, okay. Okay, let's get down. There. Oh, let's deal with this bastard first, though. Okay, so we have fished all the abundance out of here. That is fine by me. Let's drop the spear. What did we get? Oh, we got a we got a nice old haul here. This should do us for a while. Okay, we are home. We don't really need these bottles of water. Let's try and get as much fish in here as we can. Yeah, okay. Well, that's, that's summon. We'll put the rest of it down here. Okay, we got a lot to bloody take with us tomorrow. And we've got to be careful for air activity as well. That's not going to be good if we get that, is it? Okay, but it's 11 o'clock. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. We'll check the air activity. And if we're all good we'll push up to our new base we'll uh, see you in the morning okay day 97 it's 8 a.m we will wait a little bit just to see what the uh radio is saying okay so it's coming on any minute now all right here we go here we go what we got what we got okay air activity what are you saying we got you didn't even get a buzz or anything like that okay well i'm going to assume that's uh an okay well anyway goodbye construction site we're on to bigger and better things probably take the propane tank as well yeah we're so overweight but oh and we got to get the fish all right let's go we gotta hope we don't run into any zombies up there okay we are at the temporary base let's see if we can build the fire let's just get that down out of our inventory yep right let's get inside drop this fish off and everything like that well we made it we made it let's put the water dispenser in here oh yeah we need to get the tent off of our bike as well we may as well chuck all the fish down here okay tent storage uninstall yep we'll have that and then fish down there as well as the paper lovely stuff okay we'll pop the tent down here look at that ah oh, lovely lovely yeah we probably didn't need to bring the water dispenser up but oh well okay i think what we do is we have ourselves a little feast yeah we are getting low on the cows so let's put in a let's put a big sunfish in there actually we'll put a big trout in as well we could actually we could even use the oven that's an oh let's let's get the power going and let's use the fridge and put our fish in the fridge why not right we've got our fish let's eat that let's eat the big sunfish as well uh, do we go do we set the generator off probably not a good idea is it? i mean this fish is going to be gone fairly soon we're gonna to have to put someone else on there to uh so our calories on we aren't pumping yet you know what let's just put it all on to hell with it right well, let's go and have a little look around the area see if we've got any zombies around <laughs> Okay, we are gaining calories again. That's good. Okay, so I have barricaded some windows downstairs that were smashed just for extra security. Well, here we are, our new base on day 97. Wow. I feel we're going to get air activity tomorrow. Okay, but it's 11 o'clock. We're going to go to bed in the new base here tomorrow. Mm, I'm not too sure. We are close to that 100-day goal, so I might not do anything too crazy. But we'll have to see. We'll have to see. But, well, we'll see in the morning. Okay. Day 98. We are so close to 100 days. Wow. It's actually crazy how far we've come. We've definitely, you know, we've definitely come from rags to riches, I would say. We did get a nice little boost with the fishing and the foraging, but not really. I mean, maintenance is nice having that XP boost. Short blunt, we haven't really done anything with. All right, let's eat some fish. Uh, so I do want to wait for air activity today before we decide what we are going to do. Batteries are getting low on the radio as well. All right, let's see, let's see. Okay, rain, blah, 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 blah. Oh, what else we got? Any air activity? No, didn't look like it. All right, well, let's push up a little bit into Blackwood. We've eaten all our fish, but that's fine because we could do with gaining the calories. 
So maybe, I know there is like a little police station slash armory in Blackwood. So maybe we have a little play around with firearms if we can get into there. Because we may need firearms to take on pit stop, you know. Now I finally remember what the other town is. It's Grapeseed, I think. Oh yes, I'm going to get a little bit busy. So we're probably coming up to Blackwood. Oh, the axe is on its way out. That's fine. No, we got anything to repair it with? No, we do have wood glue in the um, in the bike, though. Oh, do we take the shotgun? No, no, no. Okay, so I think Blackwood is actually up, up here. You can get to it through this little road here and come in around the back. Yeah, look, here it is. Here it is, the first bit of Blackwood. All right, so we got our first little uh, little location in Blackwood. It looks a bit busy around here, to be honest. We will loot this house. Why not? Let's give it a shout. Let's bring them to us. Come on, you bastards. Oh, okay. Well, that's them dealt with. Yeah, this weather is not nice, is it? As long as we're not cold, that's fine. I mean, we could always get on this balcony here. All right, we got any good food or anything? Crackers? Yeah, we'll take them. Corned beef? Yeah, we'll eat that now, actually. We got anything, anything worthwhile in the garage here? Doesn't look like it. Uh, electrical? No, we don't need any of that. Ooh, doomsday prep. No, we've already got that. Ooh, what we got here though? Marmalade and peanut butter. Oh, lovely calorie stuff. Yes. Ooh, propane tank. Um, no. Oh, bloody hell, there's a water dispenser in here. This wouldn't have been a bad, bad little base, actually. We will put the propane tank icon here, just to remind us it is there. We could do with a water one, but... Uh, oh, we can do a water bottle. Okay, that'll do, that'll do. Right, I think we uh, we head back, I reckon. Well, do we have a little look up there? Let's have a little look up there. Oh, welcome to Blackwood. Caution, quarantine area. Oh, Jesus Christ. Gotta be nearly getting a level in axe again, haven't we? Where are we at? Ah, uh, we're getting there. Oh, there's such tight corners in here. Look at that. Oh, God. Well, we're not going in there today. Let's head back, I think. We've we've got to Blackwood, so that's a, a result. Okay, we are back home safe and sound. Probably gonna need some food on us, aren't we? Uh, we got the peanut butter. Ah, oh, no, let's take, let's take that, because we will eat that get our calories up okay so it is 11 o'clock well 10 past 11 now we're gonna go to bed tomorrow i'm not too sure hey you bastard i'm trying to go to sleep here hey 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 jesus christ as i was saying we're gonna go to bed it's now bloody 20 past 11 we're gonna go to bed tomorrow oh let's close that door tomorrow i'm not sure but uh we'll we'll figure something out we'll see in the morning okay day 99 wow hmm okay Okay, what we're going to do, we're going to have some food. We're going to check our activity as well. Let's see, see at four for this, just to maximize the calorie gainage. All right, how are we looking? How are we bloody looking? I don't really care about the temperature. I want to know if we got helicopter. Period of weather predicted starting the afternoon. Light to moderate rain. That's not a problem. Bzz, 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 bzz. Oh, 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 air activity. Right, okay, 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 okay. We got food. We got water. Let's, let's, let's. Let's go to where we was before. Let's get the hell out of this area anyway, because I don't want all the bloody Blackwood coming to us. All right, so we're at this little place near our old little base. All right, let's get over to try and get to our portaloo again. Okay, so we've actually made it to the portaloo before before the bloody helicopter comes. Let's see if we can get some berries from these bushes or anything. No, okay. Can we pick this up? No. Okay. Worth a try. Right, let's just hide in the portaloo. Don't mind us. Okay, so we got the helicopter. It's above us. It's barely 20 past 5, but hopefully it'll just do the flyover. Still above us. Well, it's flying around. It hasn't spotted us, I don't think. Okay, so it's finally gone. It's 10 to 10. It's not ideal. Let's uh, let's get back to the bike. Jesus. Well, we got back to the bike, but it's 20 to 12. Okay, we have made it home. We're very tired. We're just going to get inside. Let's actually sneak inside because we don't want to draw any zombies because we're a little bit too tired. Okay, we're going to go straight to sleep tomorrow. Whew, day 100. We'll see you then. Okay, day 100. Wow. Oh, I can't believe it. We finally got here. It's actually amazing. we got a few things to do, of course. We do always survive until the 101st day, so that we have day survived is 100. We're not just on the 100th day. But I did want to repair this axe a little bit, didn't I? And I repaired that zombie's face with the axe. Can I repair the tires with glue? I cannot remember. Might be worth doing, actually. But let's see if we've attracted any more zombies. Deal with these bastards over in the field here. 
Okay, looking good. Weight is at 81 and rising. That is all good. It's a shame we don't have any bourbon or anything to, uh, you know, celebrate with. We will celebrate with some, uh, some sage, though. Oh, we set off fish in here. We don't really need the calories, but I don't want it to go to waste. Okay, but it is 20 to 11 on day 100. We're going to get a bed, and tomorrow we'll, uh, well, we'll have survived 100 days as a nomad biker. Amazing, amazing stuff. Well, let's get a bed, and uh, let's do it. Well, there we go. Day 101. We haven't quite survived it. We need to survive three more hours. And then it will be 100 days. And there we go. We have survived three months, 10 days. There's 30 days in a PZ month. So that's 3, 6, 9, 10, 100 days. Wow. Wow. We have done it. It's been a hell of a lot of fun, this one. Let's have a quick go over our skills and everything. All building nicely. I mean, mechanics and at level, metalworking is electrical not so much axe is getting there you know foraging we're going to get there as well what are our kills 2749 we've lost our bad traits we've gained desensitized what have we killed the most with long bl no not long blunt surely axe yeah there you go splitting axe fire axe yeah this has been a hell of a lot of fun 82 weight as well now this is going to turn into so this is the end of this 100 day series we will be carrying on Barry Bixon's journey to survive 200 days. So that will be coming out shortly. We've got all the modern towns to look at. Maybe even Riverside up here. We haven't done West Point. We've got a lot to do. We've got a lot to do. But we're in a bloody good position to do it. But yeah, it's been a hell of a lot of fun this one. Thank you for watching. Really do appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. Just want to say a massive thank you to all of our channel members. But a Big shout out to everyone on the Shambler tier, John Smith, Escape Artist, Rob Jones, 309 Basehead, McDaddy Too Cool and Akuna Whiskey. Thanks guys, really do appreciate it.